welcome to the game. Welcome to Valley's Presents Live at the Bike, the world's longest running high stakes poker series. My name is Yale Greenfield. You can find me on YouTube at Live King Poker. Today joining me in the commentary booth is a very, very special guest, the incomparable Will Jaffe at Dankness3 on Twitter. What's up, Will? You ready for a little bit of this Robbie and Phil action today? I'm ready, Yale, and I only have one question for you. Were you named after the college? <laughs> You know, that's that's easy. You're going after me for the name. That's a common one, Will, but uh, shockingly, I wasn't, and I never made it anything close to Ivy League. Well, congratulations. You still made it farther than me. Should be an exciting day. A lot of bad blood here, a lot of revenge, a lot of narratives, um, and it's Valentine's Day. What better day to make things red? Absolutely. Yeah, but that's my strategy. Yeah, I know. Always works. You're a little too tight with a big snack. They might let you go back. Oh, it was not tight yesterday. <laughs> Just to keep things a little bit I more I think you'll be invited. Well, if she watched the first four or five hours, three hours, I'd look tight. If you watch the last two hours, I don't look so tight. Yeah. I just saw, yeah, I forwarded her to the final score. And this is the first hand? Game on, ladies. Are we in? Are we yeah, doing? We're in. You guys know I folded ace-king yesterday, right? I saw that. I saw that. That was a, All right, I'm going to straddle, first of all. OK, OK. Because when Shamath yeah. opened, I looked over and I could see JR was super strong. So I, I smooth called. And when he made it 7K, I'm like, he has a really big hand. But I was a little bit off. <laughs> if I thought 10s, I could just move in and just win. But There were like five callers. It was on him. <laughs> I saw that, and then yeah. the, the whole camera, uh, like, cool. looking at the camera and letting them know that you knew what you were doing. <laughs> Weren't you on the button or some crazy <laughs> shit like that, too? I think he was on the button. He had position on everybody. Uh, uh, Wait, was he, no, was I he don't right? think you had. He was wrong? No, he was wrong. He was wrong. <laughs> he I mean, I was right. He had tens, but. Yeah. Yeah. In, a nor in a normal game, he would have been right. Yeah, he was anticipating the commentary. So Phil's got middle pair right out the gate. Yeah. <laughs> He's going to yeah, want a small one. He had a yeah, pretty tough day that. yesterday, I, I, Will. I on him for that. Said it was his biggest <laughs> loss so ever in a cash game. Because you dumbasses yeah, um, as a cameraman right there. Things didn't go too well for him. <laughs> uh, well, that was Friedberg. So he's yeah. never filmed. He's never been on screen before. He, uh, had yeah. King High. And, uh, and, and he, he was trying to find a way to make Called the bet on the flop. Um, but it was a little bit rough. Called, uh, so I, was like, you just I don't even know what happened, but he ended up calling on the river and it looked like he had misread his Yeah, hand. I mean, like, um, you know, I mean, like, if, and then I saw like he's not the guy that dances on the grave. King he didn't want to dance on the grave. I don't, yeah. I don't remember. Yeah. Shamath yeah. can but, dance um, on the grave. Not his best showing. I'm interested like, to see how he comes back today in this lineup. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get the nitty tight fill or we're going to get aggressive fill today. Could be either. I have a feeling we're going to see a lot of his old tricks, a lot of limping. Uh, a lot of quick flop raises, and um, yeah, just uh, we'll, we'll see what he brings today. 333 now. Oh. Yanks three bet the king queen suited. Because then I, uh, Eric Hicks calling with pocket jacks. Then I made jacks. with jack eight offsuit. So. <laughs> and six seven, I made a twenty thousand after folding ace king. I mean, they had to be like, what is Phil half. doing? I saw this ace king in a, in a clip. And then I saw like a, a yeah. ace ten ball. Some people were surprised with that one too. It's all right. Tonight's your night, so we'll let you have. We'll let you have a hand or two. <laughs> Yang started with a flop bet. 20, I was up like twenty three early, and I'm like. I'm filming seven days or something in the next Sorry, guys, yeah. we're having some like, technical right, difficulties in the booth. we got to get it sorted out. Yeah, but, uh, like, and they dumped me kings versus queens. Should be queens smooth, soon. Hit a queen. Oh, I saw that. I, I lost that. minimum. Yeah. My first live stream, so guys. I was so annoyed because I'm supposed to be at 80 yeah. right away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, so I, saw that. I saw that one. I had him so trapped, he just had no. Clue. And it was a You're a trapper. Turn, too. Yeah. turn to queen, Brutal. check. I snap checked behind him. I told myself if he bets over 20, he has queens full. But I can't get away. He has. And you're still playing kings. There's one hand where you're like, you know how tight I play? And it was like a tight fold that you had. I don't know what it was. Yang staying with the $6,500 bet. Bluffing on this ace, no doubt, trying to move Eric. Wow, he gets it through. Eric, All right, guys, I have a really fire jacket there. Awesome. Here's some hobo. Hot sauce. 
Is this is your part of your marketing budget? This is uh, part of the marketing budget. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So wait, we have the so hobo here. So take a shot when what? <laughs> so <laughs> you pass that down. There. So if One you lose, swig. so if you lose like thirty thousand a day, you, you can just write it off as marketing. That's budget. right. And then that's for you, Michael. And if you, you win like thirty thousand, you're like getting paid to market. Exactly. Hobo. Okay. Exactly. Now I just better win. Okay. Because getting paid to market is the best. Straddle. Straddle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hold. 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 Yes. What are you trying to play like Alan Keating? 100% Viva. Yang's got big slick. I think he came down to like 99. 1600, yes. And then full pull. Pardon me, pardon me. Um, <laughs> yeah, he played. He played every single hand except like one or something. So then I got down to like. <laughs> he played like. Six well, you. So Keating asked the producer. He said, "If I leave to go get something." Yeah. Does it count against my VPIP? Oh my and god! And they said oh, yes. So he ran over and ran back because he wanted. He wanted. And yeah, he missed one hand, right? <laughs> yeah. I, think he, I think he ended up missing a hand, but he's not due to his lack of sprinting. <laughs> he likes it. Yang getting involved for the third hand in a row. To keep hundred VPIP, yeah. that would be. That would be production worthy. All you do is ask. We would have done. Yeah, yeah. Got to give sure. you bathroom breaks for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, I don't uh, think anybody's ever had 100% VPIP on any televised I mean, game ever. It's absurd. Yeah. He was close. I yeah. think he, he finished at 98. Yeah, yeah. But the only thing, I, I think the only a few hands that he folded that, Did he fold it all? Right yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. Um, that, that he wasn't on break? Did he? I don't know. I mean, I, I, lost, uh, I lost some clashes with him. Um, and that can be your whole night. Do you know, he was hitting a lot of hands, though. I mean, for somebody playing all his, it was amazing four, how four. often the car, the cards were. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. Ace, he had an ace, or he had suited, Race, suited three, cards, or he'd have ten. He had three, a lot of playable top pair. Yeah. Like it was absolutely insane. You. you know, like he wasn't exactly card. Five hundred total. Yeah. Uh, sure. Sorry, guys. Yeah, if you look back on the uh, eight, hands, eight, even though he's playing. Yang's percent, got his fourth playable in a row. A lot of great hands. Pocket fours this time. Yeah. It was five hundred. And the like, accountant yeah. will, you'll see. Yeah, he wasn't playing. Gets involved heavily. Cards. He's calling on the button. Yeah. I mean, I think I made a 20K with six, seven of spades, and it came on. Uh, ace, five, seven. I should have just bet the flop. Robbie's getting involved here. He had threes. With a blind hand. And I hand. turned to six. Could be jack four. For some stupid reason, so I checked again behind him. And a four came. Oh, no. So now the board is four, five, six, seven, ace. He bet 50,000. I said, if you're dumb enough to check, you're not dumb enough to pay this off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he had it somehow. But those gets it gets annoying, you know. <laughs> but you can blame I can blame yeah, myself yeah. if I just got the So ball Robbie has a mystery hand know. here. We have no idea what she's got. Al whiffed, and Yang's got fours. Yep. Seems unlikely Robbie has Jack Four, just considering the blockers out there, but um Check it's possible. Out. Jack four hearts. Jack four off. Al picks up some equity. I think, uh, think we're going to see a bet from Al here. I'm just really curious what Robbie has. Seems interested. Call. Yang with a gutter. Not going to peel. And Al Rivers, his backdoor flush. We're going to see a big, healthy bet here. And uh, Robbie might just have the jack four clubs here. That would be sick. <laughs> got a little jack of clubs on board. Maybe maybe, she's, maybe she's just going to rip it out. I feel like she's got clubs. A small bet from Al. I think Robbie's going to pop this. She's got a feeling. She looks interested. I call. Oh, Man. My reads are off. I said I was going to do no strategy, but um, Robbie, uh, it looks like Robbie had ace-king. Wow, ace-king off. Oh, she played it slow, kind of trapped herself <laughs> there. Uh, 
Wow. Just did not expect to see that. I'm thinking Jack 4. Jack 4 may be suited. No. Highly reasonable read. But not a good one in this case. No. Um, and I said I wasn't going to do any strategy. This is really, if you like strategy, you're in the wrong place because uh, I don't really play poker anymore other than PLO. And uh, my boy not is a vlogger. Me. He learned hmm? what back raise meant a week ago. Uh, so. nine, <laughs> nine. Yeah, certainly no vloggers can play poker. So if you don't want to watch somebody it. play good poker, <laughs> Check out Live King Poker on YouTube, <laughs> right? Uh oh. It's like, oh, this could be good. Oh, yeah, it's good. Let's go. Thought I had you, so. You were right. Hold on. Trying to do the fill, like, call down move, you know? Call me. Now I know how you play, buddy. 500. Nice, nice three bet, three flop with that shit. It's pretty hand. Right? Yeah. It's pretty hand, right, Phil? Are you? Uh, so you're you're from Sydney? <coughs> I'm from Sydney, yeah. Ah, I remember. We've only played once. Yeah. I remember. That's a good look at Robbie right there, the most controversial woman in poker. Bought him for 100000 today. Yeah. Very, very strong buy-in. Uh, so you're going back to Sydney tomorrow? Uh, no, I'm going back this week. I'm not going back. I'm going um, back to, I'm going to Thailand. And then you like it there that much, huh? I mean, it's pretty good. Thailand's nice. Yeah. Oh, Don't. Yeah, Al. Nice little start here. Get a little momentum. So you kind of stayed. You kind of stayed in town. You basically, you stayed around just to play this game. Don't forget no, to Thailand, head over to ballyplaycom to play this game. You've got about People travel for 45 stuff. minutes left. Yeah. Phil, I love it. I play for a chance to win some live at the says, bike swag. Phil Hong is on the stream. Oh, that sounds like a good experience. Oh, Ballyplay.com okay. slash LATB. He came here for you. I came here for you. You, you came here for me or Robbie? <laughs> he came here to have me on his left. Three <laughs> raised. <laughs> Yes, All right, so Robbie playing a little tight, but I mean that was a no, that was a big raise. Here goes the accountant. It's tax season. Yeah, once, twice. Uh, up to you. Let's go that shove equity. Let's go twice. Fine. Is there anybody that only goes once at the table? I usually only go once. They don't, um, what do you mean usually? <laughs> Somebody <laughs> asked me, hey, I'd really like to go twice. I'll go twice. Copy that. We've got twice used to, we've got used to going twice. It's more twice. exciting to go uh, twice. Go on the twice. app, and a lot of a lot of times we play Copy twice, that. but whatever. I have ace. As the pro. Nice. If you want to go twice, I'll go twice with you. You have what? The accountant, apparently with sharp tops. That's the pro. If someone says twice, I always say yes. Yeah, yeah. He hasn't shown, but he's announced aces, I believe. You? Me? Nope. No. That's a nasty pick. cooler. No improvement to ace king on board one. I got no idea what the accountant's got, and I'm, I'm not really sure how he got that nickname either. It looks like he might be doing some accounting for the Sons of Anarchy, but not the typical kind we see from the IRS. Yep, Count it has. There's the reveal. First blood struck in this 100 200 game. Mega cooler. And the accountant's a guy who gives a ton of action. He wouldn't be shy about a will, so. Yeah, that's 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 a nasty spot for Aussie Al. Tough spot for Aussie. Eight, nine, Luckily, suited. it was only a flesh wound. 20k. I don't always have good day at the park. Eight nine suited. Maybe shouldn't straddle. There's a couple straight draws. Phil, you can't you can't take off the straddle now. <laughs> I don't know, Al. After you lost that pot, I'm expecting a big raise from you. So, <laughs> but maybe I can handle it. So yeah, apologies Actually, again, guys. Tilted. You won the hand. Yeah, yeah I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm breaking even. I, how can I be tilted? I'm gonna do a better job as we go forward, but just kind of getting, getting, 
getting the ropes here, figuring out the booth. It's not Twitter with a camera, you know. It's a lot of stuff going on, a lot of bright lights back here, but uh, we'll figure this out. Turn this around. Yeah, but you're ready for the bright lights. You're looking good today. Thank you. Thank you, Yale. Appreciate that. Oh, see Al getting another hand here. And Hicks with a three bet with the 6 5 suited. This has to be GTO. California versus Sydney. Oh, wait, LA versus Sydney. LA hosts. Both have hosted Olympics. Rough flop for Hicks yeah, here, I'm but. Uh, F out of here. I'm running my condo during the Olympics. I mean, you must have a good hand. You, you, you know I wasn't going to fall. Wow. <laughs> Al gets Al Vegas with the nut full -time. Full -time. flush blocker to lay it down. I've never lived in Vegas. Phil, where do you live? Eric came Al to play. Alter. Look at the man. Oh, no. He's here to gamble. That's, right, yeah, that's a setup. That Owner of right? Luna Cycles, Hello. which I think is a very successful e bike company. <laughs> you know what? You ever ride an e bike? I, you know, I actually <laughs> only own a few Luna Cycles, <laughs> but uh, I haven't used one in a while. So, uh, yeah, yeah, great product. That's a lot of fun. Incredible <laughs> inventor. <laughs> and uh, he's a player. Yeah, they call him the mad genius. Oh, I see. At a university, like when you graduate medical school, you match and it's a legally binding contract. And so her number one choice was somewhere up north. What do you mean by you, you match? It's called a match. So when you finish medical school, you put yeah. your name in a system. Oh, okay. And they rank who they want. The hospitals? The hospitals rank okay. who they want. And then it's a binding contract. So well, you have to work there. You have to go there, yeah. Oh, okay. So she matched at the university up north. Her second choice was USA Harbor. Hey, you don't get a choice. Do you, you get preferences? You put your name in the system, name in the system, they throw it into a computer, and it spits out. out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You rank it by preference, right? And so she, uh, her first choice, I don't want to say the name of the university because she's so sensitive. Um, <coughs> Stanford? <laughs> Something good, your daughter? Something well, some, in Palo Alto? Some, some, some university up there. <laughs> Not too many schools in Palo Alto. <laughs> she could have gone to Harvard. Uh, Stanford City College? We were never going to Harvard because her second choice was UCLA Harbor. And then I would have lived in L.A., which was this kind of a center for poker. Oh, that's where we are now. Yeah, yeah. I think <laughs> Phil is saying that uh, Harvard wasn't good enough for his daughter. I'm not sure, but maybe Yale. Maybe Yale. Yeah. You're always flying. That, that would, def that would I, definitely I stick. Mean, I could see that. Home. Phil, time to I was home almost three months straight. Uh, C3 race. Ooh, almost three months money. straight. That's what cool. Time yeah. to buy a plane. Yeah. Till December. Are they? I think so. I know the five will. I still fly I southwest, so. but, back to you. I but I was on my friend's plane yesterday. I'm on my friend's JD plane. JD here with Ace King the best off, and the accountant's got my friend's plane seven Saturday. suited. Somebody else is playing Monday. Calls I was invited to the yesterday. That's good. But southwest. Check. 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 I was going to buy a plane, and then I was doing a lot of, um, we're doing a lot of work for, um, for Phil, climate stuff. Phil's mm -hmm. going to buy a plane, but he was doing too and much thought, climate wow, change work. So <laughs> makes a lot of that's sense, gonna, actually. Highly good. linear thought process yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't, you can't, hey, raise, you, you can't <laughs> raise millions for climate and then be on a private jet. I don't think. Of course they can. The, they flew, everybody flew to like Davos or something to have a climate summit. They all flew in their private <laughs> jets over there, talked about how everybody should stop polluting. And then everybody went home. I mean, <laughs> yeah. So I think that was the. Looks like the accounts also. A word. It begins with H. Climate and activist. I think the second word apparently. is Y. Yeah, no, I. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. World politics expert. My, my point is, you know that word? Accountant. Yes, my high stakes point poker is, player. Right in. Hypocrisy. <laughs> Hypocrite, some people might say. A man of many talents. Uh, hypocrites, yes. And you know, I, and then also for me, partly having a private just part a little bit about ego, too. Maybe just a tad. <laughs> you don't say, <laughs> Phil. <laughs> Why would I ever raise a talent? I'm not falling for that. Phil finally going to get involved. I wanted you to raise. This appears to be a limp from the button. <laughs> gave me the speech, the you gave me the We're speech and everything. Me. I'm learning. Phil's using an interesting Sorry. strategy here. But it actually um, harmed me. I'm not really sure what he's doing, but Aussie oh. Al's flopped a two-piece. Oh. Sets the trap for Phil. Oh, no, sorry. The, what's going on here? I would expect nothing less from you. I can't really follow the graphic, but... um. Phil. Oh. Come on. Yeah, sorry. Oh my god. You gotta be right. I actually yeah. had it. I actually had it. I can get handled. Oh though. shit. I had a big ace suited. Big ace suited. But I can't get rid of the jack three. No, you can't. No. no. <laughs> 
There's a small one? It's not going anywhere. <coughs> this guy to my right. I'm like rubbing You guys want to do a rounder straddle? But... No. No? Straddle if you want. Don't if you don't. I mean, whatever. We can do a round of straddles. But the point is, I'm going to probably straddle anyway. And... Yeah, it's, it's like really cold it's in this really room. Or like, cold. if they turn it off, it's like really hot. There's like no, there's nothing in between. I'll straddle this. Huh? I'll straddle this. Sorry, guys. The graphics were a little off. I'm, I'm still getting a feel around. for this. A lot of bright lights back here, a lot of technology, yeah. but um, you're right, Eric. Straddle around. We're gonna get a hang of this. We're gonna get in the flow. And we'll um, start yeah. limping on the button. You play your yeah. game, okay? Yeah. I didn't limp. I called this button. Twenty-five. Phil came oh, to talk he? today. He's struggling. Yeah, he's always no, struggling. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. She, she has uh, an the act, the action's here, Eric. Oh, I can't see her car. So but now I'm folding. Yeah, twenty-five. She folded. Twenty-five hundred. You saved two hundred. <laughs> I know, actually. Mad genius making it 25 with a mystery hand. He's going to take it down. I don't You're know right what he's Aaron. got, but this guy came to play. Yeah, he only really likes the, the highest stakes games anymore. So he go, I don't blame him. Yeah. He goes to Vegas, plays No Gamble, No Future, occasionally joins us here for the biggest and best. That's what he likes. He's a man of high taste, high stakes poker. Yeah, I'm not familiar with a lot of these players, but we're going to get to know them. Um, some some groovy looking dudes out there. Welcome back to Stream Poker. Thank you. Thanks. Here comes the accountant. He, he came to collect today. They're doing this like every day. Call. Every day. We're going to see in the tournament call. scene? Just call, huh? 17. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Action. Yeah. There's no way to like purchase. I'd like to see Robbie get involved, but I don't. She, she's definitely taking a more passive approach so far. Eight four suited, maybe appeal. Snap. Alright, so we got a little action here. Phil with the sevens. Okay, so Phil gonna take a quick lead. I think the pros call this an information bet. Accountant's got Ace King with the Ace of Hearts. He's not going anywhere. Look at this guy. Game to play. Oh my God! Is the count going to lay this down? Not re-raising me pre-flop. What? I think he's going to lay it down. Al's not going anywhere. He's loving life here. Overs against Nasty Helmy Fleet. Check. Phil's going to go into check call mode. Does Al want to try to blast him off whatever he's got? Al yeah, just checked back. Ooh, and that's going to sting for Phil. Phil with an assy lead. Can, the, can Al sniff this out? I think Al's going to sniff this out. That's too small. Got it. Got to Got to make him pay, and doesn't look like Al has anything either. If he comes with a little 15 ball here, he's gonna get he's gonna get filled real tilted real quickly. 16. 16. Raise. 16, oh man, if uh, if Phil pays this off, we're gonna have a game. He's going to be real tilted to start the session, and uh, I think he might because it's kind of tough to put Al on anything. Checks back the turn in position. And what's this guy got? Phil bet small, too, so he kind of looks weak. Yep, there's the payoff. Yeah, he didn't. I'm running. Good. <laughs> fucking kidding me. Mm. I'm telling you, we're gonna have a game now. Yeah, That's the one guy I know who's gonna give me like a hundred <laughs> for no reason. <laughs> I, can't help, I can't help it if I hit. <laughs> Great race. Oh, you, you have the hearts too. Yeah, yeah I, 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 I had the hearts. I'm aware of what he had. <laughs> yeah. What a race, though. Especially against me. But. 
I will punish that it's one today. Pick. You're gonna, it's I know you're going to make one race today. Pick. You're going to make one race today, and you're going to be mad at yourself. Am, am I not supposed to? Is is my hand not a good hand? That was a good hand. Know. Of course, it's uh, a good hand. Top pick. Hand up the river. And you made it the best way possible. If you made the flush, overs? it would have been obvious. Yeah, 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 yeah. nothing yeah, yeah. if you hit a heart. And you backdoored it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I backdoored both hands. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I and I watched you give away a hundred thousand the last time with heads. Even though you got Look, lucky against I, I was, me. I was, wow. that, all right, you got to give me some, I was down 100K oh, that day. And you were giving I, it away, I, I, and then I, I had you trapped with the nuts straight, check calling you. And you be happy that set. I broke even. Be happy that I broke even that game. I was very happy I broke even. Uh, how, about the one, how about the game where you printed 500K? Oh, that was a good game. Uh, <laughs> but that was a sick game. You didn't hold Will, back. I think they down brought us a bottle of vodka back here. And every Alice time I, Will I was, says trap, was, yeah, you got to take a shot, away. and then I got to take a shot. Or did you give it all back after the lights? Uh, all right. Sounds no, good. they stopped playing. Uh, they, yeah. I will beat Alice in big pots. It's going to be a fun game. I mean, I, that, the, the one really big pot that I had that day was the pocket twos. It, that was like... I was just sick of losing the stand-up game, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, the pocket yeah. twos were clutch. Uh, just, clutch. I'm, I'm just, I'm all in. <laughs> and and you, had a, you had a big fold. Somebody folded, I think. Uh, um, you had like... Somebody trapped me, actually. They had ace-king. Uh, I wasn't expecting. The film no, one of the hands, doesn't seem too somebody, tilted, they but uh, a better hand to you. I don't know. After last night's session, I'm wondering if he's going to start oh, steaming soon or if he's going to no, play cool. No. You have maybe, like some, maybe needs to lose another one to really get really set off. Oh, yeah, it could be classic Phil Hellmuth so if he loses another big one. He did do the, you should have given me $100,000 last huh. time, a that whole speech, which is just vintage Phil if you've ever watched the edited work that's been done on him. I like, I like, I was playing kind of tight, and then they thought that I was like really snug. And then it they just seemed to work that way. It was really <laughs> hot in the beginning. Yeah, and yeah. What happened? Timing matters. I'm just, I mean, I'm going to be snap calling Al all night, so it's a shame. I, I won't be bluffing you, Phil. <laughs> yeah, Al's just laying out a strategy. Yeah. He's looking for go. value. Oh, they, I'm just going to get there. I, yeah. He's a river. No, I'm a river drawing, expert. I'm going to have you drawing dead in a big pot. I'm a river expert. Really interesting flop. Everybody gets hit here. Eric's got to be feeling good with the overpair. Yang's not going anywhere, and Al's got a beautiful open ender. Yeah, an interesting spot here, Will, for Eric as the three better. He's got that overpair, but against two ranges, could be in trouble sometimes. Again, we're not going to go too deep into the strategy, guys, Call but um, this is a spot where all players are going to want to put more money in. And person, he was I wonder if Al will think about a raise here. Nick Airball was picking him off. Yeah. Gotta switch it up. People see your patterns. 21. Raise. 21,000. I like this bet a lot. Puts a lot of pressure on these guys. But he's gonna get called in at least one spot, because I mean, this is a great flop for both Eric and Yang's hand. But it's not a happy spot if you're the mad genius here. I gotta figure out where he got that jacket from. Mad genius calls, and Yang's just gotta be thinking, my my tens, what are they good? They are good, but he can't Aww. know that. Kind of a gross spot for him. He folds. Heads up. I got a pot, ladies and gentlemen. I was going to need to hit or keep betting to win this one. And that's a brick. It's a pretty awful card for Al. Is he going to try to keep repping a hand, or is he going to pump the brakes here? It's, I mean, it just looks like Eric has what he has, except it kind of looks like he has even stronger. 20, 000. But Al's not going to stop. He did just announce he wasn't going to bluff Helmuth, but I guess the same isn't true for Eric. I can't see Eric folding at this point to this size. No chance. I mean, that jacket has to cost more than 20. He makes the call. Al's really going to need a hit here. I'm kind of interested to see what he does on the river. Yeah, 
Is he gonna bluff this? Oh man. Decision time for Al. It's gotta be for all of it if he does. I think you got it. You gotta just rip it here with the pot size. You're hoping he folds it, makes a miracle fold with an overpair, and you can't give him a good price. Yeah, hard to not want to bluff five high. Check. He gives up. Eric's gonna be happy to take this one down. Can't imagine he would try to go for value here, but uh, then again, what do I know? He might be thinking about getting a little slice here. <laughs> yeah, 70. Open now has a seven that he got frisky with. Chatty table. I'm, well, I'm trying to get the right No, I know. It is funny. We haven't heard a lot from Robbie today. So bad. <laughs> she has been very quiet. Typically a highly entertaining figure. Yeah, I think I think as the day goes on, she'll probably heat up a little bit. Maybe she's just getting familiar. And wow, Eric is going to go for some value. This man hmm. is a player. Hoo wee! Nice hand, nice hand Eric. Thanks. If you're just joining us, 30 minutes down in the stream, Bally presents live at the bike, the world's longest running high stakes poker series. Uh, uh, 100, yeah, 200, no limit, $200 sure big buy in Annie. Yale not, Greenfield not and Will Jaffe are your water, commentators. Don't forget to head over uh, to play the Bally Predictor game. You only have 30 uh, minutes left. Ballyplay.com slash LATB for your chance to win some live at the bike swag. We're just getting comfortable in here. Robbie Jade Lou in the mix for the first time since the infamous J4 hand. And we want to thank you so much for joining us. Still learning the ropes here, guys, but um, we're getting there. Yeah, the chat wants to know why you aren't uh, why you aren't talking to them, Will. They want to hear from you. Sorry, I don't I don't even have the chat on screen. We've just been trying to figure out how to do the, the hands and stuff to start out. But uh, don't worry, chat. Dude, he's got his own hand, the, qu the queen four. That's the Phil Helmuth. Is that the Phil Helmuth? Yeah, from the fox in hand. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, he definitely wants to play. It's TV. It's his hand. If you're Phil, you gotta like this flop. You play the queen four. Doesn't get much better than this. I love the pace that he plays at, Will. The speed. It's, he's, he's the anti-euro. And it's it was a min raise, and Phil's doing this a lot. He's he's throwing these feeler raises around. Min raise, Phil? <laughs> What's up with that? <laughs> Accountant sniffs it out. He bombed before the flop. On the <coughs> Two of the chattiest players I've ever seen in live stream poker hitting this turn. Check. Check. The accountant kind of smashes this turn and checks back, but I think this one might just go check, check. Is the accountant going to put out a bluff? I hey, check. He's going to leave full off the hook there. You got it. It's a nice little momentum builder for Phil. Go, Phil. Robbie cheering on Phil a little bit. She's a Phil fan. Fuck, I missed the 3K value bet. And he can make it 15 and I could snap again. All right, guys, let's start playing. Come on, Phil, we expect Queen a little four, more out of you, man. became famous for briefly. The Queen 4, what the Phil about? What's that story? It was like in a... Is that a bad card? Yeah, we're going to swap it. Okay. It didn't scan. Uh, yeah, I had queen four and a fox and race. There were four of us mm -hmm. or five of us. Mm -hmm. He raises every pot, so I re race right, with queen four. And he moved in. And I called it off. The math was like one or two percent off. Everybody was talking about what a horrendous call. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he had nines, but you look at the math and like, I have to call. Uh, but I never said anything. Everybody just said, it's the worst hand Phil's ever played. And I'm looking at the math saying, but I like that. Like, what was the thought? I never defended myself. He had two nines and I made three queens. Oh shit! He put a, he, he put an ugly beat on me with Jack Eight versus Ace Jack. But he knows that. The great players know. And then I had and then I had Ace King against Ace Jack for. So what is it? Do you have to keep playing? Well, you played it again. You can call it the Helmuth. Jack. I'm happy with around. I'm happy with two black nines being my hand. Check. 
So yeah, guys, we're, we're going to get the chat going. You know, I didn't forget about you guys. Not, for, not forgetting where we came from. Um, but uh, right now, I'm still learning the ropes of the booth. You know, again, a lot of technology in here. A lot of, uh, a lot of big buttons. Some wires. Um, TV. And... Uh, Do you have a pair, Eric? Is that hand? Yeah. High pair? Over pair. High pair, all right. I don't think I could get you Over forward. Nah, no. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I don't think my five high was. <laughs> like, what did you get? <laughs> I don't think my five high was gonna get anything to fold uh, there. I thought you had uh, a seven, maybe. Uh, yeah, Al with a good check there. Eric was definitely not folding if he was value betting the river. I was like, he's never gonna believe me. <laughs> like, what was that? Diana, nobody had. Six thousand. Three way from six to six thousand. Fold, fold. Wow, and Phil's getting spicy here. Seven deuce. He's feeling it after the queen four. Is Yang going to defend? I think, I think he's going to want to... Oh, my God. Oh. Phil is going to... Wait, they're not even playing seven deuce? <laughs> Did Phil just make the position raise without the seven deuce game on? Or? Wow. That was, that was really strong. Um... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on, honestly. Sorry, guys. Again, it's my first time ever doing commentary. Um, and, uh, you know, it's a, it's going to be a learning curve. But um, I think we're going to get there. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm kind of surprised to see Robbie just sort of sitting back. She feels like she's feeling out the table, you know, not really getting involved. I'm, I'm wondering when we're going to see her in a hand. This could be it. Me and you. Seven deuce. Are they playing the seven deuce game? No, they're not because she's folding. So Phil just literally. The only hand I can. Seven deuce. <laughs> Maybe the graphics were wrong. I don't know what happened there, but Phil apparently went for the seven deuce three bet on the button. Without the game being, the worst being on. <laughs> like by far. <laughs> worst hand and hold them. Not Hoffa. even worthy of anything. I hope you guys are having a good Valentine's Day out there. Um, fold, shout out to my wife. Fold, fold. Love of my life. Um, and yeah, if you guys have partners, do something. Get flowers. Go out to dinner, you know, obviously after the stream. Um, but, uh. Alright, so Robbie's finally got a hand here. Looks like it's gonna get through. She's got the hooks. I don't know the hauls in the hands I got. You got it? Huh? We're just warming up here. I think we're going to see some fireworks. Oh, you know. Yeah, Bruce here. Oh, okay. He's, He's not, not much. much. Quiet banter. He's not, no. not much. No yeah, Berkey so far. For dinner. Hopefully Ashley can come. Eight o'clock, right? Eight o'clock. Is it me? I'm the... You're the big one? Cool. 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 This is change? Okay. No, that's you. It's, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right, got it. Nine call. We got Robbie in another hand here. Fold. How much is it? Five hundred. Five. Looks like Al raised. And um, not exactly sure of the action. Robbie's gonna Fold. bet 3K with the sevens and take it down. Two in a row. Yeah, small uh, ones though. For RJL. Creeping up. Robbie RJL. came to play tonight. 
I can feel it. She's got a very serious Seven feel to her. It. Looks like she's been in the lab. So your nickname is the accountant. Is that right? I'm an actual accountant. Oh. You're an actual CPA. You actually got some business that way because I was trying to know which accountants do I know. <laughs> oh yeah, the accountant. That's literally how it happened a couple of weeks ago. That's the best. Do I know any accountants? Oh yeah, the accountant. Exactly. I know the well, accountant. He the accountant. Be, he probably has to be one of the best accountants ever for poker players, right? Yeah, he's like, great. He oh, must yeah. know the law inside and out. Yeah. yeah. So we're raising a business for you. That, we're talking about. He's an actual. Poker is he good or player. does he suck? He's good. He's good. Yeah. Can you scan your card, Jack, please? Yeah. And he's a good accountant. Can you get him centered on the thing? Yeah. <laughs> they got it. Thank you. No, poker-wise, yeah. I, I lack a much better account than I poker player. So you have a business? Yeah, I have a firm. I'm a partner. If you're enjoying this yeah. awesome uh, lineup, it's called promoting. Robbie Jade Lou and Phil Helmuth. The name of the firm. Oh, Show okay. us some love. Hit the like Tell button. It really helps the channel out. Uh, I'm not. Yes, I'm a better account than I am. Uh, you smash that like button, Will. Really? Yeah, if you're out there right now watching this, that's why he doesn't go by it. <laughs> Wait a minute. One guy, one guy brought oh, out the hot sauce. Right? <laughs> I'm wearing this Sorry. and the Aria and all these logos. Shameless advertising. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He can't help himself. Yeah. He's got that Aria hat on. He's got the so Luxon tank. He's got the hot sauce. The man is a walking It's not about in angling for business. Who uh, you, know. well, you want sitting at the table? A doctor, a lawyer, and an accountant. Uh, yeah. Close the shades. You know, I never get to play with doctors. Of all the people I play with, I don't get to play They're with doctors. They're smart. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, not to do this. Looks like yeah. Phil's yeah. in a really yeah. good spot here. Around. They do it. Yeah, yeah. it is interesting. I played with one of my the first got real doctor there with the just kicker. the other day. Right. Just gonna call. That's rare. Right? Yeah, very rare. You get lawyers all the time. Accountants all the time. But yeah. Lawyers. I mean, I, doctors. No. Well, there's, there's, a, there's a really thing. famous poker player, accountant. Uh, who was it? Not a Greg Raymer, the other guy the, that started the whole money uh, money maker. He's an accountant. Oh, money maker's an accountant. Yep. I didn't know that. Uh, well, I feel pretty good. Before good. He, uh, won the World Series and then he stopped <laughs> being an accountant. Oh wow, that's great. His last name's so fitting. It's crazy. Right? So such a good. It's name. such a good last name. To win the World I asked Series. Andy, I was win like, the Andy, World is your Series. Last almost... name real? Andy Stacks. Stacks. He's like no. Yeah. I'm well, like, but money makers is real. Well, what if money maker turned out to be a deadbeat? Feel deep in thought. That's, right. yeah, should I raise? Should I call yeah. with the accountant in his up. ear? <laughs> yeah, he's got the accountant chirping at him. I got finally sells on a raise, yeah. small yeah. size. Yeah, you need to borrow money. I was not first, going anywhere. First Thirty minutes. Looks, this looks <laughs> real like fishy. going broke. He was trying to do Bitcoin transfers and stuff. Yeah. And all of a sudden, he just started doubling up, doubling up. It was he's like good. a World Series of Poker all over again. I've played with him before. He ended up winning like a million bucks. I played with him before. He's good. Cash game. Yeah, it was on one of these big televised games. It was either high stakes poker. Turn the river for us, man. No game. No game. I don't remember. Right. He really, he really, he was the, the biggest winner at the end of the thing. But he took like a break for a while, right? Like, he was kind of gone for a little bit. I don't know. He like disappeared and then came back. Hell, it could have gone either way on that. Check call or no, check raise. Oh, it was no gamble, no future. That's right. That's right. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. You should have. Uh... What'd you have? You know, I, I was telling everybody all my hands, and it kind of backfired on me, so I'm not going to say it. What happened? You scared Burke? I mean, listen, if you're late to the party, just don't show up. Ooh. You know, whoa, to his credit, whoa, whoa. though, he oh. flies Jet X, and you never know what time you're coming in. When you're coming in on JSX. <laughs> that's, true. Yeah. that's true. No, yeah, like, actually like, I, actually, yeah. I fly it too, though, and they're very accurate. But really? They're, they're, they're late, I'd say, uh, three out of four times when I fly them. Or at least, at least an hour late. It's really yeah. random. Like, yeah. I mean, I've Delay and then you just them. sit there and just. So they're talking about Berkey. He was Vegas supposed to be here, but um, pretty, hasn't been yet. Route, like, yeah, de -icing, de -icing the, the plane in Vegas. That's a bad day in Vegas. I, I was doing this thing where I flew in the morning and then flew back at night on the same day. Oh, wow. And then the one time there was a delay, and I was like, oh, God, I can't do that. I got so it's mad at those convenient. guys because the last time they delayed me in Vegas, mm -hmm. so I went out and had some dinner because they said it was an hour and a half late. Came back at the time they said it was late, uh, and, and we missed the plane. Yeah. I go wait. Yeah. If you're gonna delay it and announce the time, <laughs> at least let it. Yeah. You know, like you got to hold to that time, you amateur. Well, um, they have an LAX location and a Burbank location now, so you've got oh, okay. two chances. And um, then on the same flight, when we're coming back, we're supposed to land in LAX. And they landed us in Orange County. And no so way. We got, yeah, and we'll really? Yeah. Are you sure you got on the what? right flight? What's that? You yeah. Sure yeah. 
Dude, they've been like they're wrong. They've been That's blowing like, it lately. Like like we started playing regular commercial just because cool. I want to arrive at it at a set time. I don't like screwing around cool. with it. And it, uh, when they so dropped us off in Orange County, that was really bad because they're like, oh, we'll pay for your Uber back, but they'll only pay for your Uber if cool. you fill up a car with other passengers oh, back, no. back yeah. to LAX oh. or, or back to LAX. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so I also. Uh, oh, the guy. I uh, yeah, also it's just it's started cold. flying commercial it's recently. Cold. It's such a small airplane, they could have landed you and in Eric Hicks, good company. You're in good company there. there. But and they lowering they yourself to that level. Orange County because it's more yeah. convenient for them. Yeah. Yeah. The accountant's got a set. It no, it was JetX for sure. It was the same night Nobody that I got delayed and was... Nobody else has really anything here. I never have those problems. It was like a couple weeks ago, a month ago. They're, they're, they've been real. I, maybe I've just got some bad luck, but almost every flight's been delayed. And what? I, that's yeah. never the case with me. That's interesting. I mean, except that one kind of. Thank you. Ask Berkey. Berkey. Berkey, he's late all the time because yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they'll cancel flights and stuff. Uh -huh. They'll just cancel it. Just, yeah, if there's not enough people. Yeah, if there's not enough people, they'll just say, yeah. Got about ten if minutes to head over to ballyplay.com slash LATB. I'm pretty sure that shouldn't be allowed. Do you know what the lineup is tomorrow for this game? <laughs> Do you know what the lineup is tomorrow? When when they think Maria's going to be here. Maria's going to be here. I don't Maria know if Berkey's playing tomorrow. That's a good question. I know Maria Ho is here. He is? Okay, so he is. Berkey's here two you're days. You're playing tomorrow? Because yeah. you're, you're here. You guys all, all play tomorrow? I'm here. Okay, there you go. I just got the lineup for you. Yeah, I know that. Berkey is so. apparently I invited one person at some point. Kevin Martin. But in the meantime, it appears he's, he's oh, an yeah. excellent he's player. Cool. But he's such a nice guy. Kevin Martin it's also just random joining Twitter. us. Yeah, yeah. No, Robbie, every time his, uh, I'm looking at Twitter and I see somebody I he's really the one, like. He did like a um, Halloween Emily. costume with me and his girlfriend cool. or something. <coughs> and it was brilliant. I thought it was one Is of the really well done 12? things. <laughs> Landed Tice hanging out. So I invited well. Chance. Has he ever had a tough convo before? Randomly. He might be no, good for Landon's a good, he good young like, lad. He won 80 or 90,000. He ran like God. He won every hand. He won every hand. We might have had a tough conversation with him about that, but thanks, that? Bill, for inviting that. He, he cleaned this up. He's got a sparkling clean resume. He might be too good for the game. Tough, tough I lost, break for him against Bill Perkins in that heads-up match, against but, um, you know, the he future's he bright for him. But I think it's kind of fun. You see somebody who's a nice guy who you like a lot, and yeah, I'm like, hey, he come went, film with us this day. He won yeah, over 100000 I, um, I think. Did he? Yeah, he did great. Yeah, he, he did great. I have a lot of people that ask to play, but they're just too good. You know, it's like it's... What do I mean Race. when I say too good? Why does everybody want to play with me, Robbie Jade Lou? <laughs> Why does everyone want to play with me? That's an obvious <laughs> Hey, but when you're invited to every party. I'm invited to all the parties. I gotta say, walking around with Bill, it's surreal. What's that? Like, you know, like oh, he's sorry. one of the most famous yeah. people I've ever I've ever been around. And he's just constantly getting up for pictures. And he's so nice about it, it's insane. Two raised to a thousand. Yeah. Everyone else yeah. You guys are really buttering up You're a good ambassador right for the game. If I, people were pest I am until I start okay. fucking swearing. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 think, uh, I think that's also part of the pitch, right? It is, yeah, it really is. I mean, you walk <clears> around with another rather poker tamed player, tonight, nobody though. gets that kind of stuff. Yeah. It's, been, it, it's been pretty crazy. I think because I'm tall, right? Maybe, yeah. You and memorable. So, so Thank you. I think people... Hello. Yeah. yeah, if you took your hat and glasses off, you could walk around incognito. Yeah, yeah maybe. Yeah. Well, when you have the best record. I'm polarizing. When you have That's what it is. I'm polarizing. Yeah, so yeah. some people just hate me for the years of me going off, right? Yeah. And I've they slowly converted you. most yeah. of them to, but I mean, yeah. Yeah. But they keep because talking. I'm polarizing. And, yeah. and I'm tall, and they're like, I've got to look at the leaderboards here. Aussie Al in the first yeah, hour so playing they, a they god tier 50% VIP. Eric yeah, Hicks, yeah, that's, that's up to 55,300. Right? Yeah. He's killing it. Aussie Al's the big spender high. down 36,000. Robbie Jade Lou played uh, one decent sized pot. She's down to almost 15K. How far away is he? He has 10, I have 16, and I just had oh, three seconds. Close. Just had three yeah, seconds yeah, in the last, like, that's not even the last like, uh, 35, 40 WSP tournaments I played, and I have three seconds. Do you remember all of your uh, wins by art? Here and and, uh, uh, yeah. Oh, I don't Probably. That was a stupid race. 
Robbie with a min 3-bet, basically. I think she even admitted well, that's, that's right. like, so. <laughs> She uh, well, maybe put out the wrong chip or something. He but, remembers uh, his last four hands with Ozzy Al. He remembers. He remembers his left and right wing four off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ozzy Al and I only played once, and I do remember. Oh, yeah, yeah. And I'm all trapped with all the hands. I had Queen Jack, it was Ace, King, 10, 3, He's, and I figured he's going to bomb the river. Yang with a mystery. And he had three aces, so he has to go broke to any, like, any, any blank. Right, right. Robbie's not going anywhere. Great turn for And he was really smart. He bombed 4x pot on the river. He somehow knew I had a straight. I, was, I don't think it was that much. Look, this is, 30, this, this is how I see you on the river, Phil. This is how much I'm down. <laughs> this is how much I need to bet to get even. <laughs> you bet 3,500 on the turn and 30,000 on the river. I think, yeah, uh, yeah, maybe actually. Well, Phil, I was very stuck at that point. Robbie's got the top pair now 25? with the set, not flush draw. She's not going anywhere. Yang with a mystery hand, but he's betting this card, so he could have a flush, he could have two pair, he could have anything really. Ford pairs up. What's Yang gonna do here? Hey, there he is. Oh. So why were you late? J JSX? Vegas, man. <laughs> Was it JSX or what? Oh, wow. Robbie's gonna and take JSX this one down. And looks you, like right? Berkey's gonna be yeah, joining us. I told us. you guys. Berkey, you hung over or what? Yeah. No, they, uh, <laughs> they wouldn't let us get on. Berkey, that's fashionably late, like, and then there's this shot. He didn't show up. Yeah. 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 Then you went and hopped a commercial plane so you could get over here, huh? No, no, no. they let us back on up there. It was snowing in Vegas? <laughs> I was sleeping. Just let me know if you wow. want it. If you want camera A, I can show it. All ladies and gentlemen, the donkey's here. So. How are you texting me? Oh, wait, I have my phone. Small one. Uh, Berkey, C1, 100,000. Do we one hand, okay, Berkey? Yep. Yeah. yeah, you're texting with your watch? Yeah. <laughs> so you, you were texting and you were planning on playing the whole time? Big blind, Katie. So we've got Berkey here now. Um, I want, uh, and uh, wait, I'm interested I'm, to see if he I gets in there soon. Yeah, I'm sure. small. Oh, he's not in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I found out you were playing. I figured it's easy money. C4, raise. Did you see Robbie's promo video where she... Yeah. Threatened to steal his roll and buy his house that's for sale. Oh, tell me. I'm sorry. Apparently, Berkey's house is for sale, and he's uh, thinking oh, Berkey, about it. Berkey, you got to bring up something early. Are you ready? Wrong, so he's okay, going to need to so win tonight. And, uh, so you wind about you, you like gave chances a lot of time. Come on. Yeah, definitely a reasonable oh, spot for him. It, okay. No, I want to discuss it. Just you know, if we're talking whining, you're the character here, not me. Oh. What did I win? Everyone had a shot. You can have your chance to respond. Go ahead, go ahead. What did I want to know? So, yeah, you whined about Sorry. me charging too much uh, makeup. Four, 1, okay. Mark on steak king, markup. On yeah. steak kings and you steak. Four, and the customers four, there, sure. the customers oh, there are up over two hundred thousand dollars on me sure. so far. Sure. Do you think you were okay. wrong or I was just lucky? You're you're eliminating a lot of context there. I said that you okay. charge too much markup for unbeatable events. Like right, a 100k high roller or a 10k turbo where ROIs are like 25 30 percent for elite players. Like, even you, the best of the best, can't beat the markup you were charging. Oh. Just gotta find Do you hear the compliment so, in there? So, I heard a compliment. <laughs> be nice. Like, imagine yeah, Ber Berkey's never given me a compliment in my life. So. No, that's not true. I say all the time, you are the best World Series of Poker player in the history of the game. It's not even close. But imagine, well, I've earned that, so I mean, uh, so that's not saying much. Imagine a guy like Adamo charging 1.05 for 100k, and you posting for 1.25. Okay, so but at the end of the day, the customers that you stake and stakings are up 200,000 plus of me, okay. and uh, I won like 20 out of 22 times or something. It was a, a staggering number. Sure. Just for the record. I th I did. No, I did lose yesterday. I did lose the U-Stake customers, finally. I think that's the biggest loss they've oh, ever had on me. Phil's first loss. Oh, you know, on Stake Kings, you can put up money on Phil Helmuth, or you can put it on Alan Keating. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Keating's a ride, though, man. Huh? You got your money on Keating, you get, you, get, you, get a, you get to ride. You have to have a strong constitution to bet on Keating. Yeah. Well, his, uh, his people must have been happy I'm yesterday. Matt, um, I, I got what you're saying. Meaning, like, on 
events where he's got a positive EV, you could maybe charge that because likelihood of yeah, uh, yeah, but that's gouging on events where there's like no chance. Like, yeah. yeah, you're you're gouging your. I mean, you're leveraging your celebrity to gouge, and I know that might not be your intention. I've talked to Daniel about this a bunch. We all believe sure. that you're a good person, sure. but it's just like when it's pointed out to you that you're. I would I would love to have not. Honestly, I put those up because 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 I own a piece of used sure, yeah, yeah, things. Yeah. So it. that's why I did it. It cost me two hundred thousand dollars selling those pieces. Now the annoying thing is that I is fine. I, I made a bunch of random people two hundred k. Maybe it's two hundred and ten. Whatever. Sure. You can look it up. It's pretty easy to find. I made all this money for all these customers betting on me, and then I had to hear other guys like you talk about how I was robbing people. Well, and how you're, I was gouging people. You're omitting the context. You were. In certain was instances. I? I mean, I, 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 I okay. So, so somehow I was. So they're up two hundred thousand, but I gouged them. I'm down two hundred thousand gouging people. You shouldn't be me then, because if you're gonna fucking gouge people, you might want to make two hundred thousand. How have you made it thirty-five years in poker and still be this results oriented? It's remarkable. Like we can model these things. We know what the win rate is. You can model these things, but but I don't fit into any of your parameters. Thanks. Thanks. You might not even understand why I'm winning. Like only the greatest players see what. I, I mean that that's that's fair. I certainly couldn't see what was happening in the Ace King hand yesterday. I mean, you put in three big blinds. I couldn't imagine how we'd ever want to see a flop. Well, I mean, yeah, you want to pick hand for hand, sure. I mean. At least Jason Kuhn, who watched every heads up hand I played. Yeah, he got paid $800,000 to do it. Yeah, at least he understood. <laughs> I would have done the same thing. At least he understood. All right, I see what Phil. <laughs> now, at least he understood the greatness in there. He's like, oh my God, you outplayed everybody. Whereas oh somebody like God. you, That's Cherry unreal. picks five hands and says, oh, I don't oh, need to cherry pick five hands. Five hands. <laughs> cherry picking Berkey over here. There's no cherry. No, he's been a huge critic of mine. And I mean, also, he's been a huge like, critic. I mean, like, he's criticizing I, me. No, for, I, Gouging people when I'm down 200,000 Have you heard of the uh, customers? Have you heard of all press is good press? Oh, I'm, yeah, I, I don't mind. Cool. I mean, like. Phil, I've been. No, but his point's good. Very, oh, yeah. very, I, very I complimentary. His point. his point sounded very good. I've been yeah, very complimentary of the things that I think you are truly one of the greatest at. And I understand that gets drowned out because I'm very critical of the things you're arrogant about. But, like, your arrogance three, can't three, become my problem. But if it you're comes to problem, you talk about it. You're clever. You're almost there, but not quite. You're just a little off. On May 30, I, mean, I think you're one of the greatest no limit hold'em tournament players of all time. Maybe greatest tournament player in general of all time. But how about, how about when I won 30 out of 32 stream games? Yeah, but like, who gives a shit if you're just I limping just around and winning 10 big blinds? You, so you think you don't think I was the biggest winner in Rob's game? That's also true. I won 450,000. Sure. Yeah, it was one session. We all stunned Rob. One session. Two? I played three times in Rob's game. Three, three, two thousand. So you played, a grand, you were dealt a grand total of 400 hands. You played Just lucky. You played 20 of them. So when I won 30 out of 32. <laughs> <laughs> so I played 20 of them. So yeah. how did I win so much? Well, you played 20 hands and had the best of it. Uh -huh. Okay, so, so it's that easy? You just play tight and you win in all these games? Well, that's, that's, no. a, that's one way to look at it. I mean, that's, that's I a way to... I think it's completely to, inaccurate. But. It's a way to ensure wins. Do you think for the stakes that you were playing, the amount of money that you won is an impressive amount? I think I think when I filmed 32, tele, uh, you know, uh, live streams, and I win 30, and I, I it shouldn't really be counted against me to lose to all of the uh, uh, to all the streamers, but I did lose 90 in that game, <coughs> which was my biggest loss. Me when you I think it's short stack the greatest game ever assembled on TV. <laughs> cool. Well, you're critical of that too. Of course. Which which game was that? Professional. Berkey and Helmuth wasting no Botes time here. Game where They're getting right into it. Yeah, that's right. yeah that, that, that was the greatest, was the greatest game, game ever assembled. He's making some pretty good points, man. <laughs> <laughs> Berkey's on a roll here. Points out that Helmuth lost <laughs> almost 100k <laughs> short stacking. You know, we're in the <laughs> last few games. <laughs> no, no, no. You know something is up if Tom Dwan is sitting there YouTubers. not raising anything. He's just like. <laughs> I think Dwan, me, and Keating all lost in that game. Well, well Keating, Keating lost. Think, <laughs> Keating <laughs> lost, yeah. There's Keating and then there was somebody else. I think Juan lost too. I don't know. That's right. You were short stacking that, right. that game. I forgot about that one. Yeah. <laughs> I also got it all in with, I mean, I lost, took some incredibly bad beats. I mean, you and Botez both were buying in for 50000 She didn't have the rebuy. She just ran it up. What yeah, if I Botez told you? Botez would call 12K with 3-5 suited when I had 10s and just fall off. <laughs> let, me, let me better understand how you measure things. 
if we both played 32 sessions and you won 30 out of 32, uh -huh. and I won 14 out of 32, oh. but I had won twice as much money as you, who's the but better you poker player? You don't win. How twice. do you know? You, you're just saying you're things. You're I've no watched player. you. Yeah, are you saying you beat the televised? Are you saying you beat the televised and stream games over the last five years? Yes, absolutely. Okay, for much? Because I mean, I remember some really big yeah. losses. You, you can count. Yeah, of course. Check. Probably forget a lot of the big wins. Check. Check. Check it out. I mean, I've been biggest winner playing really tight many times. Check. But I guess it's just easy. Eight one. Oh. Oh. Eric, stop calling stop calling Berkey reasonable. <laughs> and stay the fuck out of this. Because he's been completely reasonable and you're right. So <laughs> we don't but don't give him any compliments, you know. I like I like I like Don't being speak in the, the truth. Don't right. speak the truth, Eric. Don't speak I'm the truth. To take you guys on. <laughs> don't speak the truth. <laughs> Berkey does make some good points. He is he, making some good but points. But he makes some good points, but then he won't admit oh, you, the you, you know. Check. Yeah. check. Check around. Never good. I'm a bitch. Phil won you that hand. We spades that time. Ah, the ace four. Turn was good. <laughs> so Phil oh. and Berkey, Berkey going back and no, forth here. you make points, Berkey. Phil's giving him some credit. Oh, Berkey has said man. multiple times he thinks Phil is the greatest World Series player of all time. So, you know, a lot of compliments, a lot of insults. You can blame that one. Very balanced for argument. For engaging I would, you. I would never. Yeah, odd yeah. distinction that Berkey's no, giving him Berkey, too. No, I think I think you've been very good for poker, by the way. Thank you. So. It's like Berkey's all all about not being results I mean, oriented, but we're just gonna take this time. one named series and be like, you're the best. <laughs> yeah, after well, that after that cash game was over, they accused me of um, of, uh, of taking a shot, sure. which like if you watch the video, I didn't. They accused me of being a she huge sourpuss, which that's the way I always am. I'm still fucking hell. And they accused me of not buying in enough. Tell me it's just telling it like it is. And not two out of those three were true, by the way. Yeah. Admittedly a sourpuss. Admittedly doesn't, I mean, he 13, usually doesn't buy enough until today. 13, 13, what I remember right. most about that one is when you gave Botez a hard time for calling you down with ace nine. And you, didn't you have ace eight or something? Or something like that? <laughs> so it looks like Helmy is just going to call seven. with ace king here. Playing a little conservatively. I don't, I don't think it's a great call for her. She only had 100k in play. You want the last of right now. Everybody misses this flop, and the accountant's got a mystery check. hand. Check. Check, check. Right. 3,500. How many is going to go for it? 3,500. Accountant looks interested. He's going to speculate. Tax season coming up. Might be time for Helmuth to pay. Let me see. Hold on. I'm going to check. I've got all about that one. Dark check. Help me with the dark uh, check. The one JRB won a million was pretty good. Check. check. Count and checks back. Check. check. There have been some pretty good Triton games. Help me going to be done with this. <laughs> they just don't look as appealing because you don't, they don't recognize that they're they chess have, stars. They don't have a bunch of social influencers. Right, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's, you know, it's... Help me with shows the ace king. Letting everybody know how bad he's running. Yeah, yeah well... Yeah. Just collecting here. Sometimes you flat the ace king and mm. they come along with the queen eight and wreck you, you know? Yeah. Taking notes, Al? Small loss, Taking though. Taking notes? Yeah. Berkey with the instant needle. Oh, your VIP is uh, decreasing. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can't play every hand. <laughs> you got, but you can't. Can get around that you can. Can. Like you, can. <laughs> you can play every hand uh, if you want. Haven't deserved it yet. Right, so things just I'm heating kind of up to. here. Uh, give it not, time. Not a lot of big pots yet, but um, no, I'm not saying you won't be ramped. Uh, I mean, a lot of potential with this group. I expect people to play. I can't win all this money, all these sessions. Oh, all these suckers, play. right? <laughs> right. I mean, yeah. Right, all these suckers, huh? Just because I'm smooth calling ace king. Fuck! I mean, I'm supposed to make it 8k and then I get called by king jack or whatever the fuck you have. Right, it looks like we got a real hand here. Eric raises uh -oh. under the gun. Here comes the professional. Accountant calls and Robbie's got cowboys. 
She's gonna shoot it up. I fold. Eric with a quick fold. Robbie printing money. Robbie, wow. Very solid. No Jack Four of yet. Um, rumor has it there may be a Jack Four drinking game introduced at some point later today. But for now, things are calm, and uh, yeah, no real, no real blood been? spilled yet. I've been playing a lot in, in Vegas. So? Yeah. From I've been going out there almost every other week. Keeps, right? huh? Keeps getting bigger, right? Keeps getting bigger, right? Stakes, yeah. yeah. I was thinking about Black that. Death, yeah. Queen of Spades, Eight of Spades. You're not playing the Friday Million the other game, are you? No. Um, poker Go? Huh? I'm playing, but I am playing uh, the 200 400 the day before. Oh, okay. With, uh, Phil, I think Phil's going to be there. and. Um, you and I are filming next week again? Yeah, and, and, and um, oh, I'll get one in the future. C4, raised to 500. I don't know, but you're pretty elusive. Sometimes they say you're, sh you're gonna be there and then. When I commit to film, I'm there 100%. Um, you playing on Friday too, Phil? Uh, no. You guys heard it. You see a lot of Phil in the near future. No Gamble, No Future, some different shows he's filming. He wants to, I've been very elusive, he wants to prove though. himself. Like, I, I keep wanting to make these tournament series and I just. That's right. Thank you. Five players. Set. Set. C4. 1500. Fold. Fold. So Yang's going to bet this flop with top pair. Nobody really Fold. hit anything. Eric might peel with a gutter. Tough customers, Fold. huh? Can we no. run it out real quick? You want to see? Yeah. 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 Oh. Everybody kind of feeling each other out right now, just like I'm feeling out this booth. There was and no uh, yeah, <laughs> we're uh, <coughs> we can't finish worse than we started. It's the good news, guys. That is true. But we got four hours left. You have multiple days left, so by the end of the week, you're just gonna yeah. Be I'm here all week, guys. So uh, you got a lot to look forward to. You guys play at all? Yeah, we played. We played uh, before the Unless they fire me. The this yeah. is my first job in uh, 20 years. Yeah. So, uh, well, if you guys couldn't tell, I uh, haven't worked for anyone for a long time. You've never had one real job? No, when I was 16, <laughs> I was a uh, busboy <laughs> slash runner. Yeah, it's 50 hundred, I think. It's the last time someone paid me to do anything. No, tomorrow's this, I think. Well, welcome back to the working world. Thank you. You're it's right. a grind. I was thinking about that on the way up here. When did I start playing so big? This happened a hundred. Yeah. I remember buying in for this game for a hundred thousand was a big deal. Yeah. Count's gonna shoot it up just here. In the slippery slope. You know? Yeah. I was talking to somebody from LA, and he oh. said uh, he said the games in LA are, are no longer social. It's like everybody's like. They're getting serious. Yeah, my friend had a a one k two k game. <laughs> you know. Good. Uh, with straddles, I'm hearing that things are, you know. You know when the private games are getting out of hand, Will? It's People just a bloodbath out there all around. I mean, yeah. they used to just talk smack about all the public game, games, all the Euros, but <laughs> here we got Phil telling us that 1K, 2K is just, I don't even know. What do you like in Palo Alto? Duking it out. We've tried. We've tried to maintain discipline and control. <laughs> it's a small game you guys play. What's right? the discipline? Like a yeah, we we tried. We tried. We tried. Uh, <laughs> as the guys billionaireized. Okay. We decided to try to keep the stakes at one two, but sometimes people come and it. Yeah, they they. When you yeah. Thursday was See, Thursday. When Thursday when like three people yeah, right? at the auto straddle on. So right. it was yeah. four eight sixteen was on almost every hand. Yep. Oh. It's a big game. I kind of yeah, feel like they're just taking big. Phil to the slaughter in but those like games, said, like, too. Like, you're playing against some of the smartest guys in the world. <laughs> the spat king, Chameth. <laughs> yeah, there's different types of intelligence out there, though, you know? Some of these guys can run a Fortune 500, yeah, but they can't figure out what the right thing to do is with Ace-8 offsuit. <laughs> yeah. yes. There's a lot going yeah. on that month, though. That's a problem. Like, the last two months. Like, a lot of time series. Yeah, I'm going to pump it up with a 6-4 suited. Yang came to play. He's been one of the more active players, and I'm still curious what the accountant really does because like this is not what I imagine the IRS working force really looking like. It, it's like the longer the day goes, it just. You're right. It we, I, we've done a really good job. A lot of legalized weed in uh, in California, Will. So those are good clients to have. 
I, yeah. I basically I straddle on every hand in, in yeah. the home game just to because I've, I've line in everybody's been very pockets. Lucky in the game for yeah, we're years. getting legal weed in New York now. It's uh. He it's finally happening. Home games and loses on stream. Seems appropriate for Manhattan, no, I've Brooklyn. Been winning a lot on stream. Yeah. yeah, not that I would know so about the personal says. effects. Just, I did win just happy to see the stream. legalization process play out. Big numbers. More money for the government. Down. What big, big numbers? numbers. Oh. It's not cheap to shoot down spy balloons every single day. So. What's your biggest single cash win? Mm. Maybe not that big. I won 500 uh, about eight months ago. I won 500 in a game. Not that big. Only $500,000. Hold, hold. Hold, hold. Hold, hold. Here we go. This is what we came for. Robbie opens up. Berkey shoots her up with this ace three suited. Robbie's got the 10 nine suited. Clubs here could be a real problem. There's one. Oh, baby. And it's Jack Four. This can't write up a better script than this. What a setup. What a setup. Ravi, is she gonna rep it too, knowing her history? I feel like she's gotta put in a raise here. Twenty five. There it is. The min the min pump. Berkey's sitting there with the nut flush draw. Oh baby. Does he wanna charge more? Black to the left of the yellow, right? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. I see. It's the old 500 big blinds deep to start here. Yeah. Oh. Murky just calls, kind of letting her off the hook. If we see a club here, it's going to get bloody for Robbie. But that is a really good card for her. Goes from having no equity to almost 30% if the graphics are right. Eight or a king gives, gives her a straight and um, can obviously hit the pairs, and she's got to keep betting this card. What's Berkey going to do? Does he want to put in a raise here? He's going to call in position. He's got to be thinking, what does she have? Does she have the jack four off? Yeah, I think he's a little scared of the jack four off here. River's a total brick. I think Robbie's going to win this hand if she can just slinky out another bet, but does she want to Does she want to triple barrel the man who she has recently told to go fuck himself multiple times? That's the question here. A lot of metagame at play. I'm worried she's going to give up. No, she didn't come to she didn't come to give up. She didn't come to surrender. She's here to play. Come on, Robbie. Pull the trigger, All right, it was for and then tell this guy to go himself. Check. Oh no. Check. Is Berkey going to bluff here? He might think he needs to. We well, can't lose now. Check. He's not thinking he's winning. He's going to be super happy to ship this. Man. And the first blood is drawn. Are we doing a time pot for the dealer's Did you did you get a tip out of both of you? Interesting because both of you had the opposite straight outs as well. Yeah, I did. I thought for sure one of them had, was getting cute with the Jack Four. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, what she's playing the, Jack Four. Yeah. Me. <laughs> Eric says what we're all thinking. Veronica Brill on YouTube will confirm Berkey did have himself before the game. Wow. That's a weird. Yeah. <laughs> that is uh, interesting. Can you imagine. CD raise five hundred. No, Got Big know. Poppy in the chat as well. He said he recently is done with his social media hibernation. Just got on socials for the first time yesterday. Happy to have you back, Joey. It's a, I was a good beautiful week. world out there. Today I was up 310 for the week. Full, full. Private? Full, full. And lost 144 yesterday. How much do you play still? I thought it was a start of something. N not, not as often. It was a rare week. We're getting Phil's session log from the week. I'm surprised you didn't play the mixed game series. Yeah, I, I, the problem is that... Uh, 
someone I love was coming to play in our private game. Fair. And I was a little on the tired side. I could have probably played through that, though. Fold. So, so Robbie that, folds the 10 9 the suited. The series, I circle it. I don't do set up any dates. And lately, I kind of show okay. up for two days. A lot of clubs today. I mean, at some point, you got to just. I'll see Al's going to be you loving gotta be this. Rich enough and have enough of a legacy to not care, right? Well, Daniel slug it out. Daniel's a G. He's a. Uh, no, I have to. I have to slug it out. Or, yeah, that's, that, oh. that's why. That's I should have played the. Mix he, he can't use the moniker kid poker anymore. He's, uh, He's not a kid anymore. Yeah, middle aged poker maybe. Checks. Daniel's a Ooh. fabulous player in yeah. every game. Yeah. Very good. Mm -hmm. Check. Uh, Negrano is one of the greats for sure. He found a table in the ten game, right? What? He found a table in the ten game, didn't he? The championship. I think he did. Yeah. You saw who won the twenty-five k high roll, right? Mercier. Uh huh. Mercier. Check. No, Rampage. The win million. Oh. Five k. Bro, there's so many 25 kids. You gotta be specific. Wow. They're, like They're all over the place. Yeah. That's like the yeah. standard. Like, I remember but, when the World Series like, of Poker, was, the main was, event was, was like the big deals. Like now 10 k's like. There's been at least five 25 k's since then. There's like, there's like the 25 k main, and then like other 25 k's around the 25 k main. It's like ridiculous. So you're saying it's a really low probability of winning one of these because so many great players yeah. play them. Is that the? It's it's not that it's a low probability of winning them. It's just if you play them over time. <laughs> Your, your return is not the same as like, you know, if you're playing a super soft 1K where it's a million dollars up top. Like, you can just have a higher ROI because there's so many bad players in the field. And everybody's pretty elite. Berkey talking about a lot of stuff that I don't understand, but... Um, yeah, not a lot of people would risk, uh, let alone... Uh, kind of a little lull in the action here. Um, yeah, do you have any words from our sponsors or anything while, they, while we get, get some downtime before we see some more bloodshed? Yeah, I mean, don't forget to hit that like button for us. This awesome lineup put together by the Live at the Bike team, our producer Wayne, our producer Matt, out there killing it with this Robbie Jade Lou return. Waiting for her to turn up the heat a little bit. I wish she would have bluffed it earlier. Probably with yeah. Ace King or something like that, huh? I had an ace. The accountant with the needle. Then I don't know if it was a good pull or not. Take that back. I didn't ask. I like you. But uh, all right, thank you. Uh, I still just want to know what the accountant well, really does. I, I didn't. I'm not gonna say why they're looking for though. You're getting a lot of love in the chat, well, people the say be, you have an no. excellent voice. You're really? complete. You're natural, and I they want I more will commentary. Really? At least really? some people are saying. Already? Wow, thing. we just started, guys. Thank <laughs> you. You're too kind. Just an hour into your commentary wow. debut here. We're starting off hot, guys. I don't think he watches them back. I, I <laughs> <laughs> like all those final tables at the series. I never watched never, a single never. one back. I've been meaning to. You, I mean this sincerely. You should rewatch the 5K that you final tabled. Which one? Did you? 5K uh, no limit. Right? You, you made it a thousand. Third, was it a or, second? Second or third? I think you got third. He pulled some insane maybe, white maybe magic maybe in that one. Uh, the 3K in a second. Is Bert was like secretly a Helmuth fanboy? I think, What's I think going it was on here? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it was the 3K. I want to play it, but it's gross. But what I learned? Uh, I think that there are some spots you would want to have back. Hmm. Ouch. Like, it was just the needle. Like, white magic spots, like legit spots. There's always some spots I want to have back. Berkey's just yeah. coming after him today. How do you guys feel about, say, each 200 bucks on the button? For the kitty game, the baby game. It's just too hard for the public to follow. I like the game, but. Helmuth laying down the law on the accountant. The accountant's just trying to have a little gambling fun, and Helmuth just shuts the door on him. Oh, it's cold again. Big shout out to Habo. Chipotle infused, I believe it. Beautiful, just delicious hot sauce. Yeah. I've definitely, I think it was the three that, that I've definitely had a lot of it. We're waiting, we're waiting for our yeah, Habo okay. hot hand to appear. Yeah. Haven't had one yet. Yeah. yeah. Are we going to see some some hot sauce on the table? Some spice? or Everybody's no, kind of playing I mean, I, cautiously I, I right now. I, when I look back on that one, I regret a hand I played. Red King Jack and folded. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. You have top pair, right? Yeah. I have to move in there. Yeah. Yeah. All right, and here comes Robbie. Now she wants to play a little. Berkey's got top piece. He's not going anywhere. And he did. He had it flopped an open ender. But yeah. 
It doesn't matter. Turn it, the best card in the deck for Robbie. Okay. Eric and Berkey can't really be loving life. My, my man, uh, the mad genius, he just seems to know. You know I'm just messing Just knows where he's at. Guy's got another gear upstairs. Yeah, uh, of course. Uh, like Robbie can't go anywhere now. I mean, you don't call that flop and then see this turn. You're Hearts, say baby. Weird, though, I call you out. No, that's fine. Yeah. Look at all those rings. Do you own any rings, Yale? Zero. Wow. That's a lot of rings. Um, That's a horseshoe ring. Robbie right? just lays it down, and Mad paid, Genius might be taking Berkey to solo solo trip to Value Town here. He knows his customer. Berkey ain't folding top piece with an open ender. And I think this is going to go check check, unless Mad Genius just knows. You can feel him. He wants to bet it. I mean, you don't get a jacket like that checking back rivers. My man wants a slice of value. He knows his customer. He just goes for it. Man, this guy just knows where he's at. And Berkey might might be curious here. He might pay him off. if I'll tell you what. If Berkey calls and sees this hand exposed, he's going to go into orbit. No, he lays it down. Mad genius. Just putting on a clinic yeah. so far. Go, Eric. Value bet the eights earlier in a spot <laughs> where I know goddamn well I would check back. Yeah, um, and uh, there he <laughs> takes it down with, with just a nice, just knew where he was at. Got yeah, Robbie off a bad, flush yeah. draw and a straight draw. And you folded a jack? A very bad jack. Jack four? <laughs> that was a snap call, obviously. <laughs> That's show value right there. Here for the memes. Uh, yeah, we haven't seen anybody have Jack for yet. For Just memes. for the gram. <laughs> Here for the memes. <laughs> Kill that, yeah. Hey, man. I don't remember Berkey. Berkey being so witty. Uh, what's that, 500? He was, never, he was never that much fun to me. I can never get a word in edgewise, usually. Everybody's usually talking Chinese. Oh, and here we go. On cue. 18. She's got to go for it. And they may be playing the Jack 4 game with a bounty on it. So either way. This is what we've been waiting for. And Berkey wakes up with the Cowboys. Oh, baby. He couldn't write a better script. Look at the poise. Look at the focus. The old, the old Euro pause before the four bat. Yeah, my man's played plenty of high rollers. Yang hasn't released yet, but I um, can't imagine he's going to hold on to this one too long. He's out. Robbie has a decision with the Jack-4. Is this going to be another epic hand? Man, a five ball would just be incredible here. No. Berkey, I'm going to show you what I'm folding. Ready? Aces. Wow. Uh, fully nice resuited. Oh, that's you, how it's that done. Highlight reel if you, <laughs> it, it pumped him up again. You should have ripped it. Yeah, I just almost it. did. Yeah, that was not. If I shove, what do you do, Berkey? <laughs> Call, of course. Or fold, I don't know. <laughs> Jack four. Depends. Do you know what's coming or not? <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Berkey with the needle. Got fired. I guess I this knew is it a fun wasn't. game. He is spicy today. Yeah. Look Whoa. at this guy. I like it. Spicy. You see, I think of Berkey spicy as Berkey. being very witty. That, that podcast paid off, huh? It was very clever. <laughs> yeah, I'm rolling it. That was clever. I'll give him that. Yeah. Yeah, I'll Berkey coming with the spice today. He's uh, he's had some jabs. Uh, he's been throwing. And landing. Mossy Al with the ace, queen of spades. And Robbie's got ace, jack. She's starting to get some hands. And things haven't gone her way. I wonder if she, she starts to get a little impatient here. Looks like she wants to play, but no, she's she's solid too today. A lot of good jackets today. Do you own any good jackets, yo? I like this one I've got right now. Little little de little denim piece. Little it's not great, but uh, <laughs> I, I mean, look at the jackets these guys. Even uh, even yeah. Helmuth came. He came with the like you know the hedge fund startup, the investor uh, Patagonia style. Yeah. Well, my budget's a little less than 50k a jacket, so you know, just gotta play the hand you're dealt. 
Shout out to Patagonia. Not a not a sponsor, but one of my uh, all time favorite uh, fleece makers. Yeah, sure. He's got a good dry humor. Yeah, which yeah. is what poker players love the most. Yeah. Yeah. Yang Come flops the pain and misery of two piece. Doing this for so long. <laughs> <laughs> I have a lot of joy as a poker player. For me. Hey, you're rich. Oh. But you make it easy. It. Yeah, not everybody's fell home. Some of us have grinded for 20 years and. And to start them. Actually, not even have we not made money, Yale. Some of us owe money. He's rich too. He has a plane. That's the worst spot in the oh. world. Yeah, but that's the grind. Oh. And that's why you play four card, I'm frankly. Jason, it's the only Jason. way to get it back. If you owe, you have to play PLO. That's what they say. You're semi-rich. Did you sell your house? No. Can <laughs> I still make go through? No. Well, I, I just won't now. The market fell too far, but. So you heard it here. Berkey's not going to sell pool? his house. Yeah. Is it a big pool? Yeah. That you can't build those anymore in Vegas. So that's a big that's deal. That's true, actually. So you should, uh, um, hot commodity. Big pools in Vegas. My neighbor sold. Well, the whole thing is stupid. The only reason I, I love my house. I don't want to move. But Why are I you built, selling it? Because I built it for 700 and my neighbor sold the same model for 1.9. Not the right time. January of 2022. Seems so like I a said, good time to buy. Me. Yeah, so I was just like, okay, well, your time in the market. I, I timed it so poorly. I waited till May, and yeah, had already, yeah, the interest rates had already hiked. Yeah. Once I saw Chance cool. list his, I was like, okay, this is probably a good time. What well, Chance was moving out of the area? He moved to Tennessee. That's right. Yeah. He wasn't selling it just to sell it. Well, I think I think the market had a lot to do with it. Four hearts and a deuce to diamonds. Four hearts and diamonds. And we're learning here the first-hand struggles of high-stakes players. Flying private, flying commercial, having to sell your house because you made a million dollars in equity on it. Did Berkey say he built his house? Do you believe he built his house with bare hands? <laughs> Maybe he did all the construction well, himself? It'll still go up. It just went. Nah, not and for so 700k. Honestly, that would probably I, be I, like I, I 200k I if he used his bare hands. Million and then yeah. yeah. Then he'd have 1.7 million in equity. You can picture it though, right? Yeah. A tank top on, sweat dripping. I mean, he now is I he is a rugged dude. We'll have water and Very rugged dude. Grew up like on that like Pittsburgh West nothing. Virginia border. Came yeah. from nothing. Big come up story. Oh. No, Big come up story. From, yeah. Tomla, Tomla from Colorado. Cool. Yeah. Well, that's what they absolutely been doing. smashed them in the early days of the uh, what was that game called? The uh, Bobby Bobby's game at uh. Oh, not yeah, Bobby's yeah. room, but it was uh, to, uh, the 3612 game. Plans and build a That's where he made his big come up, allegedly. That's yeah, Berkey's had some good swings. And, uh, not very practical, but perhaps possible. Seems to be in the right side of variance these days. I mean, if you've got a house that's worth $2 million in Vegas, that must be one of the nicest houses in the world. Landon Tice calling him Brick House Berkey. <laughs> Somewhere on the west side? Pacific Palisades. The neighbors. Santa Monica, Malibu. Oh. Everybody connects here. You're in Palisades? Helmut's actually got the best hand, but. Where? Might be tough for him to tell. On Palisades. He's not going anywhere. Yes. Alphabet. Yeah. Good walkability. Good walk score there. I have kids. Hey, when you see cocktails, um, uh, you like order me a bottle of Camus. I'm up the village like every day. Yang turns the flush draw. This is, I think, going to get a fold from Helmuth with the best hand because Yang ain't folding I mean, I'm like this. A regular at Angelini's. And I'm curious about this JD guy. Did he invent Habo hot sauce? Or is he just, is he just repping the brand? I believe it's both. He looks like he might have invented the hot sauce. Yeah, they have a whole like menu for that. It's a good beanie sunglasses combo. Yep, and Helmuth's out with the best hand. He's not going to be happy if this goes to showdown. How long have you been there? Three years? Four years? Or Yang's going to win a nice pot here. There's no way he's getting off of this. It's just a matter of does does Mr. Habo want to put some more cheese in the pot? No, he's going to give up. I mean, the thing is that, like, there's also, like, a new filming ordinance that's kind of cool, but... Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Fuck! Um, and there goes Helmuth, realizing he folded the best one. Wow. That's definitely not going to take him off a tilt. I'm wondering if we get to see Phil a little steamed up. You played with Julie? Chad going wild on this yeah, Berkey she, riff. She <laughs> they're, 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 they're loving what you said. What you said About him building his own house? Yeah. I can picture it. I mean, the man is a, he's a big boy. 
now they're talking about that he hunts his own food. We got Melissa in chat. Oh, well, we already know that. You, you don't think Berkey kills his own chickens for those eight eggs he's eating a day? I thought Landon was the egg dude. Maybe maybe they just feed each other. They might feed each other. It was. They had just gotten hit, so like it was kind of okay, but... There were some days where everybody everybody was, everybody's was, everybody's was pot, right? it's not The that, day I left, not that big a they deal. got like three and a half feet. It's not a big pot. I'm yeah, so it's upset. So much snow. <clears throat> yeah, apparently it's snowing in Vegas. Uh, I didn't even know that happened, but um, my turn. It's uh, race. There's snow in Vegas. That's what took Perky a while. He wasn't building a house, and here he is with the Jack Four suited. This could get interesting. Yang with a pretty hand, just gonna call. <laughs> Melissa is savage on her roommates today. Landon and Berkey breastfeed each other, she says. She lives with them, so she would know. No, you heard it first from one of their roommates. I do a lot of planning for like high net worth individuals and and businesses. So like people that own their own business and the money flows through from the business to them. So I all have my yeah, ta yeah, tax optimization. Yes. Yeah, accountant telling us a little bit more about his story, which makes more sense because I'm thinking of a guy in an office just pushing pencils, you know, collecting IRS checks, and this man is clearly doing a little bit more. All legal, of course. Big four, uh, Pricewaterhouse Oh, really? Yeah. I did. Bought it. Bought it. Okay. Four years or something? Yeah, so I was in the tax group. Oh, yeah. And I worked for a private equity firm. Mad genius here, just, oh, right the off. guy like just you, has like a sixth sense. Uh, okay, yeah. The firm, and then uh, also uh, uh, essentially deal structuring uh, yeah, yeah. for uh, a lot of uh, Australian investors actually. Deal structuring? Stopping wealth funds and all of that. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that's some beyond uh, my... Uh, Join the regional firm as a partner yeah. for um, business. Beyond my expertise, yeah. yo. I wish I knew about deal structuring before I took this job. <laughs> But is Eric, I mean, he's going to win this pot no matter what, right? Yang's just folding. So, man, I, I got I got to say, I'm a early, huge fan of this guy's game. I see why he gets the Mad Genius game. I mean, the guy invented some type of solar bike or something. So he's a player. And Yang's going to release. And Mad Genius takes another one. I mean, he's he's really been on a roll so far. Um, so the winner of this pot gets Pablo. If I win it, the dealer gets it. And here's the hot it's sauce on the table. Less, but it's just, it's, there's also politics within the firm, even that it seems much smaller or less consequential because you're like, who cares? Like, what difference yeah, yeah. does it make? But people still have feelings, emotions, and, yeah, you know, get, get hurt over little things. And Got a little leaderboard update here. Eric Hicks covering the table. Uh, Phil bought in for 300k today. Robbie Jade Lou bought in for 100,000. Berkey, late arriver, leading in VPIP. Yang also over 40%. <laughs> JD's at the bottom, just over 20. Is that yours? Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Look at the winnings. The yeah, mad genius of Luna Cycle crushing the table up $75,200. The accountants in the black. Aussie Al's down the most, $41,400. And Robbie Jade Lou's down almost $23,000 in her live stream. Hey, appearance. I don't know. I'm tripping over my words here. Good, yeah, first, I mean, first, time, first time back, if you would say. Her return to the live stream world. And if you're just joining us, this is Bally's Presents Live at the Bike, the world's longest running high stakes poker series. 100, two no, 100 200, no limit hold'em. $200 big blind Annie. My name's Yale Greenfield. You can find me on YouTube at Live King Poker. And Will Jaffe is calling most of the action. You can find him on so Twitter at Dankness3. Sale in Vegas, 2019. Okay. I argued with the agent I hired. And uh, I guess I was right because it sold in one day. So Where was clearly it? Clearly underpriced in the Las Vegas country. Oh yeah. Sold it in one day. Can't wait to hear the price tag on Phil's house. Next, the woman next door sued me. I mean, I haven't, I have never lived in the house, and I hadn't even seen it for ten years. Mm. She sued you? She sued me because my, uh, because my fence was affixed to her thing, and she blamed me for ruining the inside of her house. Sure, I can see how those two things yeah, correlate. Yeah. Obviously, yeah, obviously, because it was, you know, oh, the like, and so, um, Check. so she, it, what she did. So then, what happened is, I had sold it and I let the person move in, and they got rid of all my furniture. The garage was filled with tools. I mean, I, I don't even know what was in there. She got rid of everything. The pandemic hit. She lost her job and she moved out. She took all my furniture out. <laughs> I never even bothered. I was like, whatever. 
you know, I mean, I don't blame. You really seem to have taken the worst of this in a big way. So then, so then I'm like, so then real estate prices went up. So instead of like, I think it was 375. It was right. Never my primary house, just one of my other houses. Now it climbs to like 600 per minute. Eric, what'd you but get? But I can't sell it. Do you want a glass? Yeah, there's a loss. I'll take a little bit. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Three glasses. Three more so wait, you still really wanted that hot sauce, Hobo. So, there you go. So we finally, what, what she did have is she made me clean up some stuff that like technically well didn't fit, which was just annoying. Yeah. Because everybody else has that. So, so she basically got nothing out of it except that I had to put in a new fence. So I spent like. 75,000 repairs, maybe 50 or 75 on attorneys. Yeah. Jesus. And uh, yeah, it was. So now finally it's being listed. She just rented it the whole time. The rental market's like that's out of what, control uh, there. That's what they told me, but I was like, ah, I don't want to rent it. I mean, was it furnished the whole time too? It was furnished when I bought it. Uh, I, I like I stopped going there in 08. Wow. These guys somehow know more about homes than I know about anything. Yeah, well, a lot of savvy veteran homeowners in this lineup. High-stakes poker players. Will, you know as well as I know. High-stakes poker players, if you're good at poker, you literally know about everything. It's true. That's one of the main rules of being good at poker. It's impossible to get good at this game without knowing everything about anything and everything in the world. You don't climb to the top. Just yeah, knowing about poker, I'd never been just being a degenerate, yeah, just yeah, being yeah. a grinder. You have to know about science. You have to know about politics. Um, you have to know about climate change, glasses? and that's just a starter yeah. kit, really. Mm. Oh, did you already pour all four glasses? Yeah. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wow. Poker security. Yeah. Let it breathe there. Nutrition. Breathe. I mean, those two are big. Can you, you know, Korean yeah. and uh, wine too. We're getting some. We're getting some vino flowing. I, I get mad when there's no stem in a wine glass. She said, "Phil, you're an idiot. I'm not renting." No, no, no. We're yeah. But different, I was like, different ah, I I'm a pretty big wine drinker myself. I actually agree with Robbie on that, but that's one of the only things I know anything about, unlike these people who know everything. Think all the income you got. Not a big wine guy. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Like 25. But you don't know who wants it. At least at a country club, it, for sure. How many bedrooms? Here, you want me to pass oh, it? I'm the big. Like four? Yeah. Might have been able to get like 35. There you go. I can you name it? Eric, thank you. Cheers. Yeah, no problem. Robbie, cheers. Cheers, cheers, guys. Cheers. Thank you. All right. Good. Remember what happened, Berkey? I got drunk last time, and you were drunk last time we played, were you? Pop. I mean, That's eight three. That's all right. Phil's gonna That's bang with the nine good. seven of hearts. Oh, yeah, oh, He's finally awesome. in there. Oh, yeah, yeah, an accountant's got a nice hand here. When's he coming back? He's so much more fun than you. Who? Cool. Oh. Account gonna shoot it up. Perfect timing. He's got the button. He's been chirping. You're you're a swell person. I said you're a swell human. I just don't want to play poker with you. Wasn't used to serving nice wine. Goes for a big sizing. And anyway, next month. And I watched her. Just What's up? We just to see if Yang wants to continue with this. Now we're cooking. What the fuck? To the rim. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like okay, I'm I'm gonna fill this guy's glass. I don't have to come back and refill it. You know. You going to Vietnam? Trying to intimidate. He's trying to intimidate him here. <laughs> the arms crossed stare down for <laughs> Phil. Is, is, pull off the ultimate troll. I think Phil might sniff this out. It's not his first rodeo. Satellite or whatever on ACR. So the Count and Phil really. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Phil's a little too sharp for this. The accountant takes it down with ladies and uh. Beautiful, I think that's an English bulldog on his shirt with some sparkles on it. That's got to be worth more than my bankroll. <laughs> a little bit more. A lot of stuff going on there. We got the cameras filming, guys. We're in the booth. My short illustrious poker career. Anytime I've ever lived the big bear, always with the uh, We're getting the hang of this. We're getting the flow. Me and Yale are developing some chemistry. Yeah, bas bas basically, you're just you're crushing it, and I'm trying to play off it every yeah, now and again. So know, it's, it's I'm working. hoping I can bring Yale up with my uh, in immense social media following and my uh, brilliant voice that we can kind of just drag Yale along for the ride, and you know we can really mix it in something. I'm known for a quick wit, but man, you're quite difficult to keep up with. What do you think, Robbie? You think she's going to get going a little bit? Well, she had a little wine, but now she's got the ladies and. Uh, she we'll just calls, so that, I think gonna that's going to bring thing. Yang in. <laughs> would limp on the button with big hands. And he goes, you watch. Ten years from now, all the kids are going to be You know, on when I got Ace-4 suited here, I'm not, I'm not a pro <laughs> like these guys, they but they made fun I just want to shoot it to the moon. all of a sudden, this year, they started limping on the button. Nice. But I think Yang's just going to call here. He's been playing real solid. A lot. 
Like, especially when you get shorthanded, it's still... Interesting, too. My understanding is he's a race car driver. Oh, really? Kind of like yeah, and I don't know which version. I don't. It's not like F1, <laughs> but it's something <laughs> like that. Well, he's put the pedal to the metal here, and I love it. Um, he's going to get out to release really quickly, and Robbie's going to have a decision, but Queens on Valentine's Day, all those rings, I, I can't imagine she's going to let this go. I know no limit players who, like, took shots at that event. Yep. Look at the stare down. The Annie round was so big. Two hearts with the glasses. Incredible mm -hmm. glasses. Yes. And Yang could be in some trouble here. Robbie's been waiting for a spot like this. Got no idea what she's going to do. She's very unpredictable. She's thinking about it. Is she going to fold? No. I call. Okay, she's in there. Laying the bear trap for Yang. If we see a low flop here, maybe a heart. Could be trouble for him. Great dealer work there, getting the chips together, getting the pot right. Shout out to all the dealers out there. Never get love. Oh, and Robbie flops top set on a rainbow board. And Yang has a nice hand here. Bottom pair, backdoor, nut flush draw. You ever play with Garrett in the same game? Curious to see what he does. I think he's probably going to want to bet, just try to take the pot down, and a lot of bad turns for his hand. You, you haven't played at the lodge yet, have you? That's ten. How Robbie? How is Robbie going to play this? If she, if she can sniff this out and smooth call here, she could win a really big pot. Small run. Oh no. Yeah, but he's big time. Those guys are just. I like. Dumps. Uh, no, Doug Polk, I mean, I, don't know. I like Brad a lot, and uh, Andrew named me a lot. Doug's been kind of mean to me. Robbie rips this, and. <laughs> it's also part of this stick. Now. Doug's a I mean, I think guy. Yang's going to fold yeah, almost yeah, certainly, like, but. I think Doug could be. Doug could be it does kind of look like she has miles, like a 7 5, Ooh. maybe. Shots no, I mean, no, but he does. 5 3 suited. That's what you hope she has if you have Ace 4 in Yang's spot, because you can't beat anything else. And he gets some, but imagine how. Big but no, she's got top set. Three ladies on balance. Valentine's Day. I, uh, Takes the glasses off. I used to really hate his approach. Actually, I still hate his approach. But oh, I, does Yang put I her on the Jack Four that, here? Well, I understand it a lot more now. Like, I didn't get meme culture as much. No, he's got to yeah, release this. Go. It is, it is meme. Yeah, I mean, he's like That's coming exactly from the gaming like, industry yeah. where. I mean, the thing about this thing, Yale is it just, like, what does she have, you know? You, like, what is she, what is she just ripping like with there? I think that's the reason Yang's hand, tanking, is she, he, he can't put her on a hand. Yeah, it is kind of a psychotic really rip, and I certainly question what he's thinking about. I'll tell you what, about. he definitely doesn't think she has three queens. You know, basically accused us of yeah, yeah. metagame for you. All the money. Trust me, I, I think that he overstepped a bunch. He oversteps way too often, and just imagine how big he'd be if he could just tune in and go, wow. Wow, this Doug's right again. Talking about Doug Polk, uh, some may say he's a habitual oh, like line stepper. I'm not sure he likes me. You guys are making sure that Doug Polk gets on. This is still on YouTube. Talking during this hand. <laughs> what up? <laughs> you were you were opening a club there at one point, no? Yang hasn't folded yet. We we opened in Houston. Then we he's confused. One yeah. He's and, getting a good price. Oh, the then, Houston one's operating. I don't know how to do math, no, but it we, seems like a good we, price. Instead, we tore it down, or we, we left our we left our lease, and we could be doing the old. Down. I just put her on Ace King move. And it's being turned into a poker room now. Okay. Yeah, maybe she's got Ace King. So we have a Houston and a Dallas location. Beautiful. Ace King, Jack uh, Four, Seven Five. Right now, they can only play chess there. So yeah, the Dallas. Somebody in the city council objected or something. Yeah, not I mean, My man's a race car driver. He's out there ripping 250 problem. miles in some F1 Ferrari. He's he didn't come here to, to fold with a backdoor, seems, not flush draw. Like it's gonna be. And Robbie's selling it well, you know. She's she's looking at him. Uh, she looks a little nervous. And be either very poker friendly she or say enough's enough and shut everybody down. Yeah. Where in uh, in Texas? Yeah, specifically Dallas. Why? You I know, I was sure mind. Yang was going to fold, but the longer uh, he takes, well, I, think, I wonder if he, I think if he might look this up. From, like the tribes in Choctaw and Oklahoma. Oh. Berkey's and already hit an incredibly wide range of topics. Money. Yeah, I also think for Tita. Or like, religion. Yeah. The housing markets, like Choctaw tribes. Really in opening casino there. I mean, we're well, going to cover the globe yeah, by the time this game's over. Yeah, yeah, during this tank, he and Phil have yeah, been getting on about Doug Polk, uh, oh, yeah. a, a favorite target of yours, and a, yeah. him and Berkey and Helmuth. They all got some kind of triangle going on. Yeah, I, I have called out Doug a few times, but um, no no comments today. He's not on the stream. Um, 
And uh, I saw he recently tweeted a picture of himself without hair gel. So I was really uh, happy for that, and I, I went ahead and retweeted it. Um, and I think people were a little disturbed by the picture, but, Jack you know. Yeah. Yang does find the fold. Robbie's going to show. show she yes. wants to show. Yes. There it is. Oh. Three queens. Okay. Good fold, right? And Robbie's got a great jacket, too. I didn't even notice that. <laughs> no, no. Or like a Jack Four <laughs> game, and I'm a, I feel like there's, a, there's some bets on me. Oh, I don't want to play Jack Four sure. about I can attest it's already over two. Oh, wow, that's it. <laughs> uh, Robbie's button, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, stacking those nice hundred dollar chips. Is King? I hope you had all the big cards. You had two more, Yang going to get after it. This man came to play. Race car driver. I want to get some more specifics. Are we talking Formula One? Are we talking NASCAR? It doesn't really look like a NASCAR guy to me, but the guy came to play. Getting a lot of hands, too. Is that a race? Yeah. Well, here, yes. Oh. Yeah, he's going to take it down. You know, this dealer's really been crushing it today, Yale, and I just think we need to take some time to appreciate the dealers, the people my, behind my the scene. Is, is they never get enough love. He's, he's great for poker. They get berated. They get cursed I think at. If he was, if he didn't Especially in L.A. I don't know, I don't know what it's yeah. like in Delaware. If he didn't overstep. They get yelled at in Delaware? I don't know what it's like in Delaware, my man. I, I've never been to Delaware. Let's not talk about that. Shout out to everyone in Delaware, you know, anyone who didn't make it out. Shout out to you guys, the real grinders. Yeah, I think Brad is a good uh, he's race. He's amazing. He's, very he's, a good, he's a good indicator of that. Why? I think Brad's just like very much an everyman who is relatable to the to the community, and he doesn't really rub anybody the wrong way. Nice to everybody. Yeah. Respects everybody. Yeah, he kind of yeah, just Brad did his own thing and built a massive platform. Yep. Berkey's talking about Brad Owen, like him. biggest vlogger. He's a big fan. Of All around great guy. You guys played a couple of times and have made his vlog, and he's very like joyful about uh, talking about it. Oh. Let me ask you, Yale, as a vlogger, is, is Brad the gold standard? Are you, are you looking at Rampage? What are you, who's the Michael Jordan of the vlogging world? I mean, it's, they're really just in a class of their own, right? Uh, who's LeBron? Who's Michael? A lot of people, I mean, Brad does a great job, right? He's, he's the OG. He's got 3X the subs Rampage does. But Rampage is really young. Was the guy like 24, 25 years old? Yeah. He just shows up and dusts Kevin Rabichow and a freaking high roller. Like, one of the all-time go to poker, and yeah. he's about 215,000 subs, and uh, I think a lot of people in the game think and I got away from in time, oh, yeah. with that age and that volume, he's going to eclipse Brad and subs, but obviously, they're both incredible. So Brad is Michael Jordan. So I played all night Saturday night. Well, I'm a LeBron guy on number one, sorry. Oh, so you're a LeBron guy. Okay. I mean, I'm from Ohio. All right. So, so let's put it this way then. Brad is LeBron. Yes. Rampage is MJ. Yes. Who are you? What? Who's your NBA comp? How do you follow NBA closely? Pretty closely. Tory Craig. Tory Craig. Tory Craig. Wow. Just like off the bench, grabbing boards. Yeah, solid. Some defense. I'm a big defense solid. guy. My offense, sus at best. Yeah. I was thinking more of Zaza Pachulia, but I can see you being a touring crack. I grabbing a lot of boards, just doing the hustle work out there. I got to do like, yeah, I'm, a, I'm a hustle, I'm a grinder. I'm a hustle work guy, you know? I'm just I told Nick Airball, I'm kind of laying around. And I think the thing is, too, is like, Nick dude, look at me. I'm five foot six, man. Zaza Pachulia? Isn't he like a forward center? So I told him, I ran at him this weekend. He was it's not about the position. Like I'm mad at you. <laughs> but people are telling me he's a Wait, who's guy. better? Nick Craig's, <laughs> Craig is better than Pachulia? Is that the joke? Uh, I don't know enough it's about the NBA. <laughs> you just struck me more as a Zaza guy. <laughs> nice we weren't on stream. <laughs> but, I mean, if, if we would have been recording that day, it would have been great. Because he attacked me, and I called him a... Uh, I called him a... Uh, oh, you weren't even I called him a chess hustler from, you know, New York City. Yeah. I said, I'm the... I said, I'm Magnus Carlson. You're a chess hustler from New York City. I mean, oh. it was, 
It was some really good stuff back and forth. Uh, he loved it. I mean, like. You know, it's your humble you nature that that's, yeah, uh, yeah, that's, that. that's the most likable attribute. <laughs> humble nature. That, that, that game was just you and Nick shit talking each other the whole time. Yeah, you were there with some real shit talk going on. How are you talking about some shit talking in the past where. How deep are you? He called himself Magnus Carlsen. He called someone else a low down chess hustler, which is basically like me calling myself LeBron and calling you Tory Craig. Which is fair, not only in content, but in poker, no doubt. Well, not in vlogs. Yeah. Well, I've got a secret weapon. After uh, you crushed my. I don't know if I want to know what it is. Yeah. Uh, I lost. I. Here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Phil finally gonna oh, win one. Yeah. I lost like nice 600k or something. Yeah, Phil's been playing real yeah. solid. Like in one game? How much? In one game? Somebody in chat earlier said, I showed up for Phil Helm. I showed up to the stream today because they want to see Phil Helm with fold Ace King off. He hasn't folded Ace King off pre, but he has flatted it. He has flatted it. And he We're doesn't, there. He doesn't seem, building up to it. He doesn't seem interested in three betting. We got a few hours left. It's totally possible. I was supposed to win a 400k pot instead. I uh, I got wrecked. Yeah, that was a rough. Uh, if I would have known I was going to lose both runouts, I wish Yo would have just ran it once so we both could walk out of yeah. together. <laughs> You gave me some hope, and then I just well, We do have is that a raise or a an incredible no, vlogger in the chat, Jamin Burton. I don't know if you know him. You gave me some hope. You're not a vlog guy. No. And then Jamin. Yeah. Jamin's one of the yeah, best vloggers out there. I'm not in the vlog I mean, streets. There was a hand where there was like a... Yeah, you're too cool for that. I had like 10 big blinds with like 100k. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it was happening all day. We were basically yeah. playing 1k, 2k with like, you know, 50 bigs. <clears throat> And we got an action flop here. Middle set versus the nut flush draw, which comes in on the turn. This is going to get expensive for Phil. <laughs> JD is going to milk this. We're still not sure if he invented Habo hot sauce, but he's about to get paid. Helmy's not folding here. Helmy's kind of lucky that flop went checked around, or this would be a much bigger pot. Helmy shoots him up. With the eights. That was an action game, though. Yeah. But it was also like. JD hasn't. We were just doesn't have a huge game. stack. <laughs> like Andy and. Yeah. Andy and, and he Eric puts in the raise. And yeah. <laughs> what's Phil we're gonna do now? I mean, it's a game you can bring a hundred k and you can win a million. <laughs> right. Or you can bring a million and oh, you can win, win a, nothing. Oh, I mean, <laughs> you, you can bring a million and win a hundred k. Can yeah, you yeah. bring a million and win nothing? What's that called? <laughs> Losing a million? Yeah. <laughs> I really like this raise from JD. He knows Phil has something. More. I'm just, uh, is, that, is that about right? 15? He's giving Phil a decent price to call, but he just doesn't have chips behind. Roughly 12. Definitely going to time thing. But the flop was checked around, so I think Phil's going to be real suspicious here. Any more of these later? No, no, you're good. I'm a little late, yeah. Uh, I think it's like every couple hours. Yeah, I think you do a little more. And we still don't know what kind of car Yang drives or what type of accounting the accountant does, but we know that Helmuth does not want to fold a set here. Oh, and he's going to shove! And JD snaps him off. Oh, this is what we've been waiting for. Flush? Twice? You want to go twice? I usually go once. Phil asking for the twice. Okay. Oh, we're going to go one time. If Phil can't boat up here, we might get to see Helmut get in a little early heat in this session. And it's a brick. 70k to the man who may or may not have invented Habo hot sauce. And Phil, already down a 50 ball after losing six figures last night. <laughs> you can feel the heat starting to rise. The room has gotten hotter. No. No. I thought for sure you were Not sure that Luxon pay is going to help him. I can, like, if he has less, I can call and fold the river. Yeah, he's got. Well, I don't know what he's got. That's a lot of fun playing in LA the last two days. 
What's that, what's that next river just, <laughs> That's not that bad. just for spite? Phil is not happy. What was that? I'm unlucky. City of Angels has cursed him. I finally flopped a set. Sure. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> finally flopped a set, Phil. Just waited for the turn to get it in there. And JD is going to stack up a nice pot. I know the chat <laughs> wants me to come after Helmuth now. It's it's too early, guys. There's plenty of time left. And we're not here to talk uh, poker strategy. I watch. Played it kind of sneaky, and yeah. Keating had pocket threes, and Rivers is straight. Oh, wow. Yeah. I only got the uh, the low lights of the Ace King fold. Uh, While well, he, well, he gave praise to God. Little oh, wait, is there a straddle weight, man? No, no, I would have straddled. Uh, I didn't know I was. Raise. Uh, uh, but you can straddle regardless. Yeah. Raise to 1,000. Just not a straddling round. Nobody can uh, say you're a tight player. King six, huh? <laughs> King five. King, King five, five suited. King five suited. Let's go. Ding, 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 ding. Check. That's what you hope for with King five suited. Exactly the ace of clubs. The other guy somehow has a set. You hit it. You didn't even have to wait twice, for it. He let you uh, decide. Check. Check. Yeah, but he'll run it twice Check. later, maybe, you know. Maybe I won the big pot. These things have a way of evening out. Math. Do you have math, guys, Phil? He won bet. 3,000. When, you win, when you're as lucky as I am and you win as much as I do, you, you have to let the amateurs do whatever they want. Right? Calling him an amateur? <laughs> or, all right, well, pro. <laughs> no, he's an amateur. <laughs> I don't even know what I am. You actually I'm, have the I'm gun just out happy there. I had to, to, to be I can vouch that he's an amateur. Fair. We're all kind of amateurs <laughs> other than uh, that other. Stay amateur. Stay amateur. The scamateur. What the no. fuck? Battle. You made a good call, though, against, <laughs> the, against this monkey. You the big one? Yeah, straddle, straddle for four from seat one. Yeah, I have a choice. Yeah, yeah, big line, don't fold. Yeah. Yeah. He only has 14 more. I just yeah. 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 yeah, you have to fold. Well, oh, I can fold a set. Not against him, but that can fold me. Big shout out to Johnny Chan, the fucking Chan man. Saw him last night, and he just completely turned my spirits around. A huge fan. You, you had the outs and stuff. It was good. Robbie with threes, so we're going to see her tangle with Helmuth here. He's not messing around. He's gonna take this one down. Let me ask you, Yale, are you a big Dr. Seuss fan? It's been a long time since I got in those streets. Do you remember the Lorax? Yes. I believe Robbie's jacket is made out of fur from the Lorax. Those poor creatures were slaughtered. And I don't know if any of you chat guys are anybody's Dr. Seuss fans, but one of the greatest writers of all time. This count. Yeah, I'm sorry, Chad. I'm gonna I'm gonna find a way to look at you in, a, in the future, but right now we gotta focus on the booth. We gotta focus on the action. We're still learning the ropes, but we're we're getting the hang of it. Getting some chemistry with my man Yell, and uh, I I do believe that's a now I've been told it's an Six. American bulldog on the accountant shirt. Beautiful creatures. Twenty-two. Earlier. And Phil is getting involved here. Looks like if the graphics are right, he's going to shoot up Eric's under the gun open with 8 7 off. Eric's got him dead with 8s. If you were in Eric's shoes, would you consider a fold here? I mean, Helmuth is 3 betting. No, but it looks like uh, Aussie Al has cold called, so we're going three ways. Oh my god, and this flop is just screaming action. Wow. Yeah, Eric? I don't know what's going on with the graphics here, but it looks like Al just folded Jackson. 
Eric has Phil absolutely dead. I don't know how Phil has so much equity. I'm not a math guy, but you tell me how that hand is 30%. Does Eric want to put in a raise? Nope, he's just going to call. And this is going to slow things down, I think. Pretty unfortunate turn for the Mad Genius. I think a, a lot of cards would have had Phil putting in more money in really bad shape. Check. Phil's going to lose this one. Sevens. He did have 8-7. Oh. No, no. Kind of got away he cheap there, seven. considering the flop. <laughs> oh, I thought, did you not just see how he plays sets? The <laughs> more money goes in. Yeah. <laughs> Berkey, obviously, with an opportunistic needle. This guy's not missing any jabs today. Wow, what a disaster flop. That was the worst possible flop, I think. He did. Nine. We could have played a big one. I was going to raise him, too. <clears throat> I'd be eight nine. Nine. It's too cliche to raise Bill. <laughs> with that, yeah. On that board. That was as cold a flop as I could imagine. I had 7-8. I finally oh. made a move <laughs> at 8-8. Eight, eight. Phil, that? making a move, you got to like the heart. He came to play I two know. today. 1,000. And are we seeing a little steam from Helmuth? I'm real curious to see what he has here. Is it a real hand, or is, is the heat starting to rise in the room? Three players. He's got solid king queen. Whiffs the flop though. Three. He's up against Berkey and the accountant. Oh, and it looks like he just limped. This is a limp pot. I believe that's an English bulldog and the, the flag of England, if I'm correct. I'm not a big geography guy, but does that look like the English flag? Both of the guys are here. The UK. Beautiful place. Vegas, so you don't even have to. So I don't know what's going on here with these with these graphics, but um, very interesting hand if it's true. It looks like Phil bet and Berkey floated him with King High, and Berkey's gonna bluff it now, and I think it's gonna work because Phil can't call this bet. Phil with it, easy fold. Man, he looks defeated right yeah, now. Yeah, Phil is deflating a little. Um, bad sequence of events for him. Bad night last night. And um, yeah, it's a, uh, it's not a good week in LA for Phil. Real quick chat. We're gonna have an MC on the floor. Submit a super chat with any questions you wanna ask these players and maybe yours will get submitted. Get in there, provide a super chat, submit a question and one of these players will be asked your question. Yeah, and if you guys have any questions for me, throw them in there, too. It doesn't need to be a super chat, but um, we're going to find a way to interact with you guys. We, you guys are a big part of this. We didn't forget where we came from. Bunch of limpers, and Berkey pumps it up on the button with ace-10 off. Oh, wee, good looking. Genius is going to shoot him up, it looks like. And Berkey releases. Let's see a flop. I want to be tortured. Okay. Add it again? Yeah. Ace 10. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> That's the way you play his king free flop. No, right? fucking fold it, man. <laughs> Let me get in there with my ace 10. I the ace of spades. I just win. Genius has been playing some poker today. He's definitely, he's definitely been doing the best on the stream so far. But really impressed with his game. His reads are on. You guys want to do it? Yeah. I'm in. I'll do whatever you guys want. You're, you're up, Rami? Yeah. You do it? I did that in Malta and I made the guy. What are we doing? Way more okay. fun. So, uh, what? Uh, $500? What, what's what $500 per, per person? Jackpot per person. Per person. And the bounty. last person to fold is 1000 Ooh. You have, to be, you have to be at the table to pay it, right? That's yeah. right. That's right. You must have looked at your hand. Yeah. yeah. Jack 4 Bounty is on. Jack 4, right? Yeah, we're going to play Jack it like four. it's okay. a 7 deuce game. Okay. Cool. okay. 
Jack, Jack four. four. Yeah. There's yep. no straddle. No, no, no straddle. straddle. Jack 4 Bounty has been announced, so... Game on, game on. 500 a man. Show Jack 4 and win about $3,500, I think? Not a bad deal. Suited or unsuited? That's, that's absolutely perfect. perfect. It's got more, it's better equity both, than both. 7 deuce. Just let you know. So Robbie raises, oh, Berkey calls with a gonna, uh, king 9 off. off. Yeah, is it Jack 4 suited? Yeah. yeah. All right, so so. And Mad Genius is getting in there with a 3 bet. Guy has been relentless so far. No Robbie's gonna let it go, and he's gonna take down another one. Since the last time I played you, I'm playing really bad fucking hands, man. You're ruining my party. <laughs> but Berkey, it feels better when you win with bad hands than good hands. That's yeah. why I'm trying yeah. to see three. He keeps. You've gotten a lot more aggressive. No. Uh, like he's just been printing Maybe. money. I know. This is out here firing shell after shell. He's king every goddamn hand. <laughs> I had pocket eights four times tonight. I've had pocket sevens about the same amount really? of times. Wow. Where, do you have pocket eights right there? No. Uh, Mad genius confirming seven. he didn't have pocket eights. <laughs> oh, Jesus. You got it's the weirdest seven. thing. I keep getting sevens. No, no, no. Seat two, two. Let's keep those questions uh, PC chat, okay? Our hands are tied, you know, so if you if you give us something we can ask, we'll ask it, but uh, <laughs> underpants questions, let's just say those aren't going to fly. There was like six sessions in a row where L was just playing it to the death. Yeah. Do you see that? Do you see like are you kidding? Every, I feel like people play it just to send it to me, and I'm like, please don't do it for that reason. <laughs> yeah. Disclaimer. Surgeon General's warning. Yeah, like I'm like, please don't. Like that one hand that happened here, I was like, oh, thank God he's a billionaire. <laughs> oh, Eric? Yeah, I'm like, geez. Oh, look I, don't, I don't think that guy's a billionaire. Well, huh? billion's a lot of money. <laughs> he owns it's like a 30 it's a small casinos. We're talking strip mall casinos. <laughs> we got to do a field trip sometime. Yeah, yeah. Check these things out. We should. Out. <laughs> that would be awesome. I think if all I, I know, start... you go to the website and all you got is that, that hat. Yeah, yeah, that would be awesome. <laughs> we got to go check it. We got to go do a field trip. Uh, I'm in. 100%. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go check it out. Going to go investigate. He does a bunch yeah. of, he does like meetup games and stuff with Antonio. Got to see a flop yeah. here, accountant. Come on, no? Is it, does he have one in Washington maybe? Yeah. Account yeah, lets go. One. Pretty hand, yeah, but. I think he does. Uh, Al had the bigger diamonds, so. Could have oh, got dicey yeah, for him. Nice. You actually might enjoy it. Like, it'd probably be reasonable stakes. Nice. Um, yeah, is yeah, yeah. WPT There's some way go during that. that. that yeah. Um, Come back some months. Because yeah. it's like crazy. Benny Blanco in chat yeah. says, yeah. can we get Phil a veggie burger at least? Like a big deal? <laughs> <laughs> Robbie? No, it's super fun. Thanks, Benny. Uh, this uh, summer, 100% The tournaments in Australia are much better than here. Is there, like, is Californians in Vegas here? You hear like casino, you think very. Yeah. 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 It's very sick, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. That sounds. Really fun. Hmm. You're talking about Australia. Never been. Australia. It's about a 20 something hour flight. No, no, I think they're in a lot of Washington, I think. It's sunny like an Yeah, so up and to the right, I think. Yeah. I, which is a beautiful place to visit. Oh, yeah, yeah. I love Seattle. Now, talking about Seattle, Washington. Beautiful place. A lot of weed growers out there. Um. We got Yang and Al going at it. Little street poker here. Sorry. Yang's got the eight three suited, and you know I like that Yang is just not a he's not a he's not a giver upper. He, he tanks a little, but you never call on that hand. Yeah, usually like uh, the main event, it's like two k. Mm -hmm. Probably gets like three hundred k up top. Okay. And like that's kind of cool. There's a five k. There's a ten k. Oh, but this is Australian dollar, so like oh, uh, um, yeah. thirty percent. Wait, where's this at? Thirty percent less. No, not Crown, right? Where? Talking about WP, uh, WP. Gold Coast? Gold Coast. Gold Coast? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, like, it's, it's good. It's like beaches. You just chill. Why, why hasn't Gold Coast uh, picked up the Aussie Millions? Uh, it's a different Bottom. casino. Like yeah, the, but it's like a it's a Crown issue that doesn't run anymore, right? Yeah, but both casinos have issues. <laughs> what? Like the oh. same issues. You know how much it costs? Right, so they, the could, so they couldn't run anything yeah. bigger, you're saying. 40 bucks? 
I think it's like a branding thing. Like you gotta buy. They didn't. They haven't organized like buying the rights. Whatever. We call it. We call it the Aussie something else. Yeah, yeah. And also like the. It's not a priority for the casinos. Also, they're getting like very grilled on like made from by the regulator. Yeah. Thousand dollars. So they're not really interested in doing any poker. Who would have known, Will? So Money like laundering. Like anymore, so illicit activities involved with casinos. Never would have thought it. Never would have thought it at all. <laughs> it's like a gaming nice. yeah. you look good in um, it. So Whenever like, anybody else wears that crocodile like, jacket. For, like, money laundering. Oh, God, that looks sick. Yeah. Like, I got pictures of Alan Keating in it. Oh, yeah. my God, he yeah. looks so good Aren't, aren't cash like, games illegal like, in Australia? Uh, guys just look amazing. No, poker? They're legal, yeah. but uh, you, you have to have a license, time. and the only people that have licenses are the yeah. casinos. Yeah, yeah you wear it on the show, yeah. man. But they're legal in the casinos. No, no, no. Yeah. Legal. I can't even it's kind of like shut. here. No, but it's the same. No, no, no. So Brad Owen had, like, a stream somewhere. Somebody else had a stream. You're not allowed to stream cash games. Yeah, yeah. You can't You're not allowed to stream cash games anyway. I got five jackets that cost over $25. No, no, no. There was a casino over the summer. Oh, just over the summer. I could go over there. There was playing some, in Vegas and what's the country? The yeah. Berkey and Yang going to war here. And if Yang's graphics are correct, he just floated Berkey with Jack Deuce off. But I mean, you'd know. I have what I know. Berkey appears to have top hair on the flop. Now he's got a gutter to go with it. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? I think it's. I figure it's healthy. He's gonna check it. There's a lot. No, a lot of Asian countries. Vietnam. They let you do tournaments and not cash. Not cash. Yeah, yeah. Taiwan. That's what it probably is. Yeah. So they allow tournaments, but not yeah, no uh, cash games. Which is one. interesting, because I but mean, tournaments aren't gambling, right? They, they, the way they get around it is they a cash game is a timed tournament. So you buy in with imaginary chips, and then in two hours' time, they just count how many chips you are, and they pay you out. Ah, very smart. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> or or how whatever time whatever you want yeah them. whatever like Seven. loophole they have. Yang's gonna step on the so gas you have to here. Play those two hours or whatever. Yeah, yeah, you have to you have to play this. Yeah. Like a tournament. Like yeah, it's, it's like, like a tournament. At seven k, and the blinds? Berkey's or not no, going no. anywhere. <laughs> it's just the same. All these loopholes. Yeah. He's gonna so call. Stupid, like, you, yeah, you I mean, I, I I really don't understand. What amazes me are like uh, poker players from China. They can't. And the river's a total brick. Oh, Is Yang gonna uh, take yeah. Berkey to Value Town here? I, I think he might. Yeah, it's weird. Okay. Uh, oh, I want to see how it looks on stream. A lot of games in China. Right. Underground. Right, 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 right. Because yeah. right. right. like those players are great. You're like, Yang might no just way. want to check They're this back, but he's yeah. thinking, yeah. Uh, what does Berkey have? Can I get him to call with a ten, maybe even a nine? Have that All right. Which one? Yeah. He thinks his yeah. jack is good. He's gonna I bet it. Suited, not Broadway. Conne uh, yours is con connected. Connected I, suited Broadway. Yeah, yeah, connected. Yeah, mine was connected non suited. He overbets. Nine ten. What, what suit? Diamonds. Fuck, I was... I, diamonds. <laughs> Nine, ten of diamonds. It looks I mean, good, I right? Mean, like, I mean, uh, what a wild, I wild river. I really good I read by Yang. Just targeting Berkey yeah, for, like, the hero like call here? Like yeah, I think he's making it look <laughs> suspicious. Unless, you know, something's off with the graphics. I think he is really putting Berkey on what he has. And Berkey's wondering, what does this guy have? I got top pair. I got a... King blocker for the straight. Pretty much like one hand I'm all in. Definitely enough room to check raise. Berkey might be considering the check raise. It looks obviously super strong, and his hand shouldn't be good that often. You know, I think a lot of the super pros would say check raising is better than calling here. I think he's going to stick it in. I think he's going to go for it. Well, look at that look. That is a serious look. I mean, really tough for me. Yeah, because if I, I mean, you can hope for tens or jacks. Yeah, I got a, I got a hope, right? Yeah, or tens or queens of feather, you're kind of in trouble. That looks like a call right there. He's counting out the calling chips. You does he want to? Does he want to turn his hand to a bluff, though? Yeah, I was actually. I was thinking about it. Like, um, everyone's really friendly. In yeah, Canada, like, it's just such a track. I mean, how far. do you get here, Virgin Atlantic? What do you do? First class. Obviously. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> I, mean, <laughs> I think he's Duh. gonna pay him here. <laughs> Duh. Please. So, first I'd class and an ambient. First class and an ambient, you're fine. But if you, if you go there, you should probably stay for like a little bit because it's a bit of a. Yeah, those yeah, a physical thing. tells yeah. sort of indicate that he's so probably not going like for that. the raise. Crocodile Dundee is my yeah, raise seems off the table now. <laughs> Grew up watching Just debating a call or does he want to lay it down? There's, there's, there's not stops, obviously, to. No, I think no. it just stopped. Oh, no. Looks like it's going um, in. He wants to put it in. You can it see is, the physical Sydney motions. Sydney, but Sydney, it's like, it's like. He's been known to station. You have to, going, it's like it's like going from LA to Vegas. It has to be a pretty long vacation because from, you from need to Sydney go to New Zealand as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. New Zealand I is right there. driving if it's only an hour. No, driving you can't. Driving is probably not oh. good. Idea. And he calls and dangerous. 
No, it's like... Yang shows the jack deuce. Wow. <laughs> Berkey is not happy. Gets hit with the overbet from jack deuce. Not even the bounty game. Not even jack four, you know? But man just went for it with jack deuce. <laughs> this guy's got it. This guy, I don't even think this guy races cars, honestly. I think he races spaceships. That's, that's my new read on him. I mean, you watch Drive to Survive, these F1 guys are literally out of their minds yeah. to do what they do, so. This guy just, he just took a freaking Starship Trooper to the I mean. racetrack, and I don't even know what happened, but that was I awesome. I you jammed with your set of I know, I thought, I thought for sure, I'm like, please call. Like, I well, please ha a but I mean, you had like a, I know, I but you're like, yeah, you couldn't worry about it. You would have I just wanted him, yeah, I thought like, for sure. There was, he was nothing, no straight, no flush, no nothing. And like, tits, tits, and I'm like, what are you, wow. I already knew it when he was tanking, I was like, damn it. Oh, shit. Shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I'm like. I'm giving too much people too much credit, even right now. I'm like one of them. Matt, here's your Valentine's Day gift. Either one of them. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Hello, everybody. That was so stupid. Corey, here's your no Valentine's Day gift. Thank you. Appreciate that. Yeah. Here, I'll keep that. Fun. Perfect. Thank you. Got it. Thank you. Okay. One two one yeah. two. It appears Phil's taking a little break. The steam is still settling in the air. Maybe taking a walk, getting some fresh air, maybe a little jog. Who knows, but the way things have gone, you know, between last night and tonight, he's got to be fuming right now. He's been doing a lot of working out. He, like, tweets about it these days. Yeah, what he dropped, like, he dropped, you know, there's a gym just one floor up. He might be doing some quick squats or something. Who knows with Phil? The problem is he has to fly with those things. Yeah, that's right. You bring enough for the whole casino. Is this like spin the bottle? Your hand, <laughs> He's probably. Yeah. To carry that shit in his luggage. I was. Uh, I, I talked to. Um, I. I, I, I uh, uh, what's the thing? Barry Burn, wait, Barry Greenstein. Greenstein. You know how he used to like uh, at tournaments, he'd give a book to whoever busted him out at the at the World Series of Poker. Right. Uh, they ace on the river, and he signed the book and give it to whoever. But he did that for years. I asked him why he stopped doing that shit. Cause, cause they, they too many people of, read the book. No, he got tired of carrying the books. Oh. In the tournament. Imagine you he busted carry. too many people. No, no. Yeah, but <laughs> you got to bring the no when he uh, when you he, they bust him. He signs oh, the book. Okay. But the problem is, is traveling with the books. Yeah. yeah, Barry got a little too old to carry those books around. They're hard. They're they're not a paper. You know, they're they're hardcover or whatever they call. You know, those those heavier books. So he was lugging, you know, a package of books to every tournament stop, bringing one to the table, and then you know he busts and. Honestly, he probably just got tired of signing those puppies after busting. I mean, you know, like some euro knocks you out deep in a 1500. Do you really want to sign your book and give it to him? Yep. I wouldn't want to. I'd be on Rage Tilt, but the, yeah. the fossil man's sure. still out there doing his fossil thing every time he fossil's gets Fossil's still giving out fossils. He's real solid, but he's a little different than Barry. You know, fossil man won the main event. Barry, Barry had a different story. He had to grind. That is true. And he still grinds, by the way. You'll yeah. see him around the LA Super, casinos. The definition of a solid grinder, Barry Greenstein, one of the legends of the game. Great. Hey, fold. Did you get on Amazon? Seven, fold, fold, He's fold. working. I told him literally yesterday, get on Amazon. So he's working on it. But oh, so we, I do think we're finding out some I info. I, I think the hot sauce Amazon. is JD's, oh, and um, then, like, they're trying to get it on Amazon. So jumped in by, you know, midday. Yeah, that's awesome. Thank you. you know, like, and you know what uh, Woody Allen said? 95% <laughs> of success is showing up. I you got to teach your fucking kid that, dude. I 100% agree with that. You know what I mean? If you can't, if you can't get it on Amazon, you know... You heard it, guys. 95% of success yeah, yeah, is showing up. And and that's why I'm here today in the booth with Yale. And it's all you need to do these days. And a non-refrigerated product like that is getting on Amazon. These guys know so much. It's heavy to ship, though. Well, Amazon has a whole drop ship. Well, they program, do it. Which is great. Yeah, yeah but they... Not. It's not heavy. They're, they're not heavy. That's something you could get into, Will. Maybe you could be an Amazon drop shipper in your next life. You know, I'm set up a, set up a little biz. I, I might be <laughs> making an early appearance in the Amazon drop ship world. <laughs> it fits in a priority so mail envelope. So you can ship it anywhere in the country for $8 guaranteed. Some serious shipping tips here. If anybody's listening. You could ship 20 of those anywhere in the country for priority mail. Doesn't, doesn't Amazon have free shipping? How does that work? Yeah, but when you're, you're setting it up, the business up, 
I, somebody has to pay for the shipping, you know? It's, it's a business side yeah. that pays for the shipping. Yeah, I mean. Uh, and, and, uh, so, like, mm -hmm. basically, when you buy Amazon for free shipping, somebody's paying for the shipping. Yeah, yeah, but is it the business or is Amazon, um, like, taking the... I mean, it's coming out of the business in the end. Yeah. In trouble for the mad genius here. Flop's bottom two, and the accountant has top two. He's in a world of hurt. If the accountant decides to fast play this, it's it's going to be painful for the mad like genius. You ship your product to like an Amazon exactly. warehouse or something, and oh, they, they hold it. They 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 yeah, yeah, they hold yeah. it. Yeah, but you got to be pretty successful by the time you do that. Yeah, uh, you need, you have to do like large quantities for that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's only we're going to get like, the next 000. day shipping. Yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, it takes too long. Yeah. But I don't purchase anything unless it's next yeah. day shipping. I, I mean, Amazon's not that big in Australia, so. Eric with a big raise, and accountant's just going to call, so Eric might have a chance to get saved here. Same day shipping on Amazon in LA, and then it stops after the pandemic. There's like no Probably not on that turn, though. There is in Vegas. He's going to feel good about his two pair. So, the same day shipping? Yeah. You used to have that in LA. It's amazing. Not a ton of, mo not a ton of money behind either. No, accountant's pretty shallow, so. He may want to just rip it in on this turn, although accountants got to be a little bit curious about what Eric has. How long you fly to Thailand? Uh, uh, end of the week. I mean, uh, how long you, you fly to there? Uh, how long how, does it take? How many hours? Oh, uh, no. You can't go there directly. Uh, 17 or something. Oh. Yeah. You, you I just sleep the whole time. All I ever ask is like, does it have a, my like travel agent I'm like flat bed? He's like, I got it, flat bed. Yeah, flat it's like bed. I don't give exactly. a shit what it is except it, it literally doesn't matter. You just, it's like I don't give a fuck. Helmuth is still, a still nowhere to be I found. To, uh, Thailand, uh, April. April? Yeah, festival. I wonder if he's meditating. Thailand oh. festival. Yeah, yeah. Really, oh. just very fun. Really. Centering himself. Well, what's the festival? festival? What's it for? The the Thailand New Year, you know. Oh. oh. Trying to get full zen. April. I think I will yeah, April. Be there. I Accounts in the yeah. tank here. First time for me going to Thailand. You can get anything on on delivery, and it's like how really? So oh, that's I, I was ordering like groceries, yeah, like sparkling water and stuff like that. I got so I whether he wants to like call or ship it in. I think we got a little Hollywooding going on as well. Yeah, you think this is going in? No, just generally. I've seen the accountant play. Yeah, likes to put on a show. Well, we are in LA. An accountant folds. Oh my God, the mad genius with a another incredible play, getting accountant off the top two. I mean, is is that right? What just happened? No, yeah. That's a. I feel like the accountant is just like a totally different poker player today. I've commentated him on him so many times. I just could never imagine him folding that hand ever. It's not like it's the first time I've seen him play, and I have no idea what's going on. It's like the equivalent of applying for a seller's permit. Yeah. And don't tell me you didn't do that, right? Yeah, he did yeah. do that, right? He applied for so a seller's permit. So in order to permit. go here, is it like, nonstop? I think it's nonstop. It's, it's easier from Sydney. Yeah. But, um, a point to go to Thailand, I have to go to seller's like, permit. You know what I mean? Yeah, Taipei. Yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah. But I'm yeah. saying, it, you know, no, like we have Sydney's not that bad. You get a camera license, it's like all kinds of shit. You get certified. Anyway, oh, that's it. Yeah, he's he's awesome. Me? I was thinking like always trying to go to Bali. That one, that's on a to-do list. It's one of one of the things that gets done. I think. Like I can give you a whole list of two hours long one to do. Oh, yeah. You want to have a shopping cart on the on the on the website? So you didn't like one of the Bahamas would be like hell. He has that. Yeah, yeah, he has that. And he has a, rather than you doing Amazon, he did. One of the producers just notified me. He did the other one. That there is going to be a classic. This is the competitor to Amazon. Phil Helmuth moment. In the next hour or so. so stay tuned into this stream. On something small like that. Yeah. Because it's going to be a Phil Helm special. Do you know what cracked me up about your brother? He goes, Oh, I know this guy. I, I'm traveling with him. And I wouldn't send a stranger here. And he totally sent a stranger to the house. He lost Phil for a little bit, eh? They're, got, they're blowing up the yeah. phone. I'm getting, and I, they're like Arab and stuff. You, know, you, know, you have no idea who you're sending. And he goes, you know, oh, and he vouches for him and stuff. You know, I, I don't know what <laughs> on Dude. earth he was thinking. For today, thinking. maybe not. Yes, he goes, I know this guy. I know yeah. this guy. He didn't know the guys well, at all. And then he, he gets me on he gets me on conference call with everybody. So like so I got the driver, the owner of the company, him. I go, you know how much I make an hour? like, hell. Yeah, he made it I don't know why he didn't. This is what he said. Go pick yeah, it up and make it your problem. 
You actually, you, you unintentionally made it. Oh, so he has me doing yeah, all these speakerphone calls. <laughs> and it's actually the same. So it's just like it feels yeah. like you're just yeah, like getting sorry, robbed out here. I'm just getting robbed. He's a great guy, but yeah, yeah, but I'm Jeez. saying like, like Are the games I, I there no good? and then I you tried to get told with my AAA card and they didn't show up. Yeah, it was insane. Yeah, the whole thing was insane. It was insane. Is the call? And I, I told him. I know the guy. I know the guy. He was the guy that he got. You're just calling. Yeah, that's the guy sending the guy. And the guy he sent was like some terrorist guy. Yeah. Well, it certainly wasn't that, but it was it was way too complicated. For sure. Well, shit. I think I could have anything here. I have to call. I have about anything. So let's go. God, we're wild. Keep it ugly. Check. And he said, I just want a car to drive my my <laughs> my brother to have a car to drive when he comes. To Limp pot here. I mean, he's not gonna go to Palm Springs and pick up. Yang's the car got middle pair. Back to live with the bike. Like that's a nuts. And even if the car could do that, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's so funny. It's a great car though, right? Yeah, yeah, it's awesome. We got so much attention when we took that thing around. Like everybody, everybody loved it. It's the only Tesla that gets attention. Yeah, it really is. It's unbelievable. Just four players to the turn. Check. Eric turns the nut flush draw. Check. Check. Five thousand. Look at this over bet. Yeah, and Eric's just been in the zone today. It's all yours, Eric. You bought it. Sorry to, get, sorry to give you guys the bad news. No. Oh my god. I forgot what about that game. What was yeah. it? Oh, and the Jack four. Ball. That was a good bet. Yeah. That, that, was, that was very. Oh, I'm glad I forgot about that. I might have been tempted. Yeah. Well, but the four was good, right? Four was good. But that would have been a, that would have been a perfect uh, well, pocket four is a good bet. What a, what a perfect time. Man, I forgot how good this game was. I've been playing like we got a little FadedSpade.com. Valley's Big Bet Poker is proud to feature world-class Faded Spade playing cards. Use code BIGBET, it gets you 15% off a two-deck set of the new 3.0 version at FadedSpade.com. Code BIGBET gets you 15% off. Check them out. Beautiful cards, just big faces. Big suits. Yeah, you like you like those jumbos. Yeah, I only uh, in my home games. I only use Faded Spade. Are you the you're the, you're the host of home games? No, no, no. If if you had a home if game, if I had a home okay, I would have Faded Spade. Just beautiful cards. Made it nice and Do they use Faded Spade on apps? Right, extra hundred really did it. <laughs> it's, it's above my pay grade, buddy. And those clicks are heavy tonight. <laughs> Check. Not, not many people connecting with the flop, and yeah. Phil is still yeah. gone. He's yeah. really taking a long break. I'm dying to know if anybody's seen him out there. I feel like he might have hit the spa, Check. you know, Check. just cooled off, then a schvitz, maybe a cold Check. tub. Check. Really get his mind right and try to turn things around in this session. You think he's capable of a namaste? Just like in general, I can see it in him. I feel like he's got it in his range. Oh yeah, how do you yeah. like that curve? I hate it. Just always reminds <laughs> me of that curb. <laughs> yeah, and the, and the like point you is go to yoga. All right, so you know you work it out a little bit, yeah, but can you namaste? That, that I'm not a big yoga guy, are you? I've done it like twice, but I refuse to namaste. Just not doing it. What is namaste when you have to put your hands together? Yeah, yeah, yeah. At the end, like you, I don't, I don't even know, dude. This, yeah. you and I are not those types of people. No, I'm not a big namaste. -er. You know, I mean, that, like that yeah, card is yeah, yeah. especially hard. But I'm a big fan of yoga. Really? Yeah. And then, um, especially since and Lululemon it, and these companies came out with their new technologies, it's really, really really taking the yoga cool. to the next and level. The Just in terms of flexibility, like different positions, made it a much more enjoyable yeah, then, experience so for, for everyone, really. Can't disagree with you there. I like seeing... Do some drunk fit I like seeing their clothing yeah. when I walk around the streets. <laughs> I look at yeah, we'll just leave it at that. Lululemon, incredibly just comfortable. comfortable. Yeah. They're not a sponsor yeah. either, but yeah. gotta give a little shout out there. Yeah. Just great product. The Tesla is hard ass to I bet Berkey's got a lot of Lululemon. Right. It is so hard. And then you get in, you got no power steering, you know our driveway. Oh How god, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, holy but shit. I'll tell you, that car is the sh that car is that is gonna be worth a bucket. 
I don't know, man. They made too many of those. There's only 500 of them. No, they made thousands of them. No, there's. You're talking five, the one year they made 500, but it's not the first it, year. Well, mine is the first year, and it's a V1. There's 500 of those. Oh, that's okay. what you want is the V1. Oh, that's the first year. Then. Yeah. Okay. You want the V1. Do you know what what number it was off the line? I have I have 215, 440, and 370 or something. I'm getting a little out of line. And it, it's like a, um, it's hard to figure out how to charge it. And like, yeah, yeah, they're, they're not, they're not, they're, they're, they're not, they're, ba from, they're, they're beta you cards. Tell Elon's, Elon's point. He goes, oh yeah, I'm just gonna make it, you can plug it into any outlet. Yeah. And you go, God, it's so different from the Tesla. Robbie, now. going yeah. for some value. A thin little slice. There was, there's 500 of the V1s, there's 1,000 of the V1.5, and there's 1,000 of the v You can st see the steam kind of forming I'm around the accountant's shoulders. Be he might just be curious here. No, that was great. It doesn't really I, beat I anything, but he just so folded top to two to the mad genius. You can really, you can only fold so many times in a session, Will. That's one of the rules of poker. It's not legal to do it too much. Here's the time chip. I think we get a call here. I think, I think we're very live for a payoff. And if you, if you keep it at 50%. An accountant does pay. That's what you need to do, 50%. Robbie with the beautiful value bet on Valentine's Day. I think he called before. Mm -hmm. But you don't want to do that if you're just, you know, that's it. You're going to drive it. If you're going to use it. If you're going to go yeah. take it to Palm Springs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Got it. That's why. Okay, that's why. <clears throat> I was really glad you figured that out. I'm really glad you just said that because I've been leaving my other one on a whole blast. So. No, no, no. Yeah, you don't want to do that. That's like the worst thing you can do. But I mean, yeah. eventually they're going to have replacement batteries in those things with like 400 mile ranges or something. They already do. You can sign up right now for the um, for the V3 battery, uh -huh. and then it, is, it goes zero to sixty in two point nine seconds, so it's way faster, and it goes three hundred fifty miles. And you can. I'm I'm, sign, I'm signing up for it right now. You need to get the suspension looked at on on that on that, that orange that car. One. Yeah, it, it had something wrong. These guys are still talking but cars, and meanwhile, the, the race car driver's been pretty quiet. That's the way it is. Probably yeah, thinking, I don't I'd love to see these guys on the track next to really me. Bottom, bottom, you can feel it. Just yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe it has like that. Well, you'll know. Chat, tell us what you think yeah. the race car driver drives. And, uh, and the, uh, maybe we'll give the winner a personal the tough convo. That car is, it'll tell you the uh, tires are low when they're not. Time low. Traveler yeah. Poker so says, so you know. WTF, Phil play cards, seat open. <laughs> <laughs> seat open right now for Phil. It's We're still not sure where he is or what he's doing. Awesome. Taking a lengthy break here. Oh man, they want to see Jaffe in the game. That's that's what they're calling for now. You well, didn't hey, you guys got steak kings? Put a package together. <laughs> I get rid of the plate though. Plate so it's my Tesla, and you can't drive it. No, no, the Tesla. That plate is the, is you know. No, that, wait, I get rid of the uh, lining. The lining. Yeah, that one's terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The actual my Tesla on it is okay. from the founder of Tesla. That was his plate. And he, when this guy went and go, the guy that bought it went to go pick it up. He goes, hey, what are you going to do for plates? And he goes, I don't know. And his wife had just a gotten a Mr. Tesla. The real founder of Tesla. He had just gotten Mr. Tesla. So he gave him my Tesla. Wow. So that's from the founder of Tesla. That is, that's really valuable. Because then it's got, you know, Providence. Yeah. It, what it, kind it, of Tesla do you drive? Tesla's car. You know, I'm a was, big Tesla truck guy. I have a couple of those <laughs> at home. It wasn't uh, just for the car. kind of heavy off-terrain type of driving I have to do sometimes. Mm. I like Rivian better. Okay, let's You're a Rivian guy? Oh, yeah. I mean, if we're talking trucks so now, uh, on the electric yeah. side, yeah. Yeah, those things are pretty. I like the headlights. You just say I got it from the guy I bought the car from. And yeah, yeah. Four. 1,200? Oh. What? I don't get how it's not from. He didn't own that car. He just had the so, plate. So, he, so the founder of Tesla's car is gray with orange. He ordered orange with gray. So the, uh, oh, the founder of Tesla hand-delivered it to him and said, hey, this car's just like mine. What are you doing? Because it's the opposite. What are you doing for the license? We got a super chat from license. Matt. Mr. Tesla. Oh, Here, you want Thank you, Matt. He wants to know when is Berkey getting a tough <laughs> conversation. <laughs> First super chat of the night. I mean, got it. you got to direct him at will. Respect. Yeah, you know, it's... Uh, it's always possible. Um, Berkey's towed the line pretty carefully. He's, he's done a good job of staying out of trouble. And uh, yeah, if he, uh, you know, if he, if he, if he, if he crosses that line, it's on the table. Oh my God! Right? Yeah. Now it's Yang betting the Ace Four off here. Sorry, Ace Four suited. And Al's got a clean high flush draw, two over cards, and a bottle of Habo in front of him. Yeah, so you know why. Yeah. 
Any good Mexican recs? I know there's a lot of good Mexican food in LA, so chat, throw your Mexican recs in there. Yeah, really Tacos, yeah. enchiladas. Yeah. 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 So I could tease you if you could come out, so go to a restaurant, could grab a drink, they could run stupid. around, you yeah. know, like just... When I was in Vegas this trip... And the river's another yeah. club. Is yeah. Yang's going to give up and... Lecture at the table. Do you know what that fox on Al's shirt is? I've been kind of curious the whole time. It looks like a fox with a mug of beer. Yeah, on two stocks. Yeah. Yeah, what'd you guys do? Warren Buffett doesn't do that. Maybe chat knows. I have zero clue. Chat, let us know what that fox is. We got a lot of shirts today, and um, that's the one that's been stumping me the most. I know the first responder for fires. That kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, so I hear about the gossip that poor. I knew about that. We got two and a half hours left in this stream. Bally's presents live at the bike, the world's longest running high stakes poker series. 100, 200, no limit. 200 big buy and Annie. Robbie Jade Lou making her return. Playing solid. Phil Helmuth up from the table. He's on complete full blown. Okay. As Robbie sips the red wine. She does love wine. She was always drinking wine in those Joey interviews. Yeah, she was. That's right. Yeah, and Helmuth is still nowhere to be found. Um, you know, at this point, he could have taken a, a run, hit the spa, got a little light workout in, had a schwitz, meditated, and had a bite to eat. But uh, we don't know where he is. Aussie Al and the, the driver are starting to go into it, and the driver ain't folding here. Really like, really like Yang style. Very fearless. Right? Like, and, I mean, like, um, should we, like, energy? Ooh, that is a right. spicy flop. You guys like the wine? Brought to you Pretty by Habo Hot Sauce. Pretty good. It used to be my favorite. What is, is it? Cayman. It's Cayman. Oh, yeah, of yeah. course. Yeah. yeah. You get that all the time. Uh, That's the one they have, like, at a, at um, every, like, the highest, it's, like, the highest level of every casino, right? Like, all the time. No, they have Opus there. I was drinking oh, okay. Opus. Opus is my all-time favorite. I was drinking Opus this sure. weekend. Alan Keating was buying Opus for the table, one bottle yeah. after another at the Super Bowl. That's uh, cool. Alan's amazing. Like, it's like the fifth time I've been at a table and he's buying Opus for the whole table. Yeah. If you've played poker for I mean, an extended like period of time, chip. you've heard of Camus. Yeah, it, for it's him. the wine that yeah. all of the high stakes players like, drink. So generous, though. Yeah, yeah. He's just a good guy. Apparently, Albert Camus was some type of great philosopher yeah, or something. Yeah. I'm not sure on the details. They have Opus here. Cool. I love Meanwhile, Opus. Al's going to go for some more value, and Yang is not folding. Is he thinking about shooting this up? Definitely not folding. Not flush draw with the ace. He's going to call again. Spade on the river would be interesting. That's how you deal with real tilt, right? Nope, he hits a three. Backdoor clubs get in there, but... I'll go that way. Here he He's going to check, and I He's taking a shower, think Kyle's going to go for another value massage. bet here. <laughs> he went in a closet, you know, just to like. He's like meditating. Anger, ang angrily jerking in a closet. He's meditating. Oh, you're good. I didn't see it. What the fuck? Kyle doesn't like that river, so he checks back. I'll just take it down. <laughs> but he's not down. He's just not up. I heard someone talk about angrily jerking it. 50k or something. I have no idea what they're referring to. Sounds interesting. He's taking a walk. He's taking a walk. He's taking a bath. Yeah, he's taking a bath now. I think he, we may he, have found that Helmuth is actually uh, yeah. in a bath well, right now. Let's get him, guys. Pro probably like two. <laughs> get him. Helmuth has probably stuck like two grand. No. no, 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 no. He, he, he bought in for 300, right? Yeah, yeah so, no, so those are. He, he lost 160. I know, I'm just <laughs> like. <laughs> well, that yesterday. Like, if he's stuck here two, nights, two days in a row, oh gosh. We gotta get him back. Done. Here. Thanks for having me. Yeah, I mean, the only way to get out of this hole is to come back. Yeah, get him back. We're digging. Here. We're working. Like we'll we're get all that, a bunch right? Of, a bunch of amateurs, except for Bird. You mean the guy oh, stuck the most? Yeah, he can't. He can't be hiding from us. Another yeah. super chat, from will from Matthew yeah, Green. Good. What type of flower arrangement did Landon Tice buy his P.O. Silver for Valentine's Day? No, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> I'm thinking six roses, a couple daffodils, and uh, some nice uh, tiger lilies in there to top it off. You know that man loves his solver. Child of the Sim, he calls himself. Yeah. Hmm. We've got a little three-way here between the mad genius Aussie Al and the accountant. Ooh, and that is a flop that is going to put a lot of accountant's money in Aussie Al's bank account. You can just wire that money directly to Melbourne. Um, if these if these graphics are right, then. Accountant's going to be donating a 25 piece, and Eric's actually going to get in there in the middle, but 
call. Accountant just calls. Had a chance to save himself. Hmm? Uh -huh. Turn completes a flush. You know, Mad Genius is thinking about doing something here. He's gonna lead. The first misstep of the night from the genius. I mean, and when you're that smart, you're naturally gonna make some mistakes. Accountant quickly calls, and Al is just sitting there with top boat. I mean, he's just thinking about Vegas and the fucking Mirage. How much money can I get in from these guys? 126k deep? Look at that stare down. And he shoots it up. He knows where he's at. One of these guys has something. We gotta pile some more money in this pot. Make it a 10 ball. Mad Genius is quickly done, and the accountant's in a dicey spot here. Only 20k behind. I'll tell you, that Bulldog's not gonna be happy if he makes this call. He uses a time ship. You know, these guys don't have a lot of time when you think about it. There's a 60 second clock, I believe, and they only have a few time chips, so Count's really going through it here. He's got a real decision. Gonna fold? No. Puts the chip back over the cards. He's he's going through the ringer. Every emotion. Hey, do they have opus here? He can't love his spot. Said, yeah, Flush beats so. him now. But he's got trips. Let's do it. Sure. The clock is ticking for the accountant. What is there? Probably a thousand, a little less than a thousand. I think it should be five hundred. Because the markup, that? no, the mark, no, no, it's gonna be. You know the IRS does not like to pay. At least 600, 700. They like to take money, you know. They don't like to give it. Well, no, let's do an over not a fan of them. Say under 600. Yeah, Accountant doesn't work directly for them. He works for his own firm. Uh, we yeah. found that out. Oh, he just gave it away. Huh. But I was including tip. Oh, okay. There you go. <laughs> Accountant, I think using another time chip. <laughs> just has no idea what to Can do. We get cocktails? Yeah. I can't blame him. It's a gross spot. You gotta think Al is either sort of going crazy with a bluff or your your hand's no good. Yeah, she didn't, um, well, we're not gonna say that. Michael, I saw that. She does that with cocktails? Kind of one is in the pain. We've all been there before. Yeah. Yeah, you kind of wonder what to do. You kind of wonder if he can put it in here, though, after this whole song and dance. Yeah, he's, make, he's gonna make the fold. Great fold from the accountant. And that is just another example of the IRS not giving any money away to the people. It is. I never like a full glass of wine with that either. Well. Hey, can we see the wine list? Yeah, Just let us know what Opus 1 very fancy. But that was possibly a good fold. Accountant releases and immediately goes for the Opus 1. He likes to river a song. Tell me it's been gone at least half an hour now, it feels like. Historically. Landon Wonder, did he fall asleep? He, he does get there. He does get there every time. Historically, he rivers flushes. He had a really crazy fold. That we played. Landon Tice has informed me in chat that he did not give himself the nickname because, of course, you don't give yourself your own nicknames, which is true. He has it. It's actually not in my case. I am Dankness3. That was my first online screen name because Dankness2 was taken. I'm Live King Poker on YouTube, and my friend Brandon gave me the nickname Live King because I suck at poker, but I'm good at live poker, so I'm his guy in that regard. Hey, it's never too late to find new friends, my man. <laughs> The roasting of Phil continues in the chat. Phoenix TTD says Phil thinks he will lose less if he plays less. Can we just blind him? Hey, out? I mean, so far in LA, <laughs> it's not untrue. New rule: That's you're getting That's blinded cool. out if you're going to step outside. I wonder if Phil might be studying Pio. You'd have a heart attack. Is that possible? <laughs> I don't think white magic and Pio go together, but what I can tell you is we got Melissa in chat. She's giving her roommate a nickname. Landon Breastfeed Tice. Jesus, what's going on with all this breastfeed between Tice and Perky? Is that how they're raising these eggs? I don't want to touch this stack, but it went like... 
really in the okay, thank you. Savage. I would stay out of Melissa's way. Yeah, that's right. She's, yeah. she's 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 like you. You want it you want to stay out of you know, unless you want to get chopped up. Yeah, we'll you look stay out you stay out of Will's way. before you coming coming on the highway. You don't you don't run into it. You you swerve. Berkey with the ace jack of hearts. And the driver is gonna get in there with the fours. Al's gonna defend the Queen Nine off. The stack is building, the hot sauce looks great. Uh, Eric, did you call for cocktails? Yeah, I got a bottle. Good. I mm. just put it on my account and spill it. Berkey flops middle pair with backdoor flush draw. I think he's gonna bet it. Probably just take it down unless Al wants to peel. Yeah, Al's gonna have to peel now because Berkey goes real small. <laughs> Super Bowl bet. Yeah. It's embarrassing. I can't say it. That was a Super Bowl bet. Say, oh yeah, that was oh, for and the last. The driver would have drilled a four. Problem. Yeah, don't say it was a, was a Super Bowl bet. A thousand bucks on a high stakes game. Not a yeah. man. Okay. I go, listen. I go, are you kidding? He's texting me and goes, and I got checks. Me Al might be tempted to bluff I'm at like this. Stuck like four hundred thousand. <laughs> <laughs> don't think it's gonna I'm work though. This table's very fitting for me. Okay. Well, I didn't. I didn't know. And then, he, and then he insisted. I go, I got a PayPal address. He goes, what's your address? But then I realized once. Once he bought in for the, now I gotta pay him back right away. Right. I'm in Al's gonna go oh for it. I don't think it's gonna work. Sorry, Eric. That was a bad weekend. Sorry, I, mean, I had a great weekend, but right, right, poker wise, right. I had a terrible weekend. Yeah. No, I was just, I don't know anything about football. Goes for the I, over bet. You know, I like yeah. that. I just wanted to have like some skin in the game. Repping a six. Yeah. I was betting uh, a, a twenty thousand dollars. I'm no solver wizard, but Berkey with a nice payoff. Oh well, it's gonna win the pot. You're running with the big boys. What can I tell you? Nice I mean, little pop for Berkey. He was kind of sliding there. Well, yeah. And down about a 50 sure. ball. Yeah. And a lot of them are bookies. They never learn. You know, in that game, like, you don't I mean, he, he did just pay off a 25K bet from the race car driver with t King 10, yeah. so. I, just I don't bluff Berkey. Well. I'm not sure Al saw that hand, though. And here we have Phil back. Maybe the man just needed to eat. Phil, we started blinding you out. I hope you're okay. We'll come back. Phil's back. He's going to buy the button. We still haven't figured out where what he did and where he was, but he's back in the game. Says he's good, but I'm not sure I believe him. One more. When I have games, we let people coming in between the lines. <laughs> He's coming back a little angry, maybe. Yeah, Phil might be steamed up. The vapors are rising. Between him and the accountant, it's, it's really, the temperature has really come up in that area of the poker table. Meanwhile, Robbie's just been so solid today, really using her image. Helmy's going to get in there with threes. And the mad genius has hooks. He's just going to call. Oh, I missed it. It was on the flop. Is Phil going to put out a little value bet here? Trying to target a deuce? Trying to target a deuce or ace higher. Is he, he going to overbet? What, what is he doing? He's amped up. Yeah, he's ready to go. He checks it. Eric's going to value bet, though. From what I know about the Mad Genius, he loves value. Seems like the type of guy who never gets a bad grocery deal, if you know what I'm saying. And Phil is just, he's not having a good night. He just doesn't. Comes right back to the table. First hand, Mad Genius is just bombing a five ball. And Phil looks like he's in the mood to pay this. And if he does pay this, <laughs> the steam is just going to continue to rise. He does pay it off. Of course, Mad Genius has the hooks. Another slice of value. More money to the creator of, was it the unicycle, did you say? or? Uh, some type of yeah, solar Luna, bicycle. That, Luna cycle. Luna cycle. No, sorry, not the unicycle. 
I believe that was Albert Camus. Can I, can I, if I say, if I, what would you lay me if I say, if I say he is exactly Jack's? And that's five no, no, it's amazing you? how he does that. He's done that every what time I've played with him. Uh, um, 10 to 1 or something? No, 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 come on. Straddling. How much? Straddling. Turn one, check, check? Yeah. Not very much. His most likely hand is Jack's. Four. Really? Yeah, for sure. I didn't even know. <laughs> we have some type of wager here. Phil's, Phil's looking to get odds. If I didn't know better, I'd say Phil's blood pressure is about 150 over 120 right now. I don't. He's taking off the investor jacket. He's, the sweatsuit is out. The heat is rising. And he gets King Jack off. Makes it 2K. And Robbie's in there with the King 9 off. Like one of you, he betted, and I like. And that's the call. I'm like, fuck. I'm that's like, not gonna get Phil paid. Too many jacks out there. Yeah. Not enough connection for Robbie. A lot of great jackets here tonight, Yale. The, the driver's got some nice pistols on his, on his sweatshirt too. Really, you know, I guess when you play high stakes, you, you could afford some nice clothes. I mean, if I knew the That's why you're just wearing a I mean, basic like blue tee and uh, yeah. some ripped The fans don't need to know what I'm wearing. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's a different type of pay grade right there. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, it was like when in doubt, <laughs> hit the OnlyFans. Yeah. I hope he gets jacked. Apparently, the rumor was Berkey might have to start an OnlyFans to pay in this game, but after hearing his house financials, I think he'll be okay for the time being. I'm like, well, flush, I'm drawing slam, and. Yeah. I think I mean, chat ripping yeah. Phil. They say he's wearing the same outfit as last night. Jeez. <laughs> Phil can't catch a break here. Relentless. The Aria shirt on full display now. One of the most beautiful rooms in the country. And Al picks up Kings and Helmius got Jack Four with the bounty on. Oh baby, this could get interesting here. Al's been pretty active. Hundred and. I don't think Phil's posturing here. The way things have been going with the bounty, the blood pressure rising. I think Phil might want to do something here. The return of Robbie Jade Lou on Valentine's Day and the J40. It's the, it's too good to be true. No, he's too solid. Damn. That that meditation break clearly paid off. Great fold. I almost made it 35,000. He was thinking about it, but I don't, I don't know. I'm not buying that one. Cool. I put 10,000 in there already. <laughs> right, Phil? If I wasn't going to call the 35, I wouldn't have put the 10 in. I would have made a 35. Ace and king. Not ace king, though. No, I'm not ace king. king. Berkey with another needle. Right. I'll tell you what, right now, if Phil gets ace-king, it's going in. The state he's in, it's not being folded. No. Phil Helmuth, the big spender. Down 63,500 so far. The mad genius, your favorite, Will. Is that what you just had? Up six figs. Guy has played flawlessly. Just above the rim poker all night. I like seeing Robbie Jade Lou in the black also. I'm a big fan. She's been playing real solidly. You did not have Jack for you. forgot to show it. Don't forget, Bally's Big Bet Poker is proud to feature world-class uh, yeah. faded spade playing cards. Use code BIGBET and it gets you 15% off two deck set of the new 3.0 version at fadedspade.com. Code BIGBET. Use it. Get a little bit off on a couple free decks. Faded Spade, the cards I would use if I did host a home game. You're too fucking rich. <laughs> I did get more Jumbo, of course. Was that a straddle? <laughs> Feel free to hold it. Let's go. Feel free to part with some of those chips. It seems. That's so fast. Oh, good, good call. I did get a lot richer. I did get a lot richer. Just on testing wow. coin. After, after, yeah, just on after, after all that thinking, I came like twelve thousand very quickly. What did you think about? You again. Huh? He's like uh, one of those um, irritants. He used to annoy me too when I sat next to him. But when you sit across from him, he's really good. 
<laughs> but I used to get bugged, but I sat right next to him. I'm sure he's a great guy. No, no, he's an irritant. <laughs> and we wanted him. We walked home. No, but right he next to him. No, he's just right a configuration there. for a reason. Yeah, right next to Phil. Okay. It comes the Phil. fucking best. He's, he's, he's the like, antithesis of Phil. He also <laughs> never wins, but he's a pleasure to be around. <laughs> <laughs> Berkey, just relentless. 10 for 10 with needles tonight. I like this version of Berkey. He's usually so tame. Yeah, he's usually just using a lot of big words, talking philosophically, but tonight he brought the heat for Helmuth. I'll, I'll buy the following bottle. I've never drank in my life. Okay, never mind. But if you don't start, now's the time. I was going to start, it sounds like that's Yeah, I, I would yeah. not start today. I don't know, I might need it. Yeah. No diamond in hand for Robbie. I fired myself from drinking a year ago. Yeah, Robbie kind of stepped in it against the driver, went for some thin value. The driver river to set. Robbie's not going to pay. She's been real solid tonight. This amount of Piku reservations too. You know, like tonight's like one of the busiest. This is like the river table. I had a queen. Nice hand. Shouldn't have let you get there after the turn, but city turn card. Where, where are you staying at? I mean, I will say I'm fucking stunned. Like, I'm stunned. I'm so used to win, 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 like 30 <laughs> all the time. Yeah. And now I lose 140. Wow. Which is okay. That's Keating. Hey, Phil, are That's you, a Keating do you have dinner sure. plans? But now? for me to be down 70,000 is like unthinkable. To me, to me unthinkable. In a especially in this hey, lineup. Phil, you want to have Am dinner? I right? Yeah, especially in this lineup. It's yeah. unthinkable. <laughs> hey, Phil, do you want to have dinner <laughs> afterwards? He'll pay. Eric will get it. It's Valentine's Day. Don't you have a wife? Oh, he pulled it no, he's no, big no. boy. Oh, okay, yeah. they Al's supposed to blast off 100, like, just doing some crazy shit. I, I, like, I, I, I blasted it off. At <laughs> five high. It was to everybody. What is supposed to blast it off to me? Uh, 400? What was, the biggest, uh, what was yeah. the biggest hand you lost last night? Did you win a, lose a big pot, or was that, like, a gradual? He called with king high in quite a big one. Actually, I had ace-10 that hand. Uh, I think the graphic was wrong. That would be a lot more reasonable. Yeah, the graphic might have been. A lot more reasonable. I mean, I'm, I'm, I, I told him I'm 99% sure it was ace-10, but it's possible. Helmuth explaining a graphical error led to his payoff, which would make a lot more sense knowing him. The line was still epic regardless. Don't care. Yeah. Yeah. Who knows? No way to know the truth now. With all the small ones. Well, he's winning this it always works day. when they we don't gotta, have a set. Like a so if they don't have a set, he it is works. He's a fucking menace, man. We gotta do this. Yeah. Absolute menace. Start time I put a chip in. Call, call, call. A raise. Yeah, yeah, that's only when you have ace king. <laughs> what else are you gonna do? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm stunned. My mind is spinning. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, so I guess Helmy oh, right. may not have yeah, actually really meditated. Just pork empty, right? okay. He probably just went and had a meal. Three, four, five, no, Linda McCabe is getting at me okay. in the chat. Respect. Live King giving out his player opinions quite liberally tonight. Jealous any? I'll take one, but don't give me two. Got me. Oh, no, it's odds three is a given. Eric, I can I confirm the Live King is a very jealous man. <laughs> when you had Jack, probably fools. I was calling. You maybe you were, maybe you weren't. Yeah. Yeah. It's time to play Even like with this. Yeah. I mean, What's just that? only that hand. No, I got it. I got it this time. Tight okay. cold, right? I'm pretty no, sure no you. Offense, I, but I, I got it this time. <laughs> <laughs> but you did good. Thank you. Uh, you, know, I'm I'm sure. Sure. you actually yeah. went through it. I'm pretty sure you have a pull there. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, oh. but, and I thought about that. Uh, but I, but I was like, I didn't say anything because I didn't hit her pattern. Yeah, yeah. Eric's too rich. Like yeah. That would have been the best acting job ever if you did that. But thank you. Check. Berkey raises the button, flops top pair, and a second enough flush draw. He's going to continue, and Mad Genius isn't going anywhere. Not a great hand, but he's got a gutter. What's the uh, fucking I can open it in a minute. I lose track of this stuff. Yeah, there's a lot of cards out there. <laughs> Not a huge difference. <laughs> the guy who bets in. Mad Genius has too many chips. He doesn't even know what to do with them. He's got two giant stacks. He's going to shoot it up. And Berkey's not going anywhere. I got it. Some resistance, finally. Genius turns middle pair. I wonder if this will slow him down. Berkey picks up a gutter. Genius is going to get up 5, 5k. This is definitely not getting through. Berkey with a quick call. The river's a brick. I think this is going to go check check. Unless Genius... I don't, I, I don't see how Genius wins this hand at this point. I think Berkey's kind of hoping he bets, and he checks. This is 
Berkey okay, want to go for some value. He's going to check it back. Genius says he got it. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like Berkey could have got a little value there, but. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck you're doing, man. You check crazy me. There were all spades out there. <laughs> oh, man. That was good. <laughs> all right, let's do it. It's Valentine's Day. It's time to get a little toast going. Ladies, can you bring all these players some champagne? It's a special occasion. What is this? We are here. Bally's Presents. Big Bet Poker live at the bike. Cairo loves you. We have Eric Hicks, JD Yang, the accountant, Aussie Al, Matt Berkey, and Phil Hellmuth, and, Phil Hellmuth <laughs> and Robbie in the building, you guys. Let's all grab this glass real quick before we get okay. into this next hand. Oh, uh, Matt, yeah. I know you don't drink, but. Yeah, I'll choose you guys some pre workout. Yeah, you can get your pre workout out. It's very special. You guys raise your glass real quick one time. Right. Happy Valentine's Day. We could be anywhere on Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Love is in the air. And to everybody watching at home, we hope you enjoy your Valentine's Day. And if nobody loves you, Kyra loves you, but especially Phil Helmuth loves you, you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Let's get back to this Jack 4 game. Hopefully there's some money. Right. There's one on that. I actually have a delivery. A delivery for Robbie. Oh, Robbie. Oh. We have a special oh. delivery for Robbie. Oh. Okay. Uh, so we got a toast here and a, a special delivery for Robbie. And definitely uh, take a look right here. Who are these from? All right. Is it from Garrett, is it? Thank you. Why don't you, uh, why don't you go ahead and read that, Robbie? I'm scared. Uh, yeah, be careful, Robbie. We got your back. What if I don't want to read it out loud? Oh, yeah, don't do it. Yeah, She's suddenly shy. Read it out loud. Just do it. Read it out loud. Read it out loud. Read it out loud. It's a special letter. Robbie, roses are red, poker brats get unglued. Bally's Big Bet Poker welcomes you. Tonight, try not to make Berkey get up and quit, too. P.S. These flowers cost $135,000. Oh, <laughs> hey. oh, nice. Thank you. Robbie, you. Yeah. Nice. And this let's, penmanship. Let's keep the action going, you guys. <laughs> Michael, if you would, take it over. Oh, my gosh. Very nice. Expensive flowers for Robbie. On Valentine's Day, it's only fitting. Wonder who sent those. Adorbs. Right. Adorbs. I hope you guys are treating your ladies out there well, treating your men well, treating your pets well. Valentine's Day is a day of love. We can hate the rest of the year. Let's let's make today about love. The drinks are really flowing now. Genius is looking for a refill. Champagne's everywhere. Wait, I I have a card. Sorry. I don't want it either. It just got really quiet. But I'm from back to the poker. It did just get quiet. Genius has like too many chips, and Helmuth has yeah. Cowboys. He's gonna limp. Five hundred. Oh, and Robbie's got Ace King off. This is gonna be trouble for her. Eric, you gonna pour him? Oh, sorry. You're gonna Look at Helmuth. He, he's real interested now. And Eric's going to raise with the queen nine suited. Mad genius getting in there. What's Helmuth going to do? He's got to put in a raise. No, he's just going to call. Wow. And now Robbie's got a decision with Ace King. She's just going to call too. Okay, so fireworks averted. Classic Phil trap. They said we have. Phil's trapping, but he's he's setting himself up if, if something happens here. So far, so good for Phil, and it checks around. Man, why wasn't he walking around with Jack 4 right now? <laughs> you get the value. Yeah, Jack 4 out good? there again. Five. Phil's going to bet, and I think he might just take this down. Unless Robbie's thinking about getting a little spicy here. No, nope, she lays it down. You got Jack Four? No shit. Phil just cannot yeah, catch a break jump. here. Yeah, you throw it and you get an extra money. But just calls with the kings. Flop doesn't connect with anyone. He takes it down. You had nines? Ace king. You had nine. You probably lost some minimum then. Hmm. You had two outs. No, three outs. You can say that again, Phil. She did lose the minimum there. 
the old three out, 30 percenter. You're ready for the Opus, Robbie. Thank you. I feel like I won the minimum there. I had kings. You did. Did you? How did you, Ooh, I wouldn't how did you end you up pre-flopped with three of us with kings? That's interesting. You can't lie, though. Uh, I, I thought maybe, I thought maybe, I, you I can thought see maybe him? I, okay. I, I since, since, since you had the jack last time, well, I thought good thing maybe I'm it was time to set it up. That was a trap. So, six, five, five, trap. It's six five. No, I mean maybe it comes clean on. He saw it. Red. Queen and, uh, yeah. Sorry. Maybe I'm gonna win a lot of money that hand. If you, uh, six wow. diamonds, five of hearts. That's pretty ballsy. Four, four. You really had pocket kings? Yeah. yeah. Two kings. Wow. JD picking up ace king of hearts. Beautiful hand. Five hundred. You raised, but then Eric. The type of hand you want to spend your Valentine's Day with. The driver in the small blind, ace jack off. Mm -hmm. and I just, yeah. He's just going to call. I should have three, that. Elmuth with queen eight of spades, and Al with eight five of diamonds. See so a flop four yeah, ways. Won one. You won the last one. Check, check, check. Not much for anybody except Al, who flops an eight high flush draw. Turn is a brick, and I think Al might just take this down with a bet. Six thousand. Phil with the overbet. Six, six thousand. Al's confused. Four. Phil's gonna take it down. Four. Nice play for the poker rat. Getting a little momentum back. <laughs> Always feels good to scoop a pot when nothing's going your way. Just the feeling of the chips coming to your stack. It's a, Could have been a much bigger pot. magnetic redistribution of good feelings. He's targeting. Me. He said he's going to call when I check for his board. Different with those two people in it, yeah. I need to show him the nuts. But Phil's going to need a lot more of those to get out of the heat he's in tonight. Um, it's too bad you didn't flop anything, here. I know. Yeah, I didn't have anything. For me. I saw it before. Jack Gore would have been sick. If I had Jack Four I mean, in that hand, obviously. Big King, wouldn't that be insane? That would have been a, 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 my a biggest YouTube moment ever. 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 Yeah. We should just set it up. Yeah. And just set him up. Here goes JD. Nice and slow. Makes it 600 with eight. He's 10 off. And I would have checked. And how he's going to raise from the button. He's starting to get a little active. Shit. He's got the 7 6 off. He didn't think he had it, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> JD's going to call. JD did not come here to fold today. I can get lucky and stack them here. Spicy three bet with the offsuit connector. And a good flop for Phil because JD didn't connect with it. So a bet is going to work here, I think, if Phil decides to go for it. But he checks, and JD picks up an open ender. We'll figure out a way. Now Phil bets, and it's not going to work now. JD's not going anywhere, especially against a 2K bat. Yeah, we're playing the we're playing the jack ball sure, game. Yeah, yeah, we got him. Yeah, it's always on the board, but never in anyone's hand. Yeah, <laughs> see what I mean? It's always on the board, though. It's like jack four all the time, but never in anyone's hand. The river is another nine. It's gonna change. Is Phil gonna bluff again? He I goes him tiny. Everybody was getting jack four. We played the jack, and it was like it felt like wow. Like, it's, it's kind of a great really bet really from Phil because he just can never win. Like really fun. You just yeah. hope your opponent has something like this. And it's good that you, that you, worldwide you have your own. I'll tell you what, if JD right. flicks it in here, Phil's going to be, the heat is going to be yeah. back on. Profitable we might get the sweatsuit off. <laughs> <laughs> great bet from Phil, and that is why they call it white magic. That's him. It's like three pots in a row for Phil, I think. Yeah, he's he's starting to make a comeback. He got in there with the seven six off. He came to play. I called my best friend Shamoth. Oh, okay. The a guy from the um, game last night, right? That guy. Yeah. And he gave you the secret. And then I called my wife. Sorry. And then I called uh, Mike Mouth. Oh, nice. Okay. A little three-way calling Mike, action, starting with Chamath, then Mrs. Helmuth. Yes. Me. And ending up with Mike the Mouth Matisau. Not who I would think to call when I was in dead tilt, but well, Helmuth just Mrs. does Helmuth. things differently. That's why he's in there and I'm in the booth. And Helmuth is in there again. It's The seat is getting hot. A lot of hands over there. And here he has a real one. King, queen off. And Robbie's got ace four. She's not going anywhere. Don't put a queen out there after I got rid of a queen. Robbie flops top pair. Helmuth's got a gutter ball, back to flush draw. Flop goes check check. Now Helmuth bets. Is that your glass? Yeah, I'm not saying All right. 
And Robbie's going to raise him. She knows exactly where she's at. Small raise, though. I don't think Helmy's going to want to give up just yet. I was like, could have been worse for me. Play with Robbie nope. and I was dealt wrong about that. <laughs> I couldn't pass up the opportunity. And, and Matt, look at this. Phil's going to let it go. Party. It's a regular party. So Mike the Malk told you to play queen? <laughs> Kidding. That was a weird hand because I, I was actually dealt queens. The queen of hearts flashed. I had queens. Oh, you had um, pocket queens. Yeah, but then they replaced it with a king. It was a good replacement. That's a good replacement. Well, that's not terrible. Phil apparently had well, ladies there. And had to settle for king, queen off. I should have checked, hit a jack, and then won like a free 15,000. Eric Hicks with ace, king of diamonds. That's the type of hand I want to spend my Valentine's Day night with. If my wife is busy, of course. And Helmuth has kings. And this is going to get spicy. And Berkey with 8-6 of diamonds, putting in the 20. cold 3-bet. And there goes Eric with ace-king of diamonds. He's loving his hand. And Phil's got kings. There and he go. just calls. I don't know. Wow. I don't, know. I don't either. <laughs> You're watching the same thing I Berkey's yeah. getting a decent <laughs> price to crack these guys, but he's not super deep. I wonder if he's... Yeah, he's just going to fold. And the big boys are going to go at it. Mad genius versus Helmuth. Oh, and Mad Genius flops the nuts. And Helmuth's got an overpair. This is not going to end well for him. Mad Genius just thinking, how much can I get from this guy? He bets 20. Phil's not going anywhere. He's not loving life, honestly, but he's not folding. Two kings. You know, and the turn is an eight. Mm -hmm. Phil's going to stay around here. Mm -hmm. Unless something crazy happens. Yeah, Mad yeah, Genius yeah. is just wondering, how much can I get from this guy? Yeah. That's like nice and convenient for you. Oh, Holy shit, 50. that's like huge. 50 ball. My husband almost uh, opened his law firm down there, but he thought maybe people... And Helmuth is just getting chopped down like a yeah. tree yeah. in the yeah. olden, olden like days. Oh, you know, he, like, I can't see him there. folding to this bet. So, Eric's um, been pretty crazy. Right. He could have that's queens. Cool. He could just have an yeah, yeah, ace-king yeah, yeah. with a yeah, diamond. Yeah. He could have a lot of hands. It's actually really, really convenient. I can't see Phil folding the kings here. He's going to want to at least see a river in position. What if I have two red aces? Is that good? Or do you have drama? Phil's in there. He's not going anywhere. And if this river is a brick... It was the biggest pot I've played in a long time. It's a big pot. Already almost 200,000 in there. And the river's another diamond, and this is going to save Phil. This is the lifeline he leaned He's not going to be happy. He's going to be in Megatilt. He thinks he just got sucked out on. Meanwhile, he just got saved. $156,000 that... Probably would have lost if this was. Is Eric, Eric looking at Eric check? But no, he's just thinking about it. Fifty. Fifty thousand. And he bets fifty again, and oh man, he's just trying to milk him. But Helmuth can't beat anything now. And he knows it. Oh my God, nothing. He's sure he just got sucked out on. Oh my God. And he calls. Oh my wow. God, he pays it off. Two. The mad genius I with the perfect the river sizing gets a 50 ball out of Helmuth on the Diamond River. Oh. This guy is incredible. And Helmuth's done. He's wow. done. If I can't trap the crazy guy with ace king versus aces, he's out of the game. A half an hour walk, comes back and loses a massive yeah. pot to the mad yeah. genius. And I was so mad when I saw that flop. I was dead to one out. And Berkey would have had a smaller flush. I was unlucky on the river. Very unlucky. <laughs> and Mad Genius is right. <laughs> that river cost him about 100000 Yeah, sorry, buddy. I was unlucky. You sure, Phil? The only way to get out of a hole is to keep digging. <laughs> <laughs> and Robbie with the perfect needle. What the fuck, man? What is wrong with you? 
one, so. Okay, no with is gone. Can I lose a big pot and quit? Man's got a I decent point. Yeah. I, agree I mean, Robbie. no. Right? right? You got to find oil or water. Keep digging. <laughs> Robbie, just keep going. Helmuth keeps going back to the table. I think he might have forgot his phone charger or something, but the, they're going to need to turn the AC on because it is real steamy in there. Is, is Helmuth going to play another hand? Is he just picking up? I'll tell you what, not the best week in L.A. for Phil. I can't believe he's leaving. This is the worst loss I've had. Uh, this might be a record for him. 200? Second worst loss I've had in 15 years. Wow, you heard it first. Handling it well. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> Phil, he's Phil, gone. You want 25. Phil, you want it. <laughs> the needles keep coming. A 25 chip. Give it to the dealer. Only a second stream game. <laughs> Like Perky and Robbie just laying into Phil there, Perky too, and huh? Robbie are eating this up. <laughs> Mad Genius gets a congratulations from the accountant. Dude, that river doesn't come right. And Mad Genius is rightfully a little tilted because he knows he could have got the full scalp if the river wasn't a diamond. This is unbelievable. Against anybody else, I just guess. That was really good. It doesn't matter. All he needed was to be holding two diamonds to win that. Like one two of diamonds. Like, why are you going to call that river? Wow. Like, all he needed was two of diamonds to win the entire fucking There were no diamonds left. Unbelievable. He turned it. He turned it. I quoted it. I can flop. And then when the diamond comes again in the river, yeah, yeah. Or, sorry, yeah, kings no diamond. I, I, yeah, fold. I mean, I, yeah. insta fold. Yeah, we got him, got him, got him. He came. And the celebrations are beginning. Get like, the camis out. Get the opus. Bring yeah. the champagne. Yeah. Mad yeah. Genius yeah. is drinking tonight. I want to know what Mad Genius is doing tonight. I want, to, I want to be a fly on that wall. Hey, cheers. Like the accountant and Mad Genius just celebrating the victory. Accountant's still down in the game, but he feels like a big winner now. <laughs> I checked. Wow, what a hand. Mad Genius can't even stack his chips up. And then he does shit like this. Phil came. He saw an LA. The post mortem after the fact, the, the analysis by Robbie, too, just, just brutal. Cold blood. The man's funeral. And everybody's talking shit about him. That's great. Two days of. Wow, yeah. That lasted a long time. Two streams. Yeah. I mean, if you think about it, technically... He she literally said deuce of diamonds. What's that? She literally said <laughs> yeah. all he had to have was a deuce of diamonds. How can you call? Yeah, <laughs> Robbie tells it like it is. That's not that bad. If you do the exchange rate... We don't Salt in the wound. Sorry, we don't need exchange rate. <laughs> the, the thousand big blinds are pretty tough. <laughs> What? The river, that river you just think about it as a buy-in It's one buy-in. Yeah. You're right. You're right. Like, I'm I've probably never lost more than a buy-in. Yeah. Yeah. Any diamond beats the first river. Wow. wow. Eric I'm so in shock. He's going to get renamed. Flopped <laughs> <laughs> the nuts. Eric the vacuum. <laughs> what? But he makes like the person that won the hand feel like absolute board. shit for winning. I know. A legit I mean, hand. Yeah. And Helmuth just. I mean, what are you going to do? Like he had ace king suited. Like he's going to call anything. Like, yeah. Yeah. like if anything, you shove pre flop and he's going to call anyway. And then he's going to win like it. Had, it's not like he had a really good. Probably run it twice and you probably win one. Or Maybe. Whatever. Hey, you guys Maybe. wanted a highlight? Eric is <laughs> rightfully so taking a victory lap. Yeah. No, and then he bounced after that. Right. <laughs> Man, Phil just Great. loses fifty thousand. I mean, takes a break. Damage. But I wish calls have a his wife on so Valentine's Day a little consolation, then calls Mike the, the mouth, anyway. comes back, <laughs> like, and loses a you, monster you pot to the mad genius problem. and storms off and quits. And that's that's, that's going to be all for Phil tonight. Way, way wow. By the way. Well, way better versus eight, eight high. No, also. Yeah, the, by the way, that, well, he actually had a idiot. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, this so, idiot to be better than eight high. I'd rather him have the money than you. Oh, yeah, of course. He just and, had pocket kings, though. And by the way, that, he said, that? supposedly. Wow, that was masterful. He he I mean, I don't know. Yeah, queens, and then he yeah, had well, kings. I don't know if against the 50K my ace king. Yeah. handshaking at the end didn't give it yeah, away, he, but this is so much called with nothing. He could have let it go because there's a lot of money in the pot. Yeah. I mean, he should have. Yeah. He should have stayed uh, in the pot. Nice job. That's not really Playing the biggest pot Phil Helmuth has played in a while. I mean, I think that's the biggest pot Phil Helmuth played in his life. Ooh, that <laughs> genius. Sticking the knife in a little. Like not including the tournament stuff. But yeah. cash game, I think that was pretty good. Ouch. Cool.
according to Mad Genius, that might be the biggest pot Phil's ever lost. And as far as TV coverage goes, I can't say he's wrong. He doesn't usually buy in super deep will, so the last the last buying for 10k or 20k, you can't lose a 300k pot that easily. Yeah, the last two nights have been. I don't know if I want to say a wake-up call, but definitely a change of pace for Phil. A little bit. LA has not been kind to Phil. Then again, Pocket Kings is a good hand. It's a tough city. He's not yeah. easy to get. You a need lot of like people have cool. fallen here. Yeah, it's cool. But not Mad Genius. Mad Genius is on top of, what is it, Runyon Canyon, where they go to hike? It's Runyon Canyon. Yeah, that's where, that's, that's, that's where the, the Hollywood elite go. Mad Genius is just running around Runyon Canyon, butt naked, screaming to the gods. I mean, he can't believe his good fortune tonight. But he's earned it. He played incredible from the start of the stream, and then he just ran well and got paid at the right time, even after the Diamond River came. Oh, I'm so sorry. I, I, I looked at him, he bet, and I don't want I'm done. It's going to be tough to commentate now, but um, we got another hand here. Like, he didn't let it take, like... You should have let him get away, to be honest. The race car driver has been quiet for a while, kind of just watching the bloodbath, but he's in here for a raise. He's got 9-6. He's got a open-ender with a backdoor flush draw. And Berkey's got king queen of spades. Yeah. I don't think Berkey's going anywhere. Yeah, like, he had to be holding a diamond. Come on, okay. If he did we're telling him what he should have done, but I'm just saying, like, he'd still be really tilted if he folded, but it'd be a 50 mm -hmm. Hey, Robbie, did you have advice on this yet? What's up? I'm ready. Are you ready? Okay. Robbie's ready for her wine now. And Berkey just folds. Uh, give me I fold, I fold. Oh. And Eric folds. Or give it to me, and I'll... And it's back to JD with A7. He's going to fold too. Great pickup for the driver, Yang. Really like how he's played tonight. And the wine is starting to flow. I mean, I don't even know if they're going to play much more. I think I think they might make, just make it look good and then get up after that. Cheers. Cheers, of course. The accountant is loving life. I think we got legendary crypto trader Alex Weiss in the chat. You know him? Wow. Yeah, just keep old school legend. He just says, Geez, yeah, just keep repeating that. ESPN needles Phil has done in the past. Like, no, this guy can't that. even spell poker. No, Dude. Wow. <laughs> just That's how you make 20 billion trading crypto. Like, yeah, he just already, runs, like, runs up a cool nine figs, he's, right? He's, no problem. He, he's going to be yeah. a little bit on tilt from yesterday. And this one's just, oh. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. We got a super chat from Brian Willis. Phil should go back to min buying. All you Phil might be going back to the min buy after this. I'll tell you that the deep stuff did not work out for him these first two nights. Joey Ingram Poppy says, "Is Phil on case money?" I'll tell you what. I don't know. I don't want to be on the other end of the phone call that Phil makes right now. I'll tell you that right now. It's gonna be a hot one. I think he's gonna call Mattisau if I'm betting that. He might call Mattisau again. Because well, he said that yesterday was one of the worst cash, the, the worst cash game. Back to back, the worst. Are these the worst two sessions of Phil's life? Yeah, was what 220, 240, something like that. Maybe more. They lost 400k. Like for him, it's like. That's a, yeah, that's a lot for somebody that the wants to play with 20. He was so lucky. And the needles just keep coming. I would have stacked 100 percent. 100 percent. Eight re-raise, 10,000. One fold. That would have been better. He would have had to. Have and Al and the Mad Genius. It's tough to follow the action with all that's been going on. I think Al's just going to take this down, although Yang's in there with a very pretty hand. Might want to see a flop. He's going to fold no. too. Paired board no, with a, shoved, oh, well, nice. the last king would have to show up with a paired board. Change my six to another queen. <laughs> and Al's had a pretty good night. He's got the hot sauce there. He's quietly been chipping up, and, you know, it kind of almost feels like everybody had a good night besides Helmuth. I hope his hotel room's free. I'm probably just can't help herself. <laughs> in the free room. Ouch. <laughs> this poor guy. Let the guy get home. Let, let him get to his car at least. What do you reckon? What do you reckon the line is on whether he plays tomorrow? I don't think he will. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. I think, it's, I think he's a big dog. More like the, I didn't straddle. Unfortunately, I would have, but I will play it. Five hundred. Nine raise. Five hundred. <laughs> Mad Genius needs Berkey to pick up his chips for him. He's Mad Genius is already thinking about what are we doing tonight? What club are we going to? I'm I'm gonna tag along. I think me and the Mad Genius we might hit up 11. I don't know. Sounds like a big night. Valentine's Day. What's the line? What's the line? 
Where well, it depends. Can I, <laughs> do I have to set a fair line, or am I looking to get accurate? Like, 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 oh, I know, right? like whatever I line you just said, like, I, I can take either 000? side. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, oh. And we just do like, are you playing tomorrow? Uh, depends if he's playing, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> They're trying to set a line for whether Helmuth plays tomorrow or not. Berkey says he's only playing if Helmuth plays. I think he is... They're going to make it tough on the production team. Kevin Martin, Maria Ho, Phil Helmuth, maybe not, I don't know. This is why it's so hard to build these sick live stream lineups. You know, people go on tilt. You never know what's going to happen. Um, but maybe it's for show, because he thinks it'll get viewership and then... Uh, he's like two and a half to one to no show. To no show. I'm trying to yeah. think. I think like he's already here, so he's, he's not just going to just... He's also Will, I'll lay it. Pick. Okay, I have, I have one. What side do you like? He's My 250 to your 100. I'll lay it. Like, Phil, like, Phil, no show. Maybe, yeah. You like no I, show? I, I, I'm a no show. I'll take 250 to your 100. No, because he already I'm out. said it. I'm out. You need more price? Classic poker player. Yeah. <laughs> we don't like to give away money. I mean, Berkey I set the line, not me, man. Make a statement like, took the right side. Well, I think. Buy in for 300 every time and then go back to 10. Um. Yeah, that's. Best part too is I can't wait for the LATB team to clip when Helmuth when Helmuth's complaining and Berkey just looks at him and goes, "Well, you're handling it well." That's a lot clip. There's a lot of memes that were just made. This could supply the poker world for a couple of months with the amount of memes that just were created in the last 20 minutes. For sure. For sure. You got a little bit unlucky there. Six. Sculpting a po poker po superstar? Yeah, Not yet. Yeah. Almost. <laughs> Legit. Legit. <laughs> it's like, what a dream. Come to live at the bike and all your dreams come true. Childhood dreams being accomplished, just Sorry, live at the bike. Sure, man. Help yourself. Nice just no, 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 sending film home. No, no, no. Stop, stop. I mean, no, how many no, times, how many people can say they did that Cheers. outside of a tournament? Cheers. Eric just stacked Phil. He's buying all the bottles. Bottles are on are on Eric tonight. Like we're not so we're not so cheaping out. Oh my God. Yeah. No twenty dollar Merlots Eric here. We're going Camus. We're going Opus One. Extra Maybe some more champagne. But Dave was gonna be drinking bet good. Small on the river. You know how much that hurt. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I knew yeah. I wouldn't get another. I wouldn't. I Can wouldn't get any this? more than that. Would have been better if you showed like the two of diamonds and like the three of clubs yeah, or yeah, some yeah. shit yeah. like that. Oh, <laughs> Look at those stacks in front of the yeah, mat. Genius. Too many chips. He's gonna need a color up. We're gonna have to ask yeah, the floor for a quick color up for Eric because okay. he's getting out of control. Isn't that all start? Wasn't this that pot where I limped and raised? Oh, and he just called with kings. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I raised and he just called. It wouldn't matter. He mattered. called. It wouldn't matter. He was getting it all no matter what. Can you imagine? <laughs> like. Just two, two, diamonds diamonds three, three, two of diamonds and three of clubs. What a feeling to like get to the river with ace king suited. Call. And, and then and have the board four, not fair. Yeah. The board not fair. And, and here's yeah. the other thing with four diamonds on the board. So like if you're queen, holding any diamonds, yeah. like queen of diamonds, he would insta call. But There was a lot in there. <clears throat> and Eric flops quads. Oh my god. Oh, I, I haven't even oh, gonna follow this hand. Great. This is incredible. Al has top boat and Eric has quads. He's gonna lose it all here, Will. This is incredible. 6,000. Mad Genius is betting heavy with the quads. He's got a mountain of chips in front of him and Al is just sitting there thinking, how much can I get from this guy? Al might wanna raise here. No, he's just gonna call, just string him along. Call. Little does he know, he's drawing to one out. Oh, wow. And that's an interesting river. You know, this might somehow save Al. For sure. Wow, the best, the, the Stone Cold best river in the deck for him, other than another eight. And Mad Genius actually somehow has been running bad on these rivers, believe it or not. I know it seems crazy. 20,000. But this river might get him just called here. I think Al is, Al, that's a look of a, a man who's calling. And that genius just, Call. Al calls and saves himself. Wow. Wow. Oh, oh my God. Wow. Oh. <laughs> wow, he's turned one over. This guy's like, he's like. Yeah, he turned one over, I was like, oh. Insane. <laughs> what? Oh. 
I know it may not seem like it, but the, the rivers that Mad Genius has hit in these hands have cost him a ton. You get river. Eric, again, I was, about like, the I was like, I didn't, I didn't get it. Uh, he never the chips the keep stacking. Eric, we gotta get this guy a color up. This is ridiculous. Man. Somebody call the floor. Are you getting another 100 grand? Uh, What's that? I said, Honestly, how about that fucking king or you get another 100 grand? I know. Yeah, right? minimal no, no loss king, for you, this guy. No king. I mean, no you, got, king you, 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 you got unlucky in two pots. No king, you get my whole stack. <laughs> Eric legitimately did get unlucky yeah, in both no, of those rivers. Yeah, no, still help me with it. Uh, yeah. Could have had 100,000 more off. potentially in each yeah. hand. We'll be fine without Phil. We got Robbie and Phil. The seat is empty. The void is massive there. You can feel it all the way up from here in the booth. I want to get rid of my ass. No, Robbie, I like you. I don't care what they say. I would never make you feel like shit for having the absolute nuts. The tits. But I'm proud. Finally. I mean, how can you? Like, you're gonna no, get mad at him for having them done. No, but like, you he's super pro. Fucking nuts. Yeah, 800. Like, you're mad you're now? Yeah, you're right. You're like, sure, it's like, one thing if you, like, yeah, rivered him with, like, three deuce, with deuce of diamonds or some shit. But he had this, like, the absolute the, fucking nuts. From the beginning, it wasn't, like, it was a bad a hand moment, to begin with. It, no, like, it was, like, a pre flop shove, it was, like, a flop shove, it was a turn shove, it was a river shove. I would have been disappointed. Like, I mean, it was absolute nuts the whole If we didn't storm out of here and. Oh, yeah, you would have been, like, uh, it's not worth it. Yeah, that was like everything I dreamed it would be. <laughs> you know what I mean? That was sick. Dreams come you know true I mean? at live at the bike. Yeah, yeah, dreams come true. On Valentine's Day. Like if he was been a nice guy about it, it would have sucked. Like, oh, God. <laughs> like he didn't even put on a show for me. Uh, it's like, oh, God, I've been I've been baiting this guy all day. And hey, Berkey, what are the odds that Phil come back with a million dollar stack tomorrow morning? Literally zero. <laughs> exactly zero, for sure. <laughs> Would you give me 10,000 to one? If Bill's in, I'm in tomorrow. Yeah, can you no, but. Because <laughs> I'll loan him a million dollars. I don't think he needs the loan. I just he don't think it's going to happen. Raise the 6,000. But that would be the G move to do, right? Like, yeah. cool. Storm out, come back with a fucking mail, and be like, let's go. Well, the action does not yeah, stop I mean, just because Helmut's gone. But then. Looks yeah. like Robbie opened, been, got three bet by Berkey, and Eric coming in with the cold four with yeah, a six suited. And Berkey's loving life yeah, here with ace king off. The one goes to like 1 I don't think Berkey's going to play this like Helm uh, I think he's going to want to put more money in. Party naked. Yeah. But he just calls. Gives Mad Genius a chance to win another pot. Mad Genius is running out of real estate, and he's still Probably shooting it up with the a six suited. Bet, raise, call. Not a good wow. flop for either player. Oh, but you get stuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I mean, Mad Genius checks. You. No, I no. think he, he, he wanted the pot spread there. He just wanted to spread the pot. He's but gonna then bet. the way I looked at my hand and I was like, oh. I was like. It's a, the wine's the flowing, hard to yeah, keep up like with was, the pot. Berkey's gonna call just, because the bet yeah. is too small for him to it, fold, but he's not loving life. I was like, he's, he's only gonna, no, he's, king, he's only gonna call me if he has a king, so I was like. Uh, it was a $100,000 king. Yeah. What, what's worse is if that's not like a eight in the middle. Well, Turn no, pairs the nine. I had a, it's uh, a really good card had, for had the king Berkey. or whatever in similar, but the other guy had king. Imagine he's going to slow down and check, and I think Berkey's going to be happy to just try to get this to showdown. So like oh, the okay. same oh, thing yeah, as that, that yeah, uh, yeah. king, king, eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not no, exactly those cards, away. but There's it. No way you can, king eight. So, no, but I bet The river's a ten of hearts. It opens the door for Mad Genius. He's not going to like it with his hand, but... You never know with this guy. I'm like, uh, pretty, I mean, pretty much. I'm like, he gives up. Always queen, please. Berkey I mean, may try to bluff, but it doesn't matter. He's gonna win it. It's time. It happens sometimes. Berkey's gonna take it down. And the Mad Genius <laughs> loses a rare pot. He's still got way too many chips in front of himself. He, we need to color up ASAP. Bottom, bottom, Berkey can barely even bottom. shuffle his chips with that stack next to him. Eric, don't give it to Berkey. Like out of all people. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm stuck. Let me at least get even first. What's that? Yeah, but he's, 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 he's okay. He's, he's good people. I like him. Thanks. Berkey will never kind storm off. He's really funny. Actually. Huh? Valley's Big Bet Poker is proud to feature world class you know, faded spade playing cards. Use code Big Bet, it gets you 15% off the two deck set of the new 3.0 version at fadedspade.com. Uh, if you ever want to hear like really crazy stuff, put me in those headphones sure. and be like, it's like Oh my god, I can't believe this donkey is betting like these The accountant, talking about getting in the booth, we might have to get the accountant in the booth for some color commentary, especially if we get Helmuth back in here. I'd be curious to say what the accountant thinks of these hands. Write him a love letter. Phil, dear it's Phil. It's one thing, like I said, if you had dear anything Phil, less than the nuts. And this is amazing. It really feels like Phil is the only one who lost. And Eric is the only one who won. Eric Hicks. They might as well play heads up. 
nice about picks it. up a two fifty yeah, yeah, and made filled down yeah. nearly two hundred. Hurt my feelings. Can you imagine? He made ch like what it would take. Uh, was it <laughs> like I have to this work for my money. Can you imagine him like wrecking my day? All uh, right. No, oh, I agree. This is way better. All right. We gotta get this chip situation cleaned up. <laughs> Berkey <laughs> notices the obvious. It's time for a color up. This is getting ridiculous. The players are running out of real estate on that side of the table because of how many chips Eric has. You're protecting your Get the man some five Ks. Look at that. Help him stack that. It's half a million dollars in plastic. I think clay chips. And Mad Genius can't stop celebrating, and I don't blame him. Let's put all the meaning. Chips on your right he side. sends like, Phil Hellmuth home from a live stream. This thing on half a million dollars. Like that actually was helping him. Right, because there's no way 50k is above. Berkey's really gonna like stack the chips up. It's not Berkey's first rodeo. He's gonna make some nice stacks for the Mad Genius. Yeah, it would be wow. I like what you got going on here. I'm not gonna Meanwhile, the race car driver sneaking in there with Jack Six suited, taking down a nice pot. He's played awesome tonight. A lot of new players, new faces. Oh, and what's this? Is that Helmuth? It's a disheveled mess. I'll help out. Phil, come back. Phil is back in the room. Triple up. Come on. I wanted to bring Phil back in real quick before we get into this next hand. Phil, go ahead and talk to the table. I want to say this, like, uh, like now I finally started rooting for Berkey and I got to fucking leave. That's not fun. I got to tell you, that's not fun for me either. Welcome I back. I finally sir. started rooting for Berkey and I, and I have to fucking leave. Robbie, it's been a pleasure to play with you. Uh, you leaving? Really fun. Just like that. Al, you and I will play a lot in the future. It's fun to play with you. Accountant, pleasure to play with you as pleasure well. I know you. you're a good guy, so I've heard that. So, and, um, Hope you didn't hear wrong. Right. Good That's to see you. Good see game. You. Nice seeing you, Phil. Yeah. Good game, and good luck with the hot sauce. Thank Eric, you. nice hand. Uh -huh. Good game. Nice hand, Eddie. You want so, a fair and square, and I have an issue. Yeah, Phil, are you going to see you tomorrow? No, I'm, I'm, I'm just... just so it's not your week? These run... These, it's just been too... Like, I feel like I'm running the worst I've run in my life. And at that point, oh. I have two chances. I can either go rest for a week or, you know... Uh, Retreat. Or, or fight. But I don't like fighting when I'm running that. Okay. Or feel like I'm That makes that. sense. It's a better way of looking at it. Yeah. Yeah. And I was trapping Eric. I had kings. I'm like, oh, he's going to give me a lot of money here. And instead, he's somehow flopped me dead. Eric, he did. Hey, oh, hey, hey, you shouldn't trap with like 3,000 big lines. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> well, Eric, you understand the game better than I do. So, he's you know, a deep stack master. You should take yeah. that. No. Like, hey, so king, kings aren't that good when you're like 3,000. That's right, man. You got to shove them all in pre. Right. Let's fucking go. Bye, Phil. See ya, Phil. See ya, Cheers. Phil. I mean, isn't it true? <laughs> Man, two and a half, half a bear, two and a half is a soft line. I can have like three, four, <laughs> soft fucking line. Oh my god! <laughs> and just like that, Helmuth, the consummate <laughs> professional, <laughs> comes back, <laughs> rocks the mic for a few minutes, <laughs> says he's gonna take a week <laughs> off a of rest. For you? Yeah. Wow. Oh my god! You came dying. just for that, right? <laughs> We're dying inside. It was it's worth it. Out. Spreading positivity. The chat. The chat is hashtag oh, the positivity. Hashtag right positivity oh, from Helmuth. He's not going out storming. He's gonna come back, bless the mic, say a few nice words. Love it. It be He'll be back. Got it on camera. It has right? to be somebody other than the guy that stacked it. No, that's <laughs> fine. That makes it funny. Oh my it's god. Oh my god. Oh my. I mean, come on. I could have nine ten suited. Oh, like I could have had anything. You could have had. had that's what I actually. You could have like, had gonna, a single juice of diamonds. You're playing for stacks right there. Right. I actually thought you had a straight there. Yeah. yeah. There's so many things you could have. Yeah. And they're not pulling me. Okay. What is it? What did we just observe? Like trapping with kings is a tournament thing. And Eric, just oh, relentless, How is that gives oh. Phil the needle on his way out. What? There's no what right way to play like jiggities. It was this man is out for blood. Not he came in here with a mission. Um, mission accomplished. Okay. Helmut storms out. 500k in front of the mad genius. Why? What the guys played great. He did. And he oh, sorry. Well, yeah. You, you, now he's you in could, wine, could, wine could, season. But even if he's yeah, I've seen it's, uh, I've seen the mad genius in five-hour streams before. So he's yeah. He's so now this is this this Helmut slaughter has turned into a Catalina wine mixer for Eric. He's just gonna have some nice samples, maybe a nice uh, crisp red, maybe even switch to some white later in the night. Have some fish. The river was supposed to help him. Get away! Why you gotta buy him for three hundred thousand? This guy's like a poker champion. Me and Robbie might go to Javier's. And like, back to where it all started. There's no way to trap. Robbie did not disappoint with this game. She uh, she wanted a big lineup. She wanted fireworks. She wanted blood on Valentine's Day, and that's what we've gotten tonight. The problem is he gets stacked anyway. 
Unfortunately I, for if he Phil, it, the blood is all his. No, but they can run it twice or whatever. Yeah. I, I mean, I don't want to let him that off the hook. That, but end, that end played itself. Yeah, unfortunately, like he's still just going to get no, 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 He no, goes 50,000. Eric, Eric, Eric would go. He would have made 20,000 pre-flop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If he makes it 100,000, he No, no, no. He's not going to make 100. Yeah, yeah. Well, he actually might make it 100. Like if he, he, if he makes it 50 or 60, he should I'm make pulling. it like he should make it yeah, like yeah. 45. Yeah, I'm pulling. I'm pulling. I'm not gonna go against it. Yeah. He has back to the action. Yang has queens. He's flopped a set. Robbie yeah, has top pair four. with a backdoor flush four. draw. I couldn't have asked. Where is the first one? I but if you're just complaining out. about the game being stuck. And I, and I pointed wow. to the cameras. That would be fun. And Robbie's oh, just gonna yeah. <laughs> Especially because you would have been right. Yeah, no, could. We would have raised. No, she's she's still got a card in front of you. That graphic's wrong. You guys said, let's see a flop. But Robbie's played really solid tonight. That would have been tilting though. It took every ounce of discipline in me to fold. She could get in a little trouble here. She calls and that oh turn's gonna save her. Like, Mother fucker. Oh, you're pissed. Yeah. Yeah. And she actually so leads for 4K. If Eric doesn't make a 20K there, he might just smooth Driver's it. not I'm, going I'm anywhere. Positive, I trap you. Yeah. Positive he would have. Robbie then, now has a chance to win this hand if she wants to bluff, but is she gonna do it? Angry. It's the only well, run out that could possibly really get Driver off of his hand. She's shown a propensity to give up. She's gonna give up. But it's so much better that he has his money than yours. Driver's gonna be happy to check back on this board. If it's non-suited for 100% of yeah. yeah. pulse, and I would have been expected. Cool. Three ladies for the driver on Valentine's Day. Every man's dream. Five hands. Not the first one. If he five hands. Unbelievable. It's like, I couldn't, I couldn't, could wait, he goes, he's like, I was trying to trap those kings. He goes, shouldn't trap mm -hmm. 3,000 big bodies. Died. Okay, <laughs> hey, hey, what does this mean, Wayne? I got, I got a no, I almost died. Wait, this, like, you can't read this like, shit. Wants to play. Pocket Can boards we? or something would have won. He, he will. I got, I got to just get on, get him on the phone tonight. Yeah. Is he playing? Huh? Are we playing tomorrow? I mean, the, no. The, he the said he was. He said no. He's trap. leaving. So let's. Yeah. Isn't let's there a be very clear. He's leaving. There's get CBS on here. He wants to go meditate. It's fine. I'll bet he's not even like in the city. The okay. <laughs> another sounds like another bet from Berkey. He's gonna bet Phil is out of LA by tomorrow. And I would not bet against that man. He's like, you're in Palo Alto, right? Are you a bigger Berkey fan after hey, seeing this little performance he's put on today? Yeah, oh yeah. How can you not How can you not gain a little appreciation for the man? He came in firing needles the whole time. He hasn't relented. Come on, Berkey. I fold, yeah. I fold. I fold. I'm at. Can you see a flop? Just, 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 just nice to look at. You do? <laughs> and there he puts in the cold four bet with King Jack suited. He's trying to get even. Father, fucker. You win. Of course I'm about to stack here. Berkey's sneaking back to even, so really, we're only looking at Helmuth, and um, I'm not even sure who the other I'm loser in the game is, but it's insignificant. Really? That's good. Yeah. But I wouldn't flip out anyway. And what a week for Helmuth. Yeah. Oh my god. That's the best. No, but I wasn't saying I wanted you to come tomorrow. I'm, I'm here tomorrow, the day after. Oh, you are coming? Yeah. Oh, is that what you were saying? Eric's wondering when we can get this game off again. He wants to play more. I don't blame him. Let's go. Completely chewed these guys up tonight. Let's get a game tomorrow. Why not, says the mad genius. Dude, don't make a seat for me. I built this place. I built this They should have my statue in the... I'm just kidding. Mad genius talking about a statue erection. Is that the way you say it? Yeah. No, statue erection? Yeah. I think so. I yeah. yeah. But I don't know. We may have a statue erected oh, outside for the Mad Genius. Oh, for you. That's yeah. a, a beautiful yeah, that's bronze bust well, of the man who invented the Luna cycle. May now be better known for literally busting Helmuth from a live stream. Not, no, not that in time. And that and jacket. He's not stopping. The man gets nines and is going to shoot up the accountant. He's finally got a decent chip stack. He's already putting it to use. So 500 isn't enough for the mad genius. So and the accountant knows. The accountant, like, the accountant doesn't want to peel here with his stack. You know the usual? For the but of course if you're going to lose even more. <laughs> right. That was the biggest oh, Never mind. The accountant might be feeling a little heat himself. Helmuth has left some vapors on that side of the room. And the account's going to peel in position. It does have two overs. How much you got left? 18K? I mean, I don't know. He wasn't winning. Then he... Oh, and this is going to be trouble. I think... It's collection season. But not for the IRS. The people are getting some money back. 
count him quickly calls, he's going to need an eight, eight or we'll he's in real it. bad shape here. And he picks up a double gutter. A little bit more life. He's still trailing. Six thousand. He's not folding now. He might even ship it in with how many chips he has left. All of you don't like money. Mm. And Eric goading him. I mean, the man's just on fire. He can do no wrong. Walking on water. Trying to finish off the accountant. Already chewed up Helmuth. And the accountant looks like he might want to release this. He's out of time chips, and he lets it go. Super solid. It's... I see why this guy is the accountant. He does not give money away. He takes when he needs to. And Eric wins another pot, up to almost $540,000. And I just can't believe what I've seen tonight. And I shut up. I go, you know, this is fucking feel home move. I think it went in your favor. I think it got him to call. No, I just went into statue mode. You know what I mean? I go, this is not the time to talk shit. He goes, what did you say? I go, oh, shit. Go into statue mode. What a dream, man. I'm going to relive that moment a hundred times. You know, like for us, that's a big deal. Big deal. Like, you know, he's, he is one of the best players in the world. Ever. In our book. I, his book was the first book I ever read on poker. Oh, do you get this excited when you stack me? I don't think I should. When have I stacked oh. you? The fucking last time we played. I stacked. Yeah, but I that, stacked that, that, that wasn't, wasn't in my stack for very long, so. And that felt better well, than stacking four Bobby Baldwin a million dollar pot. Raised, when was that? Oh, just a couple months ago in the Aria. Hmm. Yeah. For how much? But that yeah. felt pretty good. A million bucks. That's it was like a mil it was a million two hundred thousand dollar pot. In that private game with Brian? No, it's sure. a big game right now, dude. Is it? Is it two, four, eight, or some shit like that? Four thousand. Yeah. C three, four thousand. Like when when the big guys are in town, it plays really big. JD not gonna get any like action it? with this top set. Hell yeah, I like it, man. I'm ready to quit my job and go and play in that game. Do you ever play in LA? All the time. Huh? I've never seen you in the Beverly Hills game. It's, only, it's probably the, the best Aria poker game in the world. Play with him? If you're, you're just joining us, this is Bally Presents Live at the Bike, the longest running high stakes so, poker series. Phil Helmuth has left the building after having a rough night. The return of Robbie Jade Lou. The Jack Four bounty is on. And production tells me stick around because some J4 shenanigans might be in play later. It was fun. It was dope. But... I like the the company. It's a good game. No, it's the best game in the world right now, dude. That game is sick. I can tell you guys stories. Just just what happened this last weekend. It's crazy ass. Robbie hasn't been involved a ton, but she's got the ten nine of spades here. She's popping it. Hold on, man. Okay. Brian Baird won a million dollars on Sunday. Did he really? Yeah. Million dollars. All right. Yang's gonna defend the big blind, and the accountant's coming along as well. Yeah. Like he, he was so drunk and. Five K in the pot. I go get, get used to it. You're playing this game. You win a million dollars all the time. The problem is you also lose a million dollars. Robbie's got a gut yeah, shot. That's the only other problem. Yeah. But you gotta buy in deep though. Yeah. Like, if you, like he's normally buying in small, and somehow he ends up. Deep. Flops checked around. Now Yang's got a pair and a four flush. He's played great tonight. He takes down this AK pot. Should we get more Opus? <laughs> Are you guys still drinking? Yeah, yeah. It's Valentine's Day. Fuck okay. it. More Opus for air kicks. And Will, can you opine a little bit on this hat glasses jacket combo? I know we've been, I mean, Eric specifically. All right. You know, I gotta be honest with you, Gail, and a lot of people, I don't think it would work. Eric really pulls it off. And if you can pull off something like that, you're a special dude. In Vegas, I just, when I got too much money, I just go on the The accountant and Eric just soaking in the vino. Is that where this came from? Accountant's down 5K, but he feels like he just won 50. Seeing seeing that first first Price first row seats to the Helmuth show. I like it, right? I mean, I would guess yeah, he's. Was the you can tell he's just loving it. Show. Yeah, <laughs> he just wants Berkey to be there. with the burns on. He's, he's burning Hicks oh, 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 for his outfit. He came to play tonight, not on the table so much, but with his mouth. Wow. Four thousand for the matching shoes. Oh. Okay, and look, the the, shoes we're getting the breakdown on the outfit necessary. now. Look at that beautiful skull and bones glittering at the table. 
Oh, that was Same thing. Really guy. brings the outfit yeah. together. I mean, I would love to just see a full. If if if, if, if we can get the cameras to show the shoes too, I would imagine there's some sparkles there. I got a collection of them now. Man has a collection, and I'll tell you what. I think he might add a few more pieces to that after tonight, y'all. Feet up, Eric. There we go. Look at those puppies. Philip. Play for the shoes. One hand. Philip, Philip Pline. Pline. What is that? <laughs> PP. Some people play pocket pair. Some people play Philip Pline's, and Eric is pulling it off the full outfit. Unwashed. <laughs> That's fine. The way he runs. The way he runs, I'm happy to soak it in. Oh. <laughs> Barky gets out of here. Funny, dude. Oh my <laughs> Probably God. after the Bro, second bottle. Uh, a stint on Comedy Central will do you good. Yeah, no, he wasn't well, this funny before. He's I know, it's true. Just, Berkey has never been this funny it. before. <laughs> Something about Helmuth's <laughs> blow up has really <laughs> parted out in Matt. He's just been on fire tonight. Oh, I, 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 He's I not actually mad at you. I'm not. I don't even remember what I was mad about. Nothing. I you had a bottle of wine. And I came the out. I think we need you to go on Poppy's show after this with Berkey and Robbie, and we can all figure out what everybody was mad about three months yeah ago. i mean you know 20 minutes ago before the stream robbie's telling berkey to f himself and now they're i was almost exclusively talking about their homies not the actual hand itself seems like they're bff he was he was on your side back to the action big flop for yang and a big flop for berkey too yang's got bottom set berkey's got a gutter and a second not flush draw and he just calls the things back about me i just got like told about the snippets Kind of, sort of deal. Yeah, yeah, like, you, you, and I was heavily emotional. You gotta watch a whole damn thing. You can't just Berkey's gonna it. check. Yang makes a boat. And he's checking back. Oh, you know what? I got the hand wrong. Oh, no, no, no. The, the graphics are wrong. I was in the same city. You know what I mean? That's it. What's unreal? It's like. Whew, it's all right, guys. Wild night here funny. at Live at the Bike. No, no. I think Berkey River to straight here, though. You know, you know what I think happened, honestly. Like my read of the whole thing is that, uh, is that there was a big incident in chess. Because I'm in the chess. Board. I can't tell what's going on by the board, but it looks like Berkey. Yeah, the whole you know what? Yeah, those didn't. You can't win them all, guys. I managed. Yeah, and, that, and they had everybody's senses up. But what happened with the anal beads? Uh, there was a chess oh, cheating thing, scandal yeah. in the same month that I, first happened. So oh, some, I, I don't know. Some like. And the Mad Genius has switched to champagne. The wine isn't doing it anymore, so. Yeah. I wouldn't know how many times I like hold it, telling like hold it too far. What, what piece to move in and shit like that, and like. Um, right. That's pretty impressive. The way he won apparently was like some really like unorthodox shit, like. With the mat. With the chest thing. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Like it, it was like some. Oh. Weird, like oh, no, he just knew what to do, you know. But, but it happened right at that he time. Yes, yeah, so the same. The way Magnus oh. reacted when he when he thought somebody cheated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he, he walked out of a, yeah, yeah. a major game. Yeah, yeah. He, he just walked he, out, he and, it, and and he didn't he have to say anything. Yeah, he didn't. he didn't have to make any accusation. He just walked out. And then I Obviously, he's, there's only one thing that he's thinking, like the way he is acting, right? That's right. Yeah. That's right. Okay. Like, the, like way before he ever said yeah. anything, everybody knew. Everybody knew. And it became like, it, it like just, it, it lit up the chess team. Yeah, yeah. My friend oh. owns chess.com. Like, oh, really? Yeah, he used to work for me, honest to God. Yeah. And oh. now he, uh, you know. He, what the, the volumes on chess.com? Like right after that scandal. Oh, my, it's just been crazy yeah, yeah, what yeah, that yeah, scandal yeah. did for chess. Yeah. And, and I think, chess, you know, the chess yeah. and poker are related. Chess yeah, for and sure. And the people in charge of poker kind of knew. You know, yeah. that a nothing brings. I mean, it's kind of like when that Netflix um, Queen's Gambit came out. Chess, that's right. Yeah, that's chess right. went crazy as well. Sure. Right, but the, the, it, it wasn't. Yeah, that's right. 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 Berkey, it's weird, but you can create an his top pair is no good yeah, and cheating on the flop. Robbie makes a boat, tries to get sneaky, but no one really has anything. No I thought you guys looked bad. I thought no somebody would have a heart. Ah. You thought you guys had a heart? It's a speculation. I just said a queen, you know, Once the best Once it gets stand. to the bank ah. I, people can't stop talking. Here I thought I was like, I'm sorry, but in America, here I thought I was like, I have it. Yeah, yeah, I've got him. I rivered, and nobody you know I mean? And it's Here like, I thought I remember. Like, it's like not value betting right now. It's like yeah. unbelievable. And it, it benefited guys like Berkey who are doing a channel. Yeah, yeah. And if he doesn't get on it, then all of his competitors are going to do well with it. You know what I mean? Yeah. I can totally see how. I mean, it's good content. Six, seven, six hundred. Two thousand. 
Oh, oh. Accountant's got 10k. Well, I want to see him win a pot. Yeah, the accountant's on fumes here. He's gonna need a decent flopper. His stack might be vapored. And Al gets a really good flop for his. Uh, I hate to say it, yeah, but perceived range. He just checks back though. A great turn for the accountant. He's gonna take a stab here because it's gonna work. Yeah, he's not messing around. It's tax season. Al's not gonna pay though. <laughs> If there's, uh, if I, don't I love how you're so against strategy. Perceived range is a no-go here. Yeah. Like the three better on an I had a list board. of words, and Dead. perceived range was right near the top. This is just this is just comedy hour. Three days. It's yeah. What, we can't. What, you're gonna be the people here. People get enough strategy. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. As they say, I'm here all week, maybe. Yeah. All week. Unless they fire me. I don't think so. Not after tonight. You can't go out like that with Helmuth. I mean, I just, this has just been an amazing stream. It, it would have been better if I Best one I've ever been involved in. Hey, I got like Definitely one of the best ones that's ever Street occurred. That was like the that was like the yeah, yeah. To me. I didn't win a bracelet, but I got second place. And I got to beat out Helmut to get there. Feels like winning second place. Have you been surprised at all by Robbie's style tonight? Yeah, but I have. I, I really thought Robbie was going to play more hands and more wildly, but I think she knows her image. I think she knows that people probably think she's insane after that hand, and she's played really solid. But the knight is still young. There's time for her to get out of line, and she's going to start doing it. All right. Me and Robbie haven't played a hand yet. Oh, we got it. What do you call them? Stragglers. Zero effects. That's what they call him. Okay. Check. 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 All right. <laughs> oh. Look at all the space help you gave me. Look at that. And, uh, Robbie's going to bet again. It's not going to work. What a life. Oh. And it's time. She's going to need an ace or a five on the river. This pot's going a different direction. And Queen is going to lock it up. He didn't, he didn't for Aussie okay. Al, small pot considering the hands. I think Damn it. Al probably Damn wish it. he raised. He just rivers the f out of us, and even then I would have lost. <laughs> look, look. Oh, wait. <laughs> and even then, <laughs> loser. I was waiting for you. You were waiting for Robbie. Wait. I was waiting for Robbie. Bad read. Yeah, that was a bad read. Yeah, you like that way. So, uh, really, uh, Yeah, you weren't gonna bet there. Come on. No. Like he's thinking like you're like the some bad Robbie. Hair. I was thinking she was gonna play. No. What did you think I had? You had to worry about me too. Oh, you were just scared. <laughs> no one's worried. We're just scared. They're just too. You're just us. playing as like a bully, so <laughs> you don't have shit. Have you know, I could see some potential chemistry had, with had, Aussie Al and Robbie. Yeah, he did. I don't want to make had, a bold prediction, but I yeah. there's a little uh, a little bit of a uh, vibe going there. Well, maybe that's just me. Yeah, so, you know, pairs are rare. I had the dumbest hand. In what I regard? Swear, like, what created you know, just good friends. Oh, God. Table mates. Right, right. Yeah. <laughs> Talk some strategy, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Drink some vino. Eric is still working on that champagne. It's bouncing around in his cup. Pairs are rare. He's getting another hand. I mean, why stop now? And the driver, it's been quiet for a while. Really like how Yang's played tonight. Super solid. The accountant looks like he's going to need another glass of vino. I think he might have ran out. Is it on? Oh, I'm a small boy. I check. Check. 500? Red jack of clubs. Red jack of clubs? Yeah. Call. Uh, T7, that's 500. Call. Hold. Heads up. Five thousand. Fold. C two. Five thousand. Not fold. Fold. Damn. Jack nine. Slipper. I, I add it. You add it. I add it. First you add it. It's so slippery. Sometime I want to get the account. Can 
I hope you guys are enjoying the stream. We're at Live at the Bike. I'm Dankness3, joined by Yale, and we're hovering around 650 likes right now, so what I'm going to need you guys to do is get up somewhere, stand on a chair, stand on a table, stand on a couch, and I'm going to need you to dive off the ring like The Rock in a WWE match and completely smash the like button until it's broken. And if we get to up to 900 likes, I'm told by our producers that we're going to do overtime tonight. So who knows how late we could go if you guys just Hulk slam the like button and get us to 900. But then you fight, and now... And now you're like, you Now you're like, who did this? Are you new? Obviously, I'm going to tell you, but it's like... Oh, OK. Yeah. But none of these chumps ever oh. order good wine, right? <laughs> no, right? I, I just have to give you your... your, your, your I thought I was, so like, far, doing myself doing a good. favor by doing this. Because I like to do it with my hand. Um, yeah. Okay. No, no, I got it. I got it. Don't worry. Like you, with these wines, you want uh, a okay. guy yeah. who buys yeah. the bottle. No offense on you. Mm -hmm. Whoever so buys sorry. the uh, bottle should pour it. Oh, yeah. So you know. Oh, okay, so on uh, expensive bottle, anything over $100, you should leave it to whoever bought the wine. Okay? So you know. Okay, I right, keep the change. Thank you. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Hey, I'm having an extra good night. Take an extra 100. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right, we got another bottle. So a little wine etiquette there. Apparently the buyer I'm gets to pour. Oh my God. Yeah, sure. So Eric has been pouring all night. Wine, problem? champagne, uh, yeah. you name it. Oh. Good luck. He's pulling off another bottle. I think that might be Opus. <coughs> Beautiful wine selection. Opus, Camus. I mean, we're, we're a long way from supermarket wines here, Gail. We're really in the, the high stratosphere. I think, a, you know, the game should have a sommelier, honestly, the way it's going. Is that how you say it? Sommelier, yeah, I think you drilled it. You want to buy a glass? Yeah, big name California, man. That's how okay. you know, like, man, I think California wine. Multi-million dollar houses, <laughs> yeah. like, hey, you got to have the high-end California. I'm a Bordeaux yeah. guy, but they're California guys, so. Yeah. I'd I'd teach their own. Bordeaux is, uh, it's in France, right? Oh, yeah. There French go, region, yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, uh, beautiful vineyards out there. Anyway, I mean, the producers are getting in on the drinking. Is that is that one of our producers <laughs> getting a glass from Eric? It's just, give the camera guy some. I mean, can we get the dealer a glass the way this is going? <laughs> the guy says no. The camera guy says no after Eric offers. The, the generosity of the mad genius truly knows no bounds. What's a three side? Like a, how do I explain three side? Like a six, seven. A middle eight card. Yeah. You want to just fold? He's got like double I vision. Extra. I have king seven of diamonds, but I mean like. I got that correct. You want to just yeah, so Meanwhile, Eric's just, he doesn't even want to go to flops anymore. He's tired of beating these guys. He's given, he's given Al his money back or something. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? It's his night. He's just on the alcohol train at this point. I mean, it's gonna be it's gonna be straight booze on it. This man, something tells me he could go a few more bottles before we even see a change in his demeanor. What a beast! The mad genius putting on an absolute clinic tonight. All of the energy has been sucked up to that section of the table. Yeah, but the guy drinking the wine usually gets the no, but like, but thank you. We gotta look out. If I win like that, I just can't. Like. This Thank poor camera guy is just trying to take some nice shots for the company, and he's getting offered a bottle of Op Opus One. The discipline on this guy is incredible. Still don't know what the car or the driver drives. I'll tell you what, in chat, if there's any way to do this, I don't know. I can't guarantee it, but if we can... We can do a little giveaway. If anybody can correctly it, guess the exact car of the driver, and we can go back and chat and scrape it, I'll personally Venmo you guys $500. And uh, I, I won't be held to that if we can't get back in the chat, but anybody guess the driver's exact car? Um, Yang, he's some type of race car driver, and we don't know the specifics. The accountant... I'm going to take this one down. He's actually got the best hand, but he's bluffing. Yang's a little curious. Had the diamonds on the turn. He's going to let it go. And the accountant, just hanging around, got to see, got front row courtside seats to the Helmuth show tonight. He may not be winning in the game, but he's winning in life. What other joy are you going to get today? Just kidding. You got a girlfriend? And you Eric, did? just... When did that happen? Are you guys going to join us for dinner? I mean, we might have to go get some wine for oh, this place. Yeah. We missed out on at least a few glasses so far. Yeah, just see one of us rolling in there. I mean, the camera guys are getting freaking bottles. We could... We might get a whole case if we walk in there. 
I hope Eric's out on the floor after oh, we wait. get out of here. I want to party with him tonight. Hope my wife isn't watching this. He's back at it. King seven suited. Cheers. Looking like aces, wired up the way he's running. And speaking of aces, Yang with sharp tops shoots it up to 4,000. Eric, oh my God, Eric just best. just lets it go. For a better game. I, my I God. Paid, I would have paid money. Just, the guy's in the freaking matrix to tonight. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I would have paid money. I would have, I would have paid more money if you stacked him. But, you know. Me and Bill are actually buddies now, so it's cool. So I can no, I, jab I got it, I got it. I got it, I got it. Uh, and, I mean, this is just crazy. That was the no, best. Do you actually think this Yang guy yeah, is a race car driver? By the way, it's someone told you're, you're, me. I mean, it's, it's no, gonna be no, funny no, if he's not, if he's just like a pro. You're right. That's what that's what I'm starting to wonder at this point. Maybe it's like guys just around her. Four hours down, and this dude's like, yeah, he's been. I, I just can't. I just very can't. solid. Yeah, he's probably been playing high stakes in Macau for like eight years. Right. Yeah. And I'm thinking he's like a Formula One driver over here. Somebody get us the info on this guy. Chat. You get the correct guess of the car. I'm Venmoing you five hundred dollars. That's my personal money. I swear. There's no diamond. Oh, is this like a Slay adjacent, like, no, 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 no. you know, Venmo? Yeah. Slay whatever. asks for money. Right. Oh, yeah. you're, you're giving it. I'm giving it. it. I'm yeah. giving it. Yeah. Like okay, you guys cool. don't even definitely know. not from the in, Live at the Bike. That money is definitely from yeah. uh, not from Live at the Bike. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> and the accountant picks up Sharp Tops just in time. He's going to be real steamed if nobody calls, but he gets Berkey in there. The account's oh, no, feeling no, good. The Vino's flowing. He he's got aces. No, no action, yeah, though. He's not but he's not, he's not down too much. That one was good. Shows Berkey the sharp tops. That was no good. Huh? I had the nine ten off. That's not the fucking one to see when you fall. Oh, yeah, I had these things. But he has, like, you know. Chat's seeming to come through. They found him on Google. Oh, shit. You forgot about Google, Will. No, but you, you. All right. Well, here's the stipulation: no Google. You have to, you have to figure it out. Didn't yourself. you mean his regular car anyway? No, no, no. His race car. It's his race car. People are guessing. Like anybody Subaru. can guess the exact race car. <laughs> Bet's a bet. Oh my. Okay. Nice of you to give me that. Cool. That's for him. That's for him. Three thousand. I just, I don't have any money. I gotta look big, you know. But. People are raised to 500. If Phil's here tomorrow, I'm, well, I'm coming tomorrow for sure. Oh, geez, if Phil's here, I'm here too. <laughs> yeah, Phil, Let's like go. Call. Like Me and my 10K, we're, we're ready to go. Like or something. Is that all you started with? What is no, you don't 20. have a big left. Has anyone won a Jack 4 bounty yet? No. 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 I, I haven't got Jack 4 the whole night. It's always on the board in no, in no one's hand. Uh, yeah. I, don't, yeah. I haven't got Jack 4 the whole night. How come so. I forget I'm playing the game? So I don't even. But like when you see it, just. Yeah, yeah. Check. 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 Sir? A little pre workout? No, I've uh, yeah. I've never drank. Where are people drink? That's why you look 50. Yeah. Jesus, exactly. Christ. It's been a hard, hard road, you know? I'm not, but I'm like growing gray hair after I've started playing here. Gray hair is hot though. Yeah, like, well, this hair looks nice. nice. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm not into that. My dad was like all gray. I, I wouldn't cool. do that. Eric continuing to run hot. I wanted a piercing when I was a teenager. Rivering two pair. To me, she's like, call your dad. And He's ask just going to win himself another one. I never did. So Stack that was over a half oh. mil. Scared of your dad. Huh? Me meanwhile, we're getting no, the initial storing on why accounting like, doesn't very, have piercings. Like, very traditional and not like... No piercings. And my mom knew Potentially that. an orthodox family for the accountant. Piercings aren't permanent. It didn't strike me, but piercings maybe Christian yeah, yeah. I'm not here to speculate. The vino is flowing. One of our producers just got a nice <laughs> bottle of Opus. Sorry. You go to a restaurant, that'll cost you at least 25 But here, if you're playing with Eric, it's free. I had no idea we're neighbors. And we're going to be best of friends. Yeah, we are. We're neighbors. You see a big German shepherd, it's probably me. The accountant has a German shepherd. That explains a lot. I it too. Uh, I, he's probably eating your dogs for lunch. No, my dogs probably want to like attack him. Yeah, they do. Right? It's like lunch for him. This guy. But like my littlest one. Like, I don't know what type dog. of dogs Robbie has, but I'm guessing like Pomeranian. Uh, yeah. Pitbull. And the great dance like, what are you? My yeah. yeah. He's like, please stop, you little mouse. Berkey with aces. 
They're like the villages. The aces have been going around a little. It's been quiet, but Berkey has aces. They were sitting on the driver looks interested. 100%. The dogs just having a on the bar seats and like Rick Crusoe's right next to him, like which is like he's like the mayor of LA practically. No, I'm never getting invited to this game. Thanks, guys. The account's out. Berkey and Yang are going to the flop. Berkey's got aces. Yang just has 6-4 off. I'm rich, bitch. Flop is jack-8-9, so Berkey should just bet and take this down. I was just this close to getting invited to Field's game. He checks, though, and the turn is a king. He might want to now, though, to get you back. Yeah, he might want to get you back. It might be the best I, thing that could happen. I'm gonna happen. try. This out. Like all the cool kids <laughs> playing Christ. for his can I, game. Can I see the river? Are you yeah. in this game already? R uh, rabbit. Uh, uh, I played it once, but I don't need it. King yet. 10. You have that yeah. beat? Yes. You do? Yeah. Someone lives up no. there. Oh. It's like, no. Did I just get out of it? I get your stack. No way. Yeah. I have King Jack. Better. Oh, no, not, not better. Not Never mind. That's a lie. Accountant stays, saves his stack with a disciplined fold of King-10 preflop. Ber Berkey most likely would have got him with the sharp tops there. Very solid night from the Accountant, has avoided disaster and hung around for what has to be one of the most entertaining streams ever. And it's not just because of my commentary, guys. There have been some fun hands. Now I'm, now I'm drunk. We started off slow. We <laughs> had a few money. mishaps, but hey, hey. now we're drinking you Opus with the Mad Genius. I mean, get the dealer a glass, my man. Hey, hey, how was Am I in trouble? Fine. I, I would have paid money for that. You look like a guy who's bring bad news. It couldn't have happened to a better person. <laughs> Mad Genius is worried the gaming commission might have showed up to confiscate some of his winnings. Potentially an inside job, but looks like he's in the clear. You realize like like an H. Meanwhile, Berkey like is getting like after Aussie Al. He's got ace nine of diamonds. This is pretty good. He four bet. It's pretty close. And Al, no, sorry, Al has four bet with ace king of hearts, and Berkey has a look in his eyes. He's not folding. In position, suited ace. Al has been a little frisky. Betterhelp.com. I mean, that's a cooler, so it's like let it go. And nobody flops anything really, but Al's got the betting lead. He's got a backdoor flush draw. I think we're going to see him stab here. Yeah. Yeah, what's his name? Jordan Harbinger is always advertising that. I mean. Therapy.com. <laughs> uh, it's the same thing. It's, uh... And Berkey folds. Really kind of harmless flop. On the bluff. He I mean, folds very quickly, so and it's probably good. Oh, with the best hand. Who's our people? Played really solid two tonight. A lot of really solid play tonight, honestly. What time is it? And I think Eric, I don't even okay, know what so he's no, doing. I think back. he's trying to get some people on the floor, some wine. Can we just start the... Uh, we can start two. Yeah, two. Like, yeah, yeah. Valley's Big Bet Poker is proud to feature world-class faded spade playing cards. Use code BIGBET gets you 15% off a two-deck set of the new 3.0 version at fadedspade.com. Eric Hicks massively covering the table with half a million chips in play. Yeah, we're at the rare situation where Eric almost has as many chips as the rest of the table combined. Ace, king, king, queen. Almost everybody rocking over a 30. Yeah, Phil Helmuth with a 39% VPIP. You see that tonight, and then you see the blood. The red number, $193,600 down the drain. Eric is up over 250 a quarter million dollar session for Eric Hicks. He's already spent at least... A up one percent of that on Opus Wine. We'll see if he can get up into the double digits later. Robbie's picked up and check it out, Will. Kings for Berkey. Here we go. Robbie's just gonna call though, I think, because she's played really solid tonight. I just kind of called with these hands. But no, I'm wrong. She shoots it back up, and Berkey is absolutely loving life. He's waited all night for this spot. She's been mighty passive. This could set up a, set off a little bit of alarm bells. Yeah, but his hand's too strong yeah, for sure. Chips. Yeah. Hmm. Just two, yeah. Thanks. And he's gonna put in the four bet yeah. or five bet. I'm sorry, I've lost count, but this could be trouble for Robbie. Berkey is pretty active, and I don't think Robbie's going to fold. 
And that was historic. Thing. I could see her thinking Berkey's making a move and just shoving it all in, hoping to take it down. Two games later. Fuck this place, I'm out. She's using a time shift. You can see she's really interested. And Berkey's over there just praying for a shove. Not yet. You guys have more, uh, more, more. Uh, we just have the regular, which is that right. one. And then we're coming out later on with what's called black, so it'll be five times as hot. Oh, that's just like a. Because a lot of people, there's, there's like. The spice there's a certain amount of and just a call really from Robbie, hot. and here's the flop. Most people don't. Most people like. But Jack 10 9 Rainbow. Special hot. You eat it, yeah. and then you Berkey's wait. Berkey's got and then kings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a gut shot. And Robbie's just got ace king high. But yeah. she does have a higher gut shot. I think. It's, a, it's an interesting flop the, uh, for Berkey, too, because well, he's, oh, he's nice. basically yeah. representing aces or kings. And really like hot sauce. That flop really yeah. should hit Robbie harder uh, than him. To, uh, J-Town here, they're, they have like the ramen place that... But know, Berkey's going to bet it. On the wall if you go to the, he likes his hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To the yeah, top. Yeah. There's a, there's a metagame dynamic here that goes beyond range. You Berkey wants to get it. this in. Yeah. He wants to get more money from Robbie. That's 10000 challenge. Yeah, Robbie's yeah, got yeah, ace yeah. king. Volcano, really whatever. tempting yeah, price. Yeah, yeah. My it's not like white person spice. No, but that's, uh, that's and there the is the revenge factor with her and Berkey. Yeah. Yeah. You're trying to leave. I, go. You're trying to leave. I don't think she's going to let this go. My favorite thing is hot sauce. And that is, yeah. like, okay. originally, the original version of it. You know, she hasn't taken a lot of time tonight, so the fact that she's oh, using a time shift so really indicates to me I she's... I love sriracha. I think she's at least going to call. So, and it's different because I don't... Sarah, like the uh, sriracha is sweet. This is not like it's got pain. Berkey's but it's so not solid. Sweet. Just like yeah. it's different. He's, Again, he's ready to go with his hand. This is what he came sure. for. Fantastic. He Fantastic. just wants to get more money in and turn the cards Soups, over. Soups, burgers. I mean. Robbie is really interested. Happy I got my second bottle. There you go. Those heart shaped glasses staring over at Berkey's stack. Thinking, is this how I get this guy? Takes another peek. What's it gonna be, Robbie? Valentine's Day? You brought the red jacket out. Berkey, like a statue, not giving anything away. Just waiting. The most quiet the table's been all day. Yeah, it's a, you could hear a pin drop in the room. And she just lays it down. You know, I thought we might see more there just with their hands, but Robbie's been so solid tonight. Gotta give it to her, you know? She she can definitely yeah. definitely change up her style. Far cry from the Jack forehand tonight, even with the bounty on. Really solid fold. Also just nice hand from Berkey. He could have played it differently, but I like the way he just kind of went with it. And I know it seems straightforward, but hey, against Robbie, I wouldn't be so happy there, but... Again, that's why I'm in the booth and not playing for hundreds of thousands of dollars. Mad Genius has taken a break, but something tells me the break is very different from the one Helmet took earlier. Coming from him, Soldier's off. Oh, Oh my god. Oh my god. Berkey's gonna straddle. The accountant's in there. Oh, an accountant now has aces. They've been going around. Robbie's gonna play. She's got 9-8 off. Maybe a little steam from the last hand, who knows. Berkey's gonna defend with 8-4 of diamonds. Oh, and that is quite a flop. Berkey flops an open-ended straight flush draw. The account's got an overpair with aces, and Robbie has a gutter. Two thousand. And the accountant just clicks it. Robbie folds. Berkey's not getting away. He's in. And the accountant's gonna have to figure it out. He's he's not folding this. He's got too little behind. All in. There you go. All in. You have straight. Nope. Twice. Twice again. Good. Twice. You're gonna run it twice. Berkey's got a lot of equity. In PLO, this is the type of hand you want to have. Big draw. Now I do. And Berkey's got that one. Hitting the second nuts on the turn, but Accountant's dead. Eight is meaningless. Yeah. I'm going to go one more time. 
No, no, no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just yeah. turn river. Count needs to hold. That would hurt He's hold on all night. Oh, and that's a great turn for him. Well, it doesn't really change much, but he's going to scoop it with a set. Count is still alive. Hang it in there. Son of a bitch, when you snapped me, I was like, motherfucker, you got me. Accountant is really hanging around tonight. You can tell he's happy, too. Could be out of the game. He's made some big folds. He's hung around. Just like the IRS, just hanging around, never really losing money, taking a lot of money, sometimes not making any money for long stretches. But then... And there it is, Robbie, with the F yourself bomb to Berkey. Doesn't matter what timestamp you go to, he's like, Berkey, go fuck yourself. Wait, hold on. Here. Yeah, what got this all started? Pretty funny video where Robbie talks about Berkey uh, yeah, okay. selling his house and starting an OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> I would have thought that would be. Yellow. I'll tell you what, so, I think oh people would God. pay for an OnlyFans where it's just pictures of Berkey awesome. building his house. If, if that there's a way to go back in time and get those pics because... You said twice, not me, by the way. I'm picture, I think I'm Berkey built his own twice. house. I'm pretty uh, sure of that now. Guy. There's a lot of weird I niches in poker. So. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure play Berkey play. built his own house, and I think he has land in we'll building a future favors. house for them now as we speak. Likes to get his hands dirty. Oh. Likes to be in there, in the dirt. Oh. And how do I fold aces he's, I think he's still got a stack of Eric's like on. encroaching onto his hand every time he plays, but maybe that's his own chips. I don't know. But the action must keep going, and now Robbie has the aces. And Yang has a real hand here. Jax. But you can't feel great the way Robbie's played tonight. She's been so solid. If I just called a raise on the flop, I nailed it. What is Yang going to do? He's not folding. I mean, maybe I don't, you know. Bink. Just calls. Playing it safe. He's got to be raising a lot of alarm bells. He the ace of diamonds. Close. Yeah. That's, that's not a good flop for him, though. I, yeah, you still have like 25% of it. I do, it's like 50 50 for him. And Robbie checks. Yeah, but you see him fucking get there on the first card, like immediately. The way she's played tonight, I kind of love it. Account, sorry, Wang, Yang, I'm losing names here. Account, Yang checks back. An interesting check back by Yang there. The yeah, and yeah. Robbie's <laughs> actually going to win the minimum here, I think, unless she gets a value bet in on the river. $16,000 pot. <laughs> it's tough for Yang to call anything now. He's really saved himself. No, hey, 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 hey. Yeah. Oh, yeah, like 20 k pot. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. Fantastic. Love it. Dot, dot, dot. To chop. The job. Oh, that's the worst. By the way, Robbie's going to bet 5K. Uh, you guys made a video out of uh, pot the Yang like folds and gets away from Jax for really cheap there. Robbie checks the flop, and honestly, I kind of like it the way she's played, but the, yeah, the yeah, king no. and the queen coming really cost her any more money there. I'm not like outgunned infinitely. Playing with like kids' chips. Need about 100 likes in the next 40 minutes. So error, as Will said, next time we'll get him. pile drive that like button. Get him next time. Yeah, treat that like button like a wrestler Apparently and throw it into the, the stream. I'm moving thumb Vegas. that you have or the elbow or whatever you got. <laughs> Hit that like button. Uh -huh. Let's get to 900. Me and Yale are going to be here all night. Eric, I swear, is coming back. He's just taking a sweet little siesta. He's going to be drinking Camus. Who knows what's going to go on? We still got Berkey. We still got Robbie. We got the race car driver playing super solid. Maybe Eric's gonna go recruit no, no. Phil and like give him, put him in the game or something. Yeah, maybe Eric is out finding hey, Phil, whoa, whoa, trying whoa. to get a little bit more money out of him tonight. Apparently, two hundred thousand isn't enough. Robbie's got a nice hand here, Ace Jack of Hearts on Valentine's Day. She's fallen in love, and she okay. makes it okay. fourteen hundred. The account's in there with Ace Five off. You know, the account has been all over the map tonight, just hanging around. Neighbors. He's going to peel. Neighbor, neighbor. And he gets a pretty nice Check. flop. Check. Little gutter ball. Check. Robbie checks back. And that's a really nice turn for Robbie. Check. And the account leads for 1,000. Robbie's not going anywhere. Nine raise. 3, she hits him with the raise. I, I think this is going to send the accountant packing. 3,000 raise. Really nice raise from Robbie. She knows where she's at. The accountant's gonna live to fight another day. It's not quite Hold. tax season yet. Hold. I'll let you pick one card. Can I turn it over? Hmm? I think.
think Joey Ingram has the same jacket as the accountant. I could be wrong, but I feel like I've seen Poppy in that jacket before. Strong jacket. Well, no, I had the king of hearts. And I also so. believe Yale has the same jacket as Robbie, but I'm not sure. Eric right now is like the guy. I'm not afraid. Yeah. I'm very secure in my masculinity. Local fishing tournament. <laughs> a strong man. And went to Yale, the bar in the booth with me. You know, to see all of his, oh, yeah. his old buddies. Oh, like sorry. walking around the room with his chest buffed out a little bit. Hey, how's it Alan Barry's in chat well. asking if Will Jaffe's well, well. commentating. You know him? Is he East Coast guy? Yeah, me and Alan Barry go way back. He doesn't play poker anymore though, but we used to we used to grind back in the day. Like a chef. He got out, he started a little beautiful little eatery in New Jersey or something, just got out of the game. Still looks still looks kinda like he's tilted, but you know. <laughs> some people never change. Robbie picking up Ace King. She's been getting a lot of hands recently. She was kinda dead earlier in the night. She's three betting the accountant. And JD's got kings. JD with the cold four ball to 10K with kings. The man who invented Havo hot sauce has the second best starting hand in poker history. And Robbie's got ace-king off. She's had these situations down. I, I don't think she's just going to give it away here. She's going to use a time chip. How much is that? Just a quick count. Like 35. Robbie 35? has no idea. She looks like About. she wants to fold. I, that's my guess from here. All in. Never mind. In. As usual, my reads are terrible. She's all in. JD's going to snap. And she's got ace king, and she's going to need yeah. some help. I got you right now. You want to run it twice? Twice. Twice. <laughs> Fine. We're having a little dispute here. Robbie wants to go twice. It's like 50K total for what it's worth. We got a hundred and eight thousand dollar pot. Twice. I'm pretty sure. Twice good. Yeah, twice good. I always wanted twice. But. Robbie's gonna need an ace. It's not gonna do it. That's the kind of thing. Really good flop for JD. I feel like he's got queens, kings, with the F. You're right about that, Robbie. He's got kings. That's going to be him. That's you ran twice. Oh, that's you? That's definitely me. Oh, shit. Oh, that's not good for Robbie. I thought she got it. That's definitely me. I thought I got there, too. Damn it. Give me an ace. Robbie's going to need an ace. He might just have aces. Maybe pick up a wheel draw. Nope. Just an ace and an ace only. Unless he has aces. A set of kings. Fuck. I thought he had kings. He's like, that's definitely me. He's like, that's definitely me. And Robbie makes a misstep there. She's played really solid in it. Also, just a cooler for her. Ace King offsuit. I was thinking, oh, yes, yes, Queen. Oh my God. No, it's still on Eric. Gross. It's on Nice. Eric gets back just to subtly needle JD, who is up a lot less money than him, saying dinner's on him. Oh my god. That was sick. And he need to raise me again. I'm not gonna flip out. I'm not gonna flip out. Thanks for letting me run it twice. You're welcome. Oh man, what happened here? JD's just wrecking in your absence. That was generous of JD to run it twice. A lot of people like to do the same thing every time. And Robbie asked, so he offered the man who created Habo hot sauce, a Cabo inspired habanero sauce. I get it. You're on vacation. You're eating tacos. You're and drinking tequila. Two yellows in the you're in Cabo, in the but you want hot sauce. Okay? Get yourself some Cabo. That is about fifty thousand dollars in real U.S. money, believe it or not. Those purples count for about twenty. The stacks of black underneath, dark brown with a blue hue. Each $5,000 chips. It's a nice little pot coming JD's way. He's played really solidly tonight. He's pulling the aviators off, which is not easy to do. Let's have a really nice gleam. He's got a magic necklace on, and the man just seems kind of blessed. And Eric, with a congratulatory pound, that table has really, that side of the table has really dominated tonight. I mean, between Eric and now JD, it doesn't really feel like the other side has won many pots. Yang's certainly been trying. Al's been playing well. The accountant's been grinding, but a big chunk taken out of Robbie there. How does she rebound? You know, she's played really solidly tonight. She hasn't really looked to get involved. And now she's stuck a little in the game. So maybe that opens her up. Eric is back, and 
Obviously, he's posting, my man. Huh? I don't know. What are we doing? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll just, I'll just side. No, no, I'm gonna, str I'm gonna straddle. And he's gonna straddle in from an unknown position. Straddle for a thousand. Oh, okay. Five, he's gonna straddle in for okay. straddle. one of those yellow chips, yeah, which is a thousand dollars. I know it may not look like it, but if you take those chips to a cage, they will give you a thousand real dollars for that. Yeah, it goes after the straddle. So there's a thousand dollar straddle on now. The accountant is going to call with queen six suited. Al picks up fives and he's going to raise. 4,500 from Al with pocket fives. The mad genius is going to let it go. Al takes down the pot. He's played really well tonight. Very solid player from Australia. <laughs> Aussie Al. Yeah. A rare I pot for that side of the table. Blood. He's just like <laughs> hanging around. Hanging Eric around. left the glasses for some reason. Will, I, I, I think Eric that's kind of lost the glasses. I'm not sure what happened, but Accountant is loading up for another glass, and Eric's not going to stop him. Yeah. Accountant really pulling off the Joey Ingram look tonight. I like it. Very smooth. God, Looks like he might own a motorcycle. Anxiety as that took place. Berkey's got the Joey Ingram look too. Berkey has the poker version. He's got the Joey Ingram grinder version. Oh, that's the grinder version, yeah, when, the grinder I, when, version. I, when I see him yeah. playing the four card out there? Yeah, it counts the Joey Ingram, you know, that you see out at win at XS. Berkey's got the Joey Ingram at 510 PLO at the you know, Rio type of look going. Go. A lot of jackets, a lot of leather on the table. But it's a poker game. What do you expect? These men and women have come to gamble. Their wishes have been granted. The wine is flowing. The chips are flying. We need 100 more likes or something to get to overtime, and, and we'll be here as long as they force us to be, or we choose to be, or either simultaneously. Check. Okay. Flush draw, natural. That's what I had. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Flush draw. We'll see if he has. Flush draw, flush draw. Yeah, yeah, that'd be great. 3,000. Accountant just hanging around, rivers the two piece. He's still got that $25 chip that was Helmuth's last chip. Helmuth forgot that chip. Accountant offered it to him, and, and Helmuth declined. And I think Accountant might hold on to that chip because in an auction, that might, fe that might fetch some, some nice coin for him. I love it. You know, you got Tom Brady's touchdown pass, Aaron Judge's record breaking home run for the Yankees, and Phil Helmuth's last 20. 25 green chip. I could see that going for at least 10k. I mean, certainly if he retires from uh, you you live stream that. cash games, yep. <laughs> I think you're onto something. You just to yeah, leave. well, I might have to. We might have to send the floor down to try to swipe that from the account. He's been drinking a lot. I think we get our hands on that thing. I think the commentators deserve a little, a little something. The commentators something. deserve a little kickback for our hard work. JD picks up jacks. Accountant's getting in there. Hmm. He's got 9-8 off. Listen, my plane has costs, okay? How'd that hand go off? Was it good? Chat urging people to smash that like button. 30 minutes left. Need about 40 likes. And that's a close ratio, guys. What is the video you're going to That was good? Who the fuck is playing me? I always... I'm counting. What do you have behind? What do you behind? Drop the mic. That was some brave heart shit there at the end, too. Yeah, I mean, no, but I'm telling you, that's one of my top poker moments ever. Yeah. Because I've been dreaming of stacking that guy forever. <laughs> it's true. Every poker player's dream. It's not busting Helmuth out of a tournament, because honestly, a lot of us have done that. It's busting him from a big cash game for a lot of money. And Eric's dream has come true tonight. <laughs> That's cool. No, that makes sense. Some some money. Money. I thought you might have a king. I would have, I would have given you some money. By the way, if, you don't even if I had a king, I would have given you some money. Adele, I'm just curious, is that row of blacks Berkey's or Mad Geniuses? Because if it's Mad Geniuses, he's really got Berkey fenced in there. <laughs> and the poor guy just does not have a lot of room to maneuver. Yeah, I got you on the final table. Definitely Mad Geniuses. It's got to be Mad Geniuses. <laughs> Berkey set it up for him, too. That's the worst part. Barely has room to shuffle his cards. Uh, yeah, sure. No, he, he's raising for Mad Genius. He, that's why it is. It's, it's Mad Genius' stack, but Berkey's doing the the, the actual execution. So he, he just, that's just been clarified. <laughs>
I make it to a final Berkey just clarified that he's going to take care of that section. I'm going to play with you. Yours is the first book I ever read because I'm sitting right next to Phil Helmut. And I, 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 I put out my hand and he ignored me. Just, just oh, slowly no. get yourself unstuck and here he is, there. 400 at a time. Here he is, <laughs> a professional <laughs> poker player. And here I am. Just the guy who plays one event a year, and this is the one event I'm playing in. And he does that shit to me. I don't, still don't know what he's thinking. You know what I mean? Wow, and, and Eric. Then, uh, uh, anyways, he goes on to win a bracelet in that event, and I get knocked out in ninth. I was like the first to get knocked out on the final table. Eric, with a little backstory. And after that, I go, man, one of these days. He wanted that Helmuth piece, and he he's got it. That bounty, and he got it in spades. Yeah, when those stop being $100 chips, you're too rich. The man asked Helmuth for a handshake in a live tournament, got showered, and now busts Helmuth. And speaking of busting, JD and the accountant trying to finish the man off, but he's got two pair. He's hung around all night, and he's in good shape here to double. Don't worry, JD. I'll run once you do, because if we get it all in, I'm way behind. And the accountant is going to need to dodge a jack or a 10. He does. Is that you? Is that you? And the count's going to scoop here, okay. staying alive. Back to 20,000. You know, because now me and Helmut are doing Berkey, you're right. It does feel better. Yeah. A mere right. flesh wound for JD. Yeah. Were you trying to tell me you didn't just do a lap around the, the bike real quick? Hey guys, how's it going? Tom, haven't seen you in a while. Yeah, did you see that hand up there? It's not to help me. No, 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 I wouldn't Here, he likes I've got him. I've yes! Oh, okay. Yeah. Time is running out, guys. You have about 25 minutes to get to this like total. Yes, thank you. I'm going to need you to get up on the highest object in your house and somersault off backwards and smash into the like button so we can go OT tonight. Me and Yale, a little more extra money in our pockets, a little more entertainment for you guys. Let's try to get there. It's coming down to the wire. And if anybody got the race car that Yang drives, let me know if we can find that person, because I do want to follow through on that bet, even though I definitely got the wrong side of it. Yeah, that wasn't your best moment. No, I, I make bets like that all the time. Anybody who knows me knows I'm a good person to bet with. If you, if you know how to use Google. I don't know. What am I? So yeah, a little bit of a backstory there. My favorite is Jack Ten. Eric was playing with a Helmuth at a World Series event. Wanted to shake his hand. Helmuth said no. Wait, Helmuth went on to win the event. Know. Eric got ninth. You don't know how often I try and to tip the, uh, waitress ever since then, he's been uh, waiting for this moment. So the, the man embarrassed him in the tournament. No, they take it every time. <laughs> and now he stacks him. Doesn't even stack him, just takes his soul at the table. Sends him home. <laughs> Well, I mean, guy, this has to be, know, this man has accomplished a lot in his life, but this has to be near the tip top. No longer there. Thousand. Bet one thousand. thousand. Come on, Berkey. Just one fucking thousand dollars. Jesus Christ. Don't be a cheap ass That's like this dude over here. Too much. Too Can't much afford it. Oh, Counting's looking to gamble. He's got oh. the king queen. I folded a pair. I folded a set of nine. Robbie, are you okay with wine? What's that? Are you okay with wine? With who? With wine. You got the opus. Oh, uh, you want to give me more? Uh, yeah, of course. Had a rough night. And it looks yeah, like Robbie's running a little low on wine, so she's going to get a top off. Take it all back. Oh my God, Let's Jay. Go. Let's go. See the pouring skills of Eric here. Pouring skills. Look at that pour. Oh Not binding. Still sturdy. Hey, those lipsticks. Beautiful pour. The man is solid. <laughs> Something tells me it's going to be a long night. Nice. Thank you. The opus is flowing. Okay. Berkey has never had a drink in his life. He's got to be tempted the way that wine is flowing. Nah. I guess he's Thanks. gone this long. It's not gonna. It's gonna take more than a bottle of Opus every minute in front of your face. What do they call that? Tea, you teetoler? Tea, you know that expression? Sure. No. Premium <laughs> hands. Premium. Not hands. familiar with that premium one, yo. Premium. <laughs> you think I made it up, but I didn't. Yeah, would have like snapped you off, but that donkey over there had to like <laughs> do the honors. They finally dealt me in. Not familiar with it. But we got a hand here, and Aussie Al has has three bet with King Jack suited, a beautiful hand, hearts, and Berkey has four bet with 10-7 of hearts. Vintage Berkey. Vintage Berkey taking the suited connector on Valentine's Day, loving the hearts, and if we see a couple more hearts, it's going to get bad for Berkey real quick. Very cheap. And Al flops top pair. 
Sorry, Berkey flops Jeez, top pair. Give me another hug after the stream. That was amazing. Out checks. I just wish she took the rest of What's it. Berkey going to do? I know, man. Spades out there. He's batting. This is a bonus. I would have been like, here, here's 20 grand. Like for that. And he's going to take it down. Nice hand down from Berkey using the suited connector in the Joey Ingram grinder jacket, playing very solidly tonight, and more importantly, coming with the fire. Tons of needles, tons of jokes from Berkey. Clearly the OnlyFans pod has been... Sorry, yeah, the only friends out. pod has been paying well, dividends for my man. Looks natural up there. Dance. He's now won 30 of 34 sessions. Long <laughs> 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 <Wow. laughs> needles continue. I mean, he this is just. Even after all can we let the man oh, just man. sleep in his grave for one this night? Guy. Yeah. If I won 30. Central, just put him on stage, get him on stage, get some seats. Yeah. Yeah. If I won 30 of 32 sessions, I would be up. Mid what does he mean by that, though? Uh -huh. like, what does he uh, mean by 30? The last 32 no. times he's played, he's won. But if like he didn't won it, every he single cash game. Has, so has he? In character to wreck it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. They're talking about how Helmuth has won 30 of his last 34 sessions. Oh, I thought you were going to bet like and he's somehow going to be in the red, a pretty big number. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> Why not? But we got action. It's not slowing down. Al raises with queen jack of clubs. Berkey's going to shoot him up from the cutoff with pocket tens. Seamstress? Jesus. The account's talking about seamstresses. He's been extremely, extremely um, <laughs> open with his range tonight of subjects. Al just keeps kind of whiffing these flops, and Berkey's going to love it. Over pair. Eric's getting a little low on the opus. I think we're going to see a refill. You know, we can set the line at 30 seconds, but I would take the over. There it is. You're a loser. I set the line a little too high. You're cold on gambling tonight. I'm a bad gambler, yo. Yeah. The only one you the only one you got right was refusing me on the uh Well, on the I Phil think you also session. offered that one incorrectly. I did. Yeah. yeah I think I the 2.5 two was the other way. No, I was I laying. Gotten jack for it. Oh, you were laying. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I uh I would have taken it. I thought I thought you wanted me to lay 2.5. No. I guess yeah, oh. we haven't determined. Come on. So we're still going guys, getting down to the wire here. On likes. I don't know where we're at. I'm going to need to ask a statistician. We've got a quant working on it as we speak. <laughs> Relax on the fucking chocolates, man. Yeah, he's like, he's like, fuck the chips. They almost made it 11,000, you know, chill out. <laughs> Eric, you should have made it 11. Brick, you would have folded. Maybe. No. He would have seen through that. And Eric is literally shining. I mean, he's literally shining right now. Berkey, you have to admit, this is a good game. A What's game. this, guys? I'm just getting word from our quant that we've hit a thousand likes, which means we have to keep going indefinitely. So thank you guys for doing whatever you did to that like button. If you just hit it with the elbow, if you gave it a punch, if you just tapped it, you made this happen. No, I'm, I'm cold hard as fuck. You haven't met anybody. Cold as ice table. The accountant telling us the truth. He's cold hearted. Maybe a heartbreak as a kid, but either way. Dude, when I You've lose, got action. I Something's happening. I, mean, yeah, I, like, I, I can't keep up with it. It's too fast-paced. There's plenty of money in there. Take it all. So he's like down 350. I can't. Oh my god, I'm done. Camera loves you, baby. I tell myself all the time. There's a lot of really friendly faces for the camera here. Between JD, the accountant, like 300 even Berkey tonight, with the Joe Ingram leather jacket. Eric, I mean, just stealing the show. Just literally sparkling. I hope. There are some people hitting the chat right now. Some late arrivers after they're... They were out with their girl, their wife, whatever. They want to know. Yes, Phil Helmuth is down nearly $200,000 and has left the stream. Eric Hicks is the big winner tonight. It was a classic Phil Helmuth blow-up night. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, if you were irresponsible tonight and you took your significant other out for a date instead of watching the stream, you missed Helmuth losing a... Two hundred thousand oh, dollars almost, I got a premium. and all of that pretty much has gone to the mad genius, who is five at least four Opus bottles in, and the night is still young for him. We're gonna try to meet up with him after this stream and see what's going on. But this has been a honestly a legendary performance, Yale. You know, Jordan has the flu game. Three dollars. Uh, you know, LeBron has the the Cleveland series against Golden State, and now, now Yale. 
the mad genius has a, a trophy night to add to his, you know, he, he, he made a bike called the Lunacycle. I'm sure it made him a lot of money. I'm sure he's had a lot of other great accomplishments in night. But tonight, tonight must be the top for him. Oh yeah, and he gets his revenge. To get, once I heard the revenge part, I knew that this was it. I mean, <laughs> to offer Helmuth a handshake of all people, you know, it's an aggressive move. It's a dangerous gamble, and it didn't pay off for him. And years later, he guts him on Live at the Bike. Sends Helmuth to the showers. See, like, this is what I'm saying, like, I love if it. you're down, you can't get up. Yeah, yeah you can't get up. I don't you gotta, get it. Get I don't, get, I don't even get the ideology. Where am I going, man? I'm fucking No, my stuck. point man, is. You don't want Berkeley to stay. Oh. I'll stay here. Um, you don't want Berkeley you're, you're to stay. Charles Barkley, right? Yeah. My point is, when you're down significantly, what, you're going to leave now? No. Like, when you're down? I don't it makes no sense, right? It makes right? zero, zero sense. sense. I don't have that discipline. Wait, especially in a plus EV scenario. Or when you're 3,000 I mean, big blinds deep. She's just cold. How are you going to get out of that? Oh, he's in big blinds deep. So the thing, down the, slope the thing with buying in for 300 is you need to be able to reload for 300 as well. Really? That's, yeah. That's the difficult. That's true, but he can, right? No. You, you so? just go get like, Whatever. You just go a million dollars and say, fuck it. You know, I'm not a huge fan um, of poker strategy talk at the table, but I don't mind this conversation. I mean, he's right. You got to right. reload for I'm that. I'm fixing to play a big one. So for, so I, I bought him for so 20 grand. grand. I'm ready to reload for 20 and, grand. And oh my God. Well, let's go. Just in time, Maybe not. Okay. Eric picks up That's Cowboys, good. and Berkey's got Jack Floor off, and he's going for the bounty. The bounty is still on. This was too much fun. Right, this right, dude, right, 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 right. you're back. Right. And right. Eric right. just called, so Berkey this, has the betting lead, and he's not going like to give Jesus. up. I mean, like, what are you going to do? He bet 7K, and Mad Jack. Genius is just going to milk him with the call. He's played it perfectly. The turn comes a four, and Berkey now makes bottom pair. I wonder if this will make him slow down. He's got to know the four is not good, and he does check. That was a good Valentine's Day. And Mad Genius is sitting there with cowboys. I go sleep on Berkey's couch after you. <laughs> Talks a little shit my and bets 15k. Instead of spending the day with me. So you better come home with more money than what you came with. Right. Because uh, I'm going home with yeah. negative. Uh, sorry, babe. Didn't get your yeah. gift. They took it all at the poker table. And Berkey doesn't look done with this. It's not just the Jack Four. It's that he's got the additional bounty on if he can win this hand somehow. But he's in bad shape. And the river is an ace. And Berkey might want to bluff at this. It's a really good river for him to bluff. Even though it doesn't make sense, it just hits him. And the specific hand that Hicks has, it's going to be tough for him. Like, Berkey looks like oh. he wants to do something. And there it is! Oh, Fuck. The all-in! How much is it? 63 mm -hmm. It doesn't make any sense. And Mad Genius is... is he's not just folded. He's got kings. He's assessing the situation. What would Berkey do this with? The alarm bells are going off for the mad genius. The open shove on the river from Berkey. And mad genius skulls! And he's going to win a $180,000 pot from Berkey! Oh, and he can't even think for more than a minute there. Shut! Yes! Yes! Uh, yes! And it gets the celebration Woo! pound from the you account in! Jack four off. I, I, I forgot about him. Fucking yeah, 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 Jack four off. Yeah. Berkey goes apeshit with the Jack four, wanting the bounty. For the boys. Woo! Give it up for Eric Hicks, everybody! Yeah. I mean, the man is literally shining. Never the legend of Robbie Jade Lou just <laughs> continues on, stronger than ever, with the Jack Wait. 4 Wait. bounty bluff. The Jack 4 bounty bluff oh, takes out God. Berkey. Helmuth's already been taken out by the mad genius. Now Berkey... Now we have a poker game. Let's you can go. say that again. <laughs> we do have a game. Mad Genius is stacking all the chips that poor Berkey held on for dear life. And now, now all of his stack is Mad Genius. Little boy with a dream and an electric bicycle. Oh, yeah, yeah. And here comes the speech. Wow. You see what kind of trouble you get people in? It's not your fault. It's not your fault. This is true. This is Robbie's fault. She started this. And here comes Berkey back. He's not going to quit. Okay, sure. You should give him He's here for the long haul. He's got the pouch. Probably going to reload for 100, but wow. 
accountant is having the time of his life. He's even in the game. He's bought in for 20. He's hung around for these front row seats for the Mad Genius show. And my God, what a display from Eric Hicks tonight. I can't believe that I just shot. Truly one of the most dominant performances in live stream history, to my knowledge. A chocolate stack, just a little pittance for the mad scientist, $100,000 going back to Berkey. No problem for the mad scientist, probably going on credit at this point, probably just wants to keep Berkey in the game after that one. I mean, the, didn't even really think about it. We got Joey Ingram in the chat. He's locked in on this game, Will. He said he did it for Robbie. <laughs> he's 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 back. He's off a hiatus. He's locked in. We got Joey back. Great news, guys. Joey's been on a Twitter vacation, clearing his mind, doing a lot of healthy things, staying off of social media. But he's back, and what a way to come back. What a beautiful game. I'm not even a huge fan of No Limit. I don't play it a lot more, but tonight has inspired me, and I'm going to get back in the game, Yale. You're going to see me grinding No Limit now. Cash games, tournaments, I'm back. This has been incredible. The Mad Genius has put on an absolute clinic. I mean, the guy's going to have a stacking problem. Poor Berkey is running out of real estate, just fresh off a new buy and He's looking at the chips. He's saying, can you get some of those chips out of my face, Mad Genius? Please, please give me some life here. Wow. Truly one for the ages tonight. I did not think this would be so entertaining. Mad Genius is sparkling like a diamond in a Taylor Swift video. Robbie's still going strong on the Opus. I mean, that is a nice cup of wine. Al's got the hot sauce. The accountant's just hung around all night. Had the time of his life in the process. He's gotten at least two free bottles of wine himself. Robbie's in there. She's still going. And Yang is still here playing incredible poker. JD, the creator of Havo Hot Sauce, is sitting there with a nice little win himself, and wow. Luckily, Helmuth left, so we have more extra room for Eric and his chips. Will Jaffe's first commentary, you just can't get enough of this. You're just... I didn't know what to expect, Yale, but this has been something else. It's been a really an it's epic a, it, night of poker and gambling, dreams being crushed, Oh, dreams I'm being made, childhood <laughs> dreams fulfilled for Eric Hicks, <laughs> adult <laughs> dreams fulfilled for Eric Hicks, everything you could hope for as a man. Wow. An accountant just sitting there with the Joey Ingram jacket, having a night. He's playing hands. He's getting in there. He came to play a little. He can have it. Ace 10 offsuit. Are you serious? I have, 20, I have 20 grand in front of me. At least raise it. Like, Christ. Like, yeah. You could raise yourself. Check. I check. Oh, Berkey. Sure, buddy. Catching some strays from the accountant. Sort of unnecessary. Right. No. You're not the gonna man just dusted off 100 on the Jack 4 bounty. Dollars. And he, now he's got accountant dropping okay. bombs on him. He's ready to play, though. He came back. He's not quitting tonight. Oh, accountant is having himself a night. He's almost <laughs> even. Nick, can you be at all of our games? All of them. <laughs> and Robbie, just what a game. My, me and my $65. I'll be in all of your games. Berkey, oh now the flames have started to heat up. The smoke is rising <laughs> from the Joe Ingram what? Club. Uh, sorry, the Joe Ingram grinder jacket. It's looking a little like, bit dustier. Like my man Berkey stuck a hundred ball. <laughs> and we got another promo for Faded Spade because these cards are so good we cannot stop talking about them. Bally's Big Bet Poker is proud to feature world class Faded Spade playing cards. Use code Big Bet, it gets you 15% percent off a two deck set of the new 3.0 version at fadedspade.com. Will just grabbed himself a couple of packs. We're going to get a little leaderboard. And Eric is now up $336,000. That's probably as much as he makes in a month at least. And the blood is all on Helmuth and Berkey's hands. The two, just the two name pros going down. What a night for poker. What a night for gamblers out there. I won't say that I was rooting for it because I'm a neutral observer, but a lot of people tonight wanted something to happen, and I think they got what they wanted. The night is still young, though. Berkey's in there. He can still battle. We're going to overtime. We got the likes we needed. Thank you guys for all that sweet work with your hands and fists and other body parts. Aussie Al with a three bet from Kings and the accountant just, he's managed to play like 40% of hands, hang around, drink two bottles of Opus and have the time of his life while watching Eric just slaughter the table. 
I mean, this is truly, truly one of the best games I've ever seen, and I'm not just saying that because I'm commentating. What a way to make your debut. I feel like we should just all, was it 50 or 20 you started with? I want to be in your mood. No, 20. And then Robbie, wishing she could go back in time and get the accountant stack. Just kind of a nice observer's little cozy stack that he's played well tonight. He's hung on. I mean, we're meeting at 8, right? I know, but I gotta go. Pick her up. Yeah. Now we're making dinner plans. I, I, I want to try to get in on the dinner with Eric because something tells me there might be more free drinks there. Should I try to have Ashley go get her? She's at Long Beach. And Yang picking up Ace King offsuit here. One more bottle of wine. The hand that started this whole weekend for Helmuth. Yang's got it. He's three betting, but nobody else. Oh, wait. I got it, I got it. Oh, Berkey has Jack four off, but he's he's learned his lesson apparently. He's not going to go for it this time. I wonder if the bounty's still on because I'm actually surprised to see Berkey just give it up. But Yang's three bet is really strong. I'm coming back tomorrow for sure. Let's go. That's what she said. Well, Berkey got a seat. So that's good. That is what she said. The accountant tells it like it is. She's coming back tomorrow. Robbie with an incredible game. Dude. She's a natural. Yeah, we have go like wrong. a four hour like, go right highlight in. reel of like just <laughs> ripping him to pieces. And Berkey, what what a grinder, what a battler. He's not going anywhere. He's sitting right. with a hundred ball. He's gonna get his tonight. Has the discipline to lay down the jack four after the disastrous bounty gate a few hands earlier. And the account's just happy to be here. He's he's just got a great attitude right now. One time. He's talking, he's picking up ace-queen suited and he's just gonna call. And Aussie Al is gonna call two out of the straddle with ace five off. And Al outflops everyone. I'm gonna buy in for like 10K tomorrow and just shove every hand. But Yang is gonna bet. That'll last you three hands. Really like this bet from Yang. It's gonna take it down a lot. It's not gonna work against Al though with ace five. All right. Um, Whatever his strategy is, they're still here. I, I, I've been folding. That's my strategy. I'm talking shit to Berkey because he's a nice guy. Accountant with a little strategy talk, but again, out. this isn't the type of strategy talk we mind at the table. Um, I, hold on. I, oh. Let's it go. I think Joe Ingram might have those glasses, too. <laughs> Whoever wrote that book on poker is right. The one that said that that hand plays awful post flop. Which one? Play after the hand is over. Now, account getting a little more in-depth, and Yang picks up an open-ended straight draw. Really nice card for him to bet. You're trying to get you're trying to get Al to fold all the little cheese he peeled with, and I think it's going to work. Hey, Robbie, don't ever take poker advice from that guy. Well, Why? Yeah. Five yeah. Why? Because yeah, I shoved on. with an ace five and you called me with this pocket guy aces. This has you been think? sticking around with the shortest. Because he's got alligator skin. Because he's got alligator skin. Uh, has he been sticking around? How many times have you insulted tonight? Zero. He has a. Oh. Oh. Zero oh. Oh. That's oh. Oh. But Al is going to call. Really nice call from Al. Kind of sniffs it out. It's like a, a, a main event. Like. Yeah, main event. And does event. Yang have one more bullet if he misses? You're gonna get short you stack made it to day three already. Yeah, my my wife's full of pointers. Don't worry about it. Stack them, honey. He knows he has to bet to win. No, no, no. This He's shown a lot of strength, hard. but Al has called twice. He gives up, and Al's gonna win this pot. And really nice pot for Al. You know, you know, small dig, big heart. He's deciding if he wants to bluff, but he's happy to show it down. He'll take the pot. It's a self-deprecating humor. It's fine. Or true. Mm. Okay. The accountant is right. He does have alligator blood. He's just been hanging around all night, enjoying the show. Self realization. Okay. Self awareness. Self awareness. Way knows your shit. Oh my god. Self love. Self love. Self love. And you heard it from Robbie, self-love on Valentine's Day. I hope you guys are treating yourself well, not being too hard on yourself. Love yourself. Today is a day of love. And there has been a lot of love and a lot of blood at this table. And Eric is already encroaching again on Berkey's stack. You better fucking love yourself tonight. And Robbie is, Robbie is really giving it to Eric. No, he doesn't even need a hooker. He just needs some salt. It's true. Eric does not need a hooker after the wait tonight is gone. I can, I can completely agree with that. He's, I mean, he has just had a night. He is shining bright tonight in LA. 
City of Stars, uh -oh. Eric Hicks, the Mad Genius, $622,000 stack. I mean, he could hit a million if we go late enough tonight. All right, one time. And here goes the accountant. He's just calling with Ace King. He really has hung around. He's played very solidly. Ace King suited here against the Mad Genius and Yang. He triple up. And the Mad Genius obviously flops the top pair in a gutter. Taking a tower, a small little 5K chip from an absolute Lord of the Rings Sauron tower of 5Ks, half a million dollars in front of him. Take those puppies to the cage, and you will be granted a nice house in Vegas if you wish. Yang is thinking about it. He's got an overcard with a hard draw comes in the back door variety. And accountant's going to fold. He's going to stick around. Some people might criticize Accountant's play. He did hit the king there, but we're not about that here. People are playing their games. Accountant's not here necessarily to make money. He might just be here for the show of a lifetime, which Eric has put on. The vino is still flowing. He's holding the glass with really good composure and control. And meanwhile, Berkey is just sitting there wondering, when is my time going to come on a live stream? When am I going to be on the right end of one of these parties? He's not going to quit. But man. Mad Genius with an absolute clinic tonight. Just domination on all fronts, all of the chips, all of the big pots, all of the blood, all of the scalps, the bounties. You know, it's just like when Columbus hit America. It's 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 carnage. Come on, keep doing okay? Feel free to put a Rough night. Oh my god, holy fuck. Thanks. No, hell no. I also like that the accountant has cursed a lot tonight because it means I haven't had to curse too much. Which, well, that, that's debatable. It's true. Holy but uh, you know, but he's helped me balance my own ratio and not get out of line. You've you've been extremely well timed on the cursing. Yeah, I try to really balance. Um, I'll let him have this one, maybe. Copy that, Michael. A small pot, only forty-five hundred dollars. What's that? A good week stay at a hotel somewhere. Oh my god. And Berkey's gonna win with an eight high flush. Oh, you're gonna enjoy this one. <laughs> you're gonna like it. <laughs> Count's not really happy. He's got the seven. Wow. He wants wow, to tilt Berkey a little more. Right. Bury it. Bury it. Somebody somebody bury that puppy deep, deep down in the ground. Gross. Not that gross. <laughs> what happened? Not that gross at all. No, no, you know we had a flush, right? <laughs> it's already out. Hey, you wonder at all who those girls are with yes, that have been showing in the background? Yeah, you know? we've got a couple ladies in the background just kind of sweating. I, I don't know if they're with the accountant. Or, you know, it's it's really up in the air. Maybe they're with Eric. That's going to be the worst. Maybe they're with Robbie's friends, but, you know, they've been enjoying the show. They've they've been front row seats for this this incredible night of gambling. That's, it's all bad, yeah. He just came back to get needles. <laughs> I just got that. Honestly, it's a just got back. It just came back to get needles more when he came back. <laughs> like, just like, just like, that's all you, Eric. I pulled it. What am I doing? 600? I'll call. <laughs> And I, and I really want to give a quick shout out to these dealers. I don't know their names, but these two guys in particular, incredibly solid. The man behind the curtain, the ones who don't get the credit, but put in the blood, sweat, and tears. They've been solid tonight. No errors that I've seen. Just extremely solid dealing. Great flop peel there. Six deuce deuce. And uh, we're back in action, but it doesn't look like a lot of connection here. Looks like JD's bet out with nothing, and the accountant has called with even less. Can't be playing hobble hobble over here. And JD hits top pair, goes from nothing to something, and he's going to let the accountant bluff at it. Really nice play from JD. He's going to let the accountant hang himself. Accountant's been so solid all night. Does he want to blast it off here? And even better river for JD. He checks, and the accountant might want to go for this. <laughs> He's eyeing up his stack. He's got about a pot-sized bet left. Does he want to go out like this? He gives it up. The accountant has been so solid tonight. Great check oh there. God. Hangs around for another orbit. Gets a chance to see who knows what. Who knows what will happen next? What, what the mad genius has in his pocket? 
Did you want me supporting your hot sauce or not? <laughs> please. The man who created Habo. Please, please. A One. Cabo in inspired hot sauce. <laughs> when you're on vacation, <laughs> yes, no, you're pounding yes, tequilas, yes, you're, you're drinking you Coronas, says, go, you need something hot. Yeah, dude. Habo. I gotta make sure nobody catches me. No yeah. doubt. I think There's you're safe. safe. Throw it on your tacos, your burritos. <laughs> Throw it on your pizza. Chicken. Makes a little ting. And Yang, just super solid. We still haven't gotten confirmation on his race car. I will pay out the $500 bet, I swear, if we can confirm anybody, even with the Google search, to give us Yang's race car. I'm still not sold that he is a race car driver, but the man has come to play tonight. Really solid performance from Yang. Open it up with the 4-3 suited. An accountant is starting to see more hands he likes. Queen 7, the original computer hand. That's when you know you're old school. Yeah. If you know the computer hand, you've been playing poker way too long. Nobody really flops anything except Yang, except Eric also. Another incredible analysis by me. And this could get a little dicey for Eric. He hasn't had any real spots like this where he's had to maneuver, but... He's going to shoot it up with the King-10 here. And, you know, it's. I think this is probably going to work out for him because he's going to find out really quickly that his hand is no good. Yang's sitting here. He's played really well tonight. He's got trips. Mad Genius is pumping you up to a five ball. What are you going to do? Just call. Oh. Mad Genius, is he going to... What is he thinking? He's got to be a little bit worried. And why would you worry when you're the Mad Genius? The turn is a king. He goes from almost dead to having Yang in a woodshed with no light. He's going to bet a ten ball. And I think Yang is going to have to call the way this guy's played. It's just disgusting, but what are you going to do when the man throws two chocolates at you like that? Yang's been so solid. He's played so well tonight. He's going to call, and he folds! My God! This guy is not a race car driver. I don't care. He's played so well tonight. He's got to be a pro. He's played a better session tonight than I've ever played in my life. He's a, he's a race car driver like I'm a neurosurgeon. Yeah, he's a race car driver like I'm a basketball player. And Eric continues to shine. The glitter is sparkling off of him. The gods have given him this day. This day forever, Valentine's Day, 2023, will be known as the day of the mad genius, the day he took down Helmuth, the day he snapped Berkey off with Cowboys. And my God, the man has just been an absolute wrecking ball. Incredibly fun to watch. Drinking Opus the whole time, having a beautiful night at the bike here in L.A. Temperature is about 55 degrees Fahrenheit. And thanks to your solid help in the chat, we are going to go until they literally force us out of here. We're going to need to have cops come in with nightsticks. Me and Yale are here for the long haul. we got nothing to do. I have a wife. I'm not sure if Yale has a partner, but my wife knows this is, this is what we had to do tonight. And Yale's partner does too, so... It's, it's a beautiful Valentine's Day. I'm not going to say it's the best one ever because I'm, I think my wife might be watching, but it's been a good one. Hey, I like how you're covering all your bases there. That's yeah. important. Yeah. And I, mean, I, and I don't know your wife, but. Yeah. I mean, she knows. She knows how strong our bond is. You know? And I'm, you know, I actually proposed to my wife. Not on Valentine's Day, but at 12.01 a.m. the following day. Okay. So. A lot of good memories the there. The anniversary of the proposal incoming yes. in 50 minutes her time. Yes, yeah, so we are about an hour away from my proposal to my wife. Not that you guys care about that. Let's get back to the action. Lost the action here. There's been a three-bet preflop. The action slowed down. Mad Genius with the aces again. He's going to take it down. Al has nothing. Jack-10 suited. A beautiful hand into the dust. And Mad Genius adds another scalp. Not a scalp, but just a small pouch of goods to his giant purse. Just a casual $16,000 pot. Not really sure what you can get for that these days, but Mad Genius has not stopped all night. I think he could play for a week if he needed to. I think he plans on playing all week. And I'll be interested to see who shows up because... Honestly, with a guy like that, you know, I don't care how solid of a pro you are, I'm going to be scared. I'm, I'm not going to want to go back in the ring with a player like that. 
But that's why I'm in the booth with my man Yale. And these guys are out here battling all night. It's late for me. It's almost midnight Eastern time. But luckily, we're on the Pacific coast, so we're three hours behind. We got a decent amount of sleep last night. And these guys don't really seem to be stopping. The accountant is, is getting a little bit tired. He hasn't won a pot in a while, but he's still hanging in there. It's not going to take much for him to shoot back up to life. And Eric, with a nice continuation bet here, unfortunately, JD has flopped top pair. And I think this pot's going to go quick, and Mad Genius just gets away. $636,950, too. That's how you say that, but um, what a night. I'm just... I'm running out of things to say. I, I really feel like the <laughs> adrenaline is just coursing through my veins. I want to keep talking. I want to keep watching. You're doing it, Matt. I don't want to stop, yo. I don't want this night to end. One quick break. I, I'm just dying. A very, it. very good <laughs> YouTube chat. Joe Ingram won. What are you laughing at? In his <laughs> classic voice from one of his most famous segments, mm -hmm. he says, Life. Hicks is a god. Everyone's Which like always smart. reminds me of his <laughs> apostle. Everybody's losing. He's a god. If you're, if you're, if you're remotely familiar with that. You guys are familiar with Joey Ingram. Hicks is a god. Okay. In the Apostle is a god voice. I don't give a shit. That, that was my best impersonation. I can't do what he does. Yeah, I mean, nobody can do what Joey does. We've already seen two of the players trying to impersonate him with their jackets tonight. No, 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 my point is... It's like... Loser, gone. No, I'm not... I'm not Eric, just... My man is on fire. Loser, gone, gone. I like this one in chat. Tim, Jaffe he should have been on the thumbnail. Fuck these guys. Like, they're too serious, right? You guys are too kind. Well, well you're also, you're happy because you have all the money. Yes. Eric is happy. Robbie's yeah. right. Her it's reads have been attitude. spot on tonight outside of the Hanvers, JD. He's in a bad mood okay. when he doesn't have it, and in a very good mood when he does. It's true. Robbie does talk strategy at the table, but it's not the type of strategy I mind. Well, there's a lot of shit. I don't think people give a shit. Oh, him and Zach will play poker. Everyone will be happy about it. Yeah? What's up, chat? I'm glad you guys are out there. I don't have full access to you guys. It's my first time in the booth. But I want to know each and every one of you. I appreciate your support. I appreciate you tuning in. It's been a lot of fun. Hopefully the first time of many, because if I see another game like this, I'm 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 hooked, man. I like I like this game. I like this lineup. Yeah, I'm coming. I'm just uh, I'm laughing a little bit inside because it's like, it's like it's, um, he was so generous this weekend. It's insane. Like, I'll never. Sorry, we got you. Oh yes. Yeah, sure, I don't know if we have any left. I'll order another oh. bottle. Don't worry about it. Oh, cocktails. Yes, cocktails, please. Mm -hmm. Pizza, Somebody get these players some cocktails, please. Check Eric may need a new yeah. color up soon. We're getting soft here. Like one time. Tilted. Yes. Oh. Yeah. For three days, you paid Phil home with a finder's fee. Check. Remember? Check. Check. Listen, don't, don't get like that. that. And I come every week. No oh. finder's fee. You, you, you shouldn't pay me paying call. finder's fee. No, no, no. No finder's fee. I think you've done quite well. Somebody's asking for a finder's fee for Helmuth. The, Helmuth is long gone. He's left hours ago, but the needles are still flying. His grave is not safe tonight. The accountant on the right side of it here versus Aussie Al, and the accountant just continues to hang around. The man does have alligator blood. Good river for the account's hand, but it's going to cost yes, him money because Al can maybe open. fold now. We want, uh, just the bottle and An account the with the no-look bet. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Al doesn't like no. it. No. Come on. Just 1500 An accountant trying to get a call. He's trying to stick around a little longer. Oh, but Al's not going to pay him. Jack Al, can I get 175 for the collection? What discipline from Aussie Al. This man didn't fly from Melbourne. 28-hour flight to mess around tonight. He came for the show. We came for the show. He had it. I mean, the mad genius is just... The man has two Lord of the Rings Sauron Towers of chips in front of him. Yeah, it's like 
That's so cool. He's got two bottles of Opus on the on the on the tray. That's the strategy. He's got a beautiful jacket. No, it's and he invented the not the unicycle. Sorry, the lunacycle. Let me, but I want to. Tomorrow. Tonight is his night. What if I did though? I'm sorry to my wife. Money was it? For anything yeah, I've said. Grand. No, no, no. We listen. We ride, okay? Like I've been. Accountant, I, I thought so. I think he rides some type of hog. I'm thinking some type of Harley. He's garbage. Shove, so it's like a whole other thing. Like he's the man has alligator blood. He's hung around all night for the show. He's in for twenty thousand. He doesn't care that he's down a few thousand. Are you kidding me? After what he's seen tonight, this vantage point. Oh my god. I mean, we got some hands. The race car driver, air quotes, raises to 800 with Queen Jack suited. And um, Aussie Al has sevens on the button. He calls. Robbie hasn't had a hand in a while. She's been really quiet. Berkey, too, since he got back from the Jack 4 gate. You don't have a date. That's right. I gotta go. She's here. Oh, and the man, of course we should have known, the man who invented Habo has a date tonight. It's Valentine's Day night. You think this guy's going out alone? You think this guy's hanging out at his house watching Netflix? Watching Chasing Dragons? No. He's out tonight. He's out on the town. We'll see if we can get Jason's... I think it's... Is it Jason or just JD? I don't know. But this man is smooth. The inventor of Habo, he's going to rack up. He's going to leave the game a very healthy winner. And the rich get richer tonight, folks. It's not an, a good night for the poor. Sorry, I don't really know why I said that, but um, you know, it happens. Production can edit that out. Hopefully the poor are having a nice night, too. But the rich are getting richer, except Eric has ran into it here. I don't... I kind of lost track of this pot watching JD rack up. Lost my focus, but I'm back. Eric's going to bet 10K with top pair, and Yang's going to snap him off with a better top pair. <laughs> Not sure what happened before the flop, but we got some action now. Already 35,000 in there. And Eric's going to bet again. He likes his hand. It's a big bet, and it puts Yang in a tough position. Do you really want to go against the Mad Genius? You've got top pair with the third best kicker. But look at this guy. I mean, looks like he could melt the cow just on entering a room. But Yang has been really solid. His reads have been right. I think he's going to call and see another, see another card in position here. Nice call from Yang. He's not done yet. Mad Genius looking for a 10 and only a 10. And that's going to get him to a river cheaply. Don't think he's going to bet anymore. <laughs> Mad Genius checks. Yang's going to be happy to knuckle back. He's going to win a $75,000 pot. A token to her perseverance and patience. Very solid. I'm still curious what kind of car he drives. I'm wondering, is it Formula One? Is it NASCAR? That's not what Eric wanted to hear. Oh, what do you mean I'm good? And the first pot of any size, $75,000, it's going to go Yang's way. It's the only real larger pot that Eric's lost tonight. And he's not sweating it. He's still sitting with it. He's still sitting with over 600000 Nice hand for the race car driver. I mean, no one has a jack for you. I'm good. It's always on the board, and like never in anyone's hand. How do you know you're good? You're sure. See you, JD. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow. You were scared, though, man. I thought about bluffing. I thought about turning my hand into a bluff. But I go, man, it's too good. I can't do it. Mad Genius so locked in, he even says he thought about turning it into a bluff, knowing his jack wasn't good. The man is walking on water. Jesus would be proud of this performance. Robbie's getting involved with the ace-8 offsuit. She's going to limp from the button, Helmuth style. Try to see a cheap flop in position. Check. Check. 
Robbie takes a stab. Eric's going nowhere with top pair. Eric, how does it feel to have all of me on the table? Feels <laughs> pretty good. Check. Okay, good. Now shut the fuck up and pour the wine. Eric telling the waiter or somebody else to pour his wine. Stop talking about his stack and how big it is. And now he has more chips than the rest of the table combined. Just fill up another glass of Opus and let's keep the train rolling tonight. Because why would we possibly stop now? We got another bottle. He's gonna keep winning. An accountant is running low, coming back for another pound and a refill. Get that man a top off. No, I know, I know. Now is not the time to start. I get it. I know, no, but serious. He's never drinking his life. Berkey never, never ingested drink. alcohol never before. The man has the drink. discipline of a Buddhist monk. Never never That's, really impressive. That's how you make it in poker long term, high stakes. That's how you make it. You're either drinking opus like Eric, or you're, you're abstaining completely like Berkey, and nothing in between. Who's your, who's your opus comp to Eric that, that any of us could know? I can't even think of something. You know, he's the man. The man there's just no, nobody like him. There's no, there's no pro I've never seen anything like him. There's no pro comp. Thing. I've never seen a I've never seen a performance like this before. Uh, I've never had any curiosity. It doesn't seem like it would taste well. Do you have, do you have an addictive personality? <clears throat> Clearly not. So. Well, I see no, what you're I mean, saying. I know what you're saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, like what's like controls themselves. Right, 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 right. No, I don't really have many compulsions. How much is that? I don't, I'm not familiar with the colors of the chip. Oh, it's millions of dollars. And we got a mystery hand from Eric. Just kidding. But the accountant has smashed the flop. Uh, three and three is six, about ten k. And accountant still has that green twenty five k, twenty five dollar chip. Helmuth's last chip from when he got up. Accountant is holding on to that desperately. He knows the worth of that chip. Yeah, he's not. It's not his first rodeo. He knows that chip's going to go for big money one day. And he turns the flush. Eric actually makes a good hand considering where he started. And accountant again is going to just hang around every time this guy gets low. <laughs> he finds a situation like this, wait, and he wait. hangs around. He checks the trap, and he lets Eric hit the straight with the three. And Eric shoves, and accountant quickly calls, and is going to get a double up. $20,000. Oh, fucker. I run so bad. Oh. <laughs> Suck it. You I run, run so bad. bad. Suck How, it. Eric? You're never running bad. Account with the quick suck, it doesn't put the $25 chip in the pot, confirming it is Helmuth's. And he's going to get a double up. Did I or what? You did. You had a flush here. Hey, listen. Small flush. What are you going to do? Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. No fixing this game, okay? Yeah. And maybe change it up for like baby chips. Like, I'm not like a big baller like these. I thought these were pretty good. These can give. No, no, no. Not from you. I don't want it from him. Give me like 10 yellow or something. Or no, give me the purple and then yellow. Eric, you want some purple? Berkey, regulate. Make sure he doesn't, you know, like give me. Looks like ten, purple. man. Looks like ten. You want to do the purple? Or no, no. Yeah, no. how many? How many ten purples do you want? Well, how many? Purples do you got? Good. Like get your shit together, buddy. <laughs> Listen, you like me drunk? When like your five. first big pot. <laughs> yeah. How much? You want? Okay. It's like five. Let's do it. Five. Accountant with a timely double. I'm excited. Only like knocks over the hot sauce. Dollars. The champagne yeah, stays intact. The wine glasses are fine. He's played really solidly tonight. Right. Get a great job of checking back with this flush there point. against Eric no, no, and letting no, no, him get there on the river. Why do you drink the entire bar? We were like, lit that shit up. On No Gamble, No Future? We, we drank the entire bar. We did. You remember? We pissed off Lynn and that rush, crazy Russian guy. And Eric is apparently not his first night like this. Apparently he's he's done this to yeah. other people before, which is a terrifying yeah. thought. He wasn't there. Dude, he would... That guy like limps aces, what is and then it? continues on straddle. The mad genius, the inventor of the Luna cycle, he wants to know what it is because he's not done. Twelve hundred going in the middle with a mystery hand. It's over to the accountant. <sighs> Oh. What? <laughs> okay. An accountant's gonna, he's gonna raise and Eric's gonna <laughs> fold. Did, did we don't know the hands. Yo, accountant has jack four? He just turned yeah. over his hand. Give me my money. Oh, an accountant. What a play. The jack four. He's played solid all night. He hasn't three bet anything. He's called with ace king suited. 20k. 
the man the makes the three bet with yeah. jack four off. What a timely yeah. play. Gets Eric to fold. He's now winning in the game. He's hung around all night. He's had over two bottles of Opus. What a free roll for the account with alligator blood. I'm glad someone finally got it through. Berkey with the big fail, but finally someone gets paid. The, the jack four bounty has been expensive. The, Rob <laughs> the Robbie bounty. Robbie bounty, but more so Robbie's game has been expensive for some of these players, particularly one Phil Helm youth. 500. It's, it feels like hours ago he was here, but he's gone, and okay. the so mad genius isn't stopping. You know what I was missing? I was missing $500. 500. Nick, Nick, I fold it. Oh. Oh, she called. She called. I'm sorry. Mad genius almost mucked out a turn there. Robbie's called him. She hasn't played a hand in a while, so she's looking to get in there. Flops trips with a king high kicker. She's loving life. Eric bets and curious to see if Robbie fast plays this. I think she's gonna raise. No, she just calls. Gives Eric a chance. And Eric picks up equity. I think he's gonna bet again. Sorry? And he bets 6,000 uh, to Robbie's delight. She's got him on the hook, but there are a lot of draws out there. Does she want to keep setting the bear trap, or does she want to put more money in? We get uh, cocktails. It's coming. The show just took off. The professional. I don't have any time chips. I don't know. Robbie's out of time chips, so she shoves. Are you guys getting good reviews? And Eric's gonna fold. Not even. Not doing well. He folded. He folded. He folded. She's got it. She's got it. There it is. Nice time, Robbie. You, you know, I, I think. I love the acting job, though. I love <laughs> How'd you know I had it? Eric, the, acting job. the man is just the locked in. The end was insane. Sees the Hollywood before the all in. <laughs> Robbie's not happy. She's out of time, Chips. I think that cost her there. If you, if you tell me the hand I had. I don't know the hand you had. I know you had a month. Why I sighed because yeah. I had to raise it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, That's what's going on? I don't understand what he has. <laughs> right? I, I, don't know, I forgot I forgot we were playing. Honestly, I've forgotten. Now you remember. Now you remember. Times. You, you remember, you remember the $500 yeah. payout? Two I, I remember that. Now you remember. Actions on C2. C1 is the but a nice pot for Robbie, oh nonetheless. She hasn't yeah. won one in a while. <laughs> Ready for this? You should, you should get aces and ah. <laughs> I should get aces, you should get jack four? No, and then go ah. Oh. That's yeah, tricky. Yeah, that's an acting job, though. You know what I mean? Yeah. You never see that in here. And Eric commenting on the acting job from Robbie. You shove when you don't have well, props, right? Because yeah. oh, no. I'm like, okay, so if I get re-raised, I got to go. Oh, no. Why didn't you call? Then, you know, I got to go worth the price. No, that poor guy yeah. paid me fucking $2,500 or $3,500. So it's not yeah. right. Yeah. 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 I was like, you never see that anymore. Yeah. Yeah. There was no acting yeah. job. There's no acting. You probably would have gotten there if you just called it. Come on, I'm okay. I'm okay. Hard to disagree it's with that. It's okay. It's, it's all right. Okay. It's okay. Oh, oh. Right. I think you would have gotten there. Most people do. Yeah, yeah, yeah but I only have like a 10% chance. The river C7, gives it to everybody. Yes. Yeah, the river will cleanse everybody. Yeah. Thank you. Mark, I call. Have it. You heard it from the Mad Genius. The river cleanses all. Yes. But he does have a point about Robbie's acting job. I know Robbie lives in L.A. It's not for what? big movies. She's got a good job before she started playing right. poker, but she is not an actor. No, you've got issues on this hand. You've got problems, honey. Uh, so do you. You've got honey, bunny. You've got some trubs. You've got honey, go. Oh, oh shit. And meanwhile, accountant's back at it. All right. It's 500 bucks, babe. Come on, you got a million dollars out there. Come on, just put another 500. Accountant, I'm trying to get every dollar. He's a grinder. You could tell he spent his time accounting. He doesn't mess around. Listen. Sucking 500 out for the IRS. <laughs> You're toast. And Robbie now actually can win this pot. She's got a flush draw. There's a straight out there. How much is all your entire stock? All right, it's enough more money than you can. I don't know, actually. I don't know. It's like 10. And Robbie, and, with a uh, subtle needle, asking accountant to stack, nine, to count his like chips out, 19, knowing he's the shortest stack at the table. 
Chuck. 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 Hold on, Robbie. Of course you Chuck. Hold on, hold on. I'm thinking about this. I don't have time stamps left. Do you want to give me one of yours? Sure. No, she doesn't need them. She doesn't need them. I, I checked her. Oh, wait, are these yeah. your time stamps? Oh? Huh? No time stamps left, boys. Oh, no. You're done. Uh, Let's go. Probably yeah. JD. Ship it, baby. Why you got them in my stack? And Robbie, oh, does she want this pot? Does she want to take a little chunk yeah. out of the accountant? You don't have nine times. The accountant won't stop talking. Oh, and Robbie gives it up. I have an eight. Seat seven. Checks. Checks. Eight. Is eight good? Mine's is good, though. Accountant's going to win this pot. That's good enough. And he is up to $23,000, but it's not the money that counts for the accountant. He's won the Jack 4 bounty. He's hung around all night to witness this absolute manslaughter. That was wrong. No, no, no. I was, uh, <laughs> thank you. Thank it's you. It's like Eric Person minus 10 or something. I only have like three dollars in front of me. What do you know, want with my life? I almost shoved on the turn. Just, just Listen, and Eric having some stacking problems again. His chips, no matter what happens, they keep gonna, moving closer to Berkey. Go and Berkey's just put in that dungeon over there, just Did you really? yeah, yeah. barely anything other than space to peel his whole cards. And hope he looks down at something good. No. I said, you marry her? Yeah, of course I did. I said that's what I want. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Okay. I don't know, man. You got it. Thank you. I don't know. Where are we going to dinner? Uh, uh, five hundred. Give me a five. Five. Not taking your wife out? Thank you. Eight nine. It's Valentine's Day. You have to be crazy to go out today. The food's shit. And it's like a, a prefix menu. menu. It's true. And yeah. it's so obnoxious. Do you order oysters Facts. from a prefix menu? That's how you. No. That's how you slung are it to your fresh? wife, right? When you told her you were coming out here. <coughs> yeah. What are you gonna do? You gonna go out Valentine's Day? Yeah. No. It's a waste. They're not right. gonna do that. It'd be like costly as f. A little Valentine's Day strat dinner talk at the table. Never hurt anyone. Good advice here if you're listening. You're not missing anything, guys. There's a bunch of couples. A lot of them don't even love each other anymore. And they're out there pretending. <laughs> While we sit here, we'll watch people gamble for thousands of dollars over and over again. What again, those there, little right? beautiful yellow chips. Each one of those is $1,000. Those brown chips in front with the blue hue, 5000 a piece. There's a lot of money on the table. The Mad Genius has most of it. But who knows how far these guys will go. I know Berkey will be in here for the long run. Robbie doesn't look like she wants to quit. Yang won the Daytona 500 last month for all I know, so we got a game. And here comes the Opus refill. Just in time. Mad genius, not missing a moment. Accountant is happy. There's a couple ladies in the back. We don't, we're not sure who they're attached to, but we have a game here tonight. And I don't know what time it is on the East Coast. Not a helmet bad. But it doesn't matter. This is a West Coast game, Pacific time. The night is young out here. Temperature is about 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Look, we should get a. Well, he's not. Hey, Wayne, do we get a loyalty fee for staying at the table when we get stacked? Do we get a loyalty no, fee? Like yeah. Yeah, because yeah. I didn't flip the weekend. fuck out Remember when I lost you my You should have got up and flipped the fucking just, table just really? like... Just, She's I incredible. Mean, for I mean, the shit talk is just... Right? They never stop. The but how can you not love her? Do I get a loyalty fee for not I'm just a huge fan. No, no, but if you flipped it, you might, you might have. <laughs> I mean, a needle, needle to Helmuth saying, I don't get up when I lose. <laughs> Hours later, she's staying strong. <clears throat> Robbie's game tonight. You know who's hosting. Has not disappointed. Here comes the opus. Eric's obviously offering to the producers. The cameraman may get in on some. And here we go. It's time for Faded Spade. The big faces, the smooth deck. Yeah, I'll tell them tell what we're working with here. Bally's Big Bad Poker is proud to feature world-class faded spade playing cards. Use code BIGBED. It gets you 15% off of a two-deck set of the new 3.0 version at fadedspade.com. Will is up to 10 decks since this stream started. Can you fill me up, please? Yeah, I love faded spade cards. Um, I have a deck set at home. I have a deck set um, in my basement, and uh, I have a few sets scattered around just in case. Just in case it's time for gaming. Here's here's the accountant joking, drinking another glass of Opus. The, cheers, cheers, my friends. Eric only up a paltry two hundred ninety-seven thousand dollars. Berkey's down a hundred. Robbie's down fifty-four. The accountant's down. Uh, sorry, the accountant's up two hundred. 
probably feels like at least 30k. And Al is stuck 52, so we're starting to see some blood from the rest of the table. It's not all peaches and cream around here. But these guys want to play. Berkey's got no room to even look at his hand. Accountant's got the Phil Youth Bounty green chip sitting in front of him, waiting to go to auction from Sotheby's. Oh, geez, I don't want to say it. I, I like you, but... Just waiting to needle Berkey some more. Well, all is fair in love uh, and war. I think I got a glass. Do I not? Oh, yeah, you should have brought the sweater on. Should have brought the sweater. Should have brought the sweater. And Mad Genius <laughs> wants some more action. He's on the button. No, no. You need a massage? You need a massage? Uh, on my thighs. <laughs> Account <laughs> requesting a thigh massage for the long night of work he's had. All right, Eric. He's in there. And Eric is getting out of line here. Berkey's got I dust. Thank you, though. Sup. Let's do it. I'm oh, practice. man. Eric's getting out of line against the accountant. Like, no I feel guilty about playing And he flops the best hand. Why not? Accountant's going to call. He's not going anywhere. He's got ace queen. Check. Check. And Eric knows where he's at. He knows his man. I wish I had a 10. He's going to let it go. I wish I had a 10. I Wait, thought. I don't even know if account. I, Show me one card. I believe the, the board it. is wrong. I think there was a seven on the flop, so Eric has the four came on the turn. Yeah, no there we go. We can both be ten. I've never shown a card. Eric's gonna take this one down. In the middle of the hand. Accountant. All right, think about it. Everyone's gonna see it anyways. He's hanging around under twenty thousand, but he's happy to be there. Not anymore. It's pretty worthless now. He wanted to see it in the middle of the hand. I had ten plus. Ten plus. Ten plus plus? Ten plus. <coughs> I, ace queen. No good? Yeah, no good. Double suited. You're ahead and die. Shut up. Yeah, yeah. You got it. I help him. He's big. Yesterday, not today. Are oh, you want to come to dinner with us tonight? Um, where do you guys go? Oh, we got a private room in the restaurant here. Normally, I wouldn't be that excited about eating here, but are you staying here tonight? Yeah. yeah, yeah. And the other thing, if you ever want to crash at my place or uh, borrow a car, Berkey getting the offer from Eric. Eric clearly wants to keep playing with him. Offers him a place at his house and a car. All you got to do is donate 80. Sounds great. But the J4. I mean, Mad Genius knows his man. He's looking to keep Berkey around in town. Doesn't want him flying back to Vegas just yet. Trying to see if he can get another hundred out of him. Wouldn't trust me. I, go, I like to go fast. I'll loan you, uh, I'll loan you one that's cheaper. Look at All this. Right, there you go. Stuff. Yeah, one of the shitty Ferraris. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. And Berkey sounds like he's going to get a Ferrari tonight for his troubles. Oh, that's awesome. And my house is like... Uh, uh, Close to the airport, too, if Berkey does want to get on his plane. I've been, uh, I've been... You invited me to Brian's game. You basically got me in. You're welcome. Like, you stood up for me when he said, that guy is fucking too good for this game. <laughs> you stood up for me. Your action, man. I don't yeah, know why anybody would like... like, he's... Yeah, this guy's going to make us all our money. And this guy stood up for me. Jean, that guy... This guy's and, and that guy shit. stood up for me for Brian's game. Yeah. And then Brian's like, hey, your donkey ass is welcome any day. Yeah, you got invited to Brian's game? You invited me! I did not. I didn't <laughs> invite you, dude. I'd have to apologize to Brian if I invited you. When did I invite you? I, you and I sat next to each other playing in Brian's game. Jesus, your memory is to, to shit. Literally last time in Vegas. July, Vegas. Oh, I don't remember it. Well, you know. Where do you live, Eric? In LA? Where? Yeah, yeah I live in Palos Verdes. Oh. Yeah. People always confuse the Palisades for Palos Verdes. Do you ever get that? They're like, uh, oh, no, I remember that. No. I get it all the time. I get it. They're like, oh, South Bay. I know. And they don't get it. They're like, oh, I know Palos Verdes. It's like, no, what year? Like, by, by the airport, I was like, wrong, wrong, okay. wrong, 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 Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Amazing. but like, we live in the Palisades, yeah. like, Pacific Palisades, it's confused. We're Palos I miss driving stick. It's been a while. No, we got it. Like, uh, just let me know next time you're coming. I'll take care of you. Okay. Like, uh, uh, and also, uh, see, I have trouble with cash. Yeah, yeah. That'd be great. Eric with the full cell, trying to get Berkey to stick around. All long enough. Wants to keep playing with him. I mean, at this point, I might not have any cash left. No, oh, shut up. Berkey, after all this turns out, may actually have to sell his house. And he may have to start an OnlyFans account. There's no money in podcasting, man. I don't know how many ladies we have in here, but... I know the salvations happen when you start thinking of Berkey on a, the dark web. Check. 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 Check around. Six eight is good. Six 
seven is also good. Accountant with some chirping chips. He doesn't need a lot to start talking, which is nice because usually people need to be up a lot. Accountant is pretty consistent. He just stays in the game and he doesn't stop. Yeah, he's always providing when he's playing. But Long history. I really don't care, give a shit about. Like somebody could wreck it, I want to kill. And really good guy. Uh, Off stream, I can tell you that with 100% certainty. For vet wreck. That, those airbags are not reliable. I do want to know who makes that sweater. I'm a big fan of English bulldogs, and I had a couple Frenchies um, when I was younger. Great, great animals. Accountants out. Berkey's bluffing with a gut shot and an eight, so he, a king, and he's got a, a lot of outs, but. He's going to brick. Is he going to fire another bullet against Yang? It's kidding. I'm he knows not, he I'm needs to really to win. Anything. I've never seen you shot with that small stack, which is shocking. Pretty cool. I'll give you some He's going to give up. Skill. Yang's going to take this one down. The driver. <laughs> Berkey may get to drive Eric Hicks Lambo later tonight, but Yang drives for a living, apparently. Robbie's pretty cool, man. Is. Like, dude, I want to play with her every <laughs> I, yes. You I'm have, easy to play with. You're dynamic to the game. Like, we never get to play with hot girls. It's, like, so rare. <laughs> Eric with the truth We're bomb. Always just a bunch of dudes. You're just happy. You're just taking my money. Yeah. Breaking down the socioeconomics of the home games they play. Apparently not a whole lot of hot chicks. We yet. have, and you Wait, said no, I... Hashtag poker. But Robbie is providing it. tonight. It's her game. She set this up. Just full. When I raise, okay. I'll play hand with you if you fold when I raise. Scan your cards, please. Yeah, let's do it. Six hundred from there. Let's do it. It was six hundred from there. Eric's back at it with pocket sevens under the gun. Not a lot of takers here. Berkey will supply a thousand dollar chip flicked in for the call. He's in the big blind. He's going to defend. This is the guy that sticks around like a little For sticky fucking donut all night. Gram, like a little turtle. <clears throat> it's fine. It's okay. Zero loss, zero gain. It's yeah. like money. Yeah, funny money. It's like stagnant. Like just stagnant. Still water. Stagnant. Mosquitoes stagnant. everywhere. I want to be stagnant as fuck right now. I want to be like I came in and I left and nothing happened. My Classic. life didn't change. What happened in Germany between 1940? <laughs> Happens. Robbie, thinking what all players do who are stuck in a big game, wishing they had been stagnant yeah, instead of going down the roller coaster. But, but yeah. that's part of life. That's part of gambling. You go up, you go down. Tonight, the mad genius is on top. He's got a pile. Come in and say, let's lower the stakes. You know, it's getting a little insane, guys. It's the end of night. Let's lower the stake. I got an idea. Uh, you know, like the let's first time, get, that's why I love this guy. Let's let's he's a perfect one to put him feel helmless here. Let's get Berkey's left guy. ears getting used yeah. a little bit here on the late night. No Just on the left of him as well. Yeah. Berkey's catching a lot of friendly fire from the mad genius. One, two, Is that a straddle? Yes. yes. 500? 500 or 400? Stuck a cool six figs. I would call these chirping chips, but that really would do a disservice to the, the absolute operation Mad Genius has put on tonight. These chips are earned. He has earned the right to yap at the table. Not everybody does that, but he has tonight. It's crazy. It's not. It's 5K will cover most tables, like one well, What did he start with? Three. No, 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 no. So he's, he's got to be more than uh, more than 200. And here comes a little more Opus. He's up like 500K. Oh. Look at that pour. A, a little, a little misstep, but he's good. You checked. One of the ladies getting a nice refill. The ladies have done well tonight too. They've enjoyed the show. We're not sure who they're here with. If they're just here for a sweat, but they've got front row seats to this absolute Valentine's Day carnage massacre. Helmuth is already back home on a private jet. He's having a consolation phone call with Chamath. He's thinking about which businesses to invest in to get this 200k back over the next year. And Eric keeps cheersing to the world, really, everybody out there. Put your glasses up if you're having a good Valentine's Day night. Cheers, salute. Mazel tov. You have to be invited, Eric. Oh you might just be now. about the accountant in the chat. I don't know. What's up? Yeah, keep an eye out, guys. We're looking at the chat. And I hope nobody's talking smack about the accountant. He's hung around all night. He's put on a show for us. He's got alligator blood. Wow, accountant with a strong. You know, we're gonna let that one slide. He's had he's had a few glasses of Opus tonight. Is it just me and you? 
And you can just tell Eric's just got the magnet over there. Is it just me and you? Yeah. There you go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, what, how much is that? Six. Can you mind if I change it? I'm just not paying attention. 3,000. He's going to change his bet because he didn't realize the account raised, but he's coming after the accountant. It's going to work. The account is folding. Seven dudes. It doesn't matter what Eric has. He's got piles of chips. They keep falling over. Berkey's running out of breath faster than a seal on land in a desert. And we're still going strong here. I think it's getting close to midnight, Eastern time. But on the West Coast, we're three hours. We're good. We can still go get dinner. We can go to the club. We can do whatever we want. But I hope we will all respect our partners out there on this beautiful night. I know shit. And why are you so happy? I just won a million bucks. And I'm playing poker. Thank you. Now a little blind on blind action. Yang, the race car driver, we still don't know the specifics. The guy's a player. He's got A7 of clubs. I believe he shot it up. Yeah, those are the best <laughs> group of guys ever. No words. And the account with Ace-9. And Yang's going to look him up here. Some back doors. Could have the best hand. Now Yang makes a gutter. He's going to check it over to the accountant. Accountant's got the glasses back on. Mm -hmm. Yang can win this pot with a bet. Check. He's going to check, though. An accountant's going to bluff at it. He doesn't need to, but he's trying to get Yang to fold a six, maybe a four. So he takes it down. Accountant just hanging around. He's got the bulldog. I believe the bulldog has a crown on its head and a poop underneath it. So, you know, I actually just might have figured out that that, that bulldog is... An American bulldog that's actually <laughs> defecating so on the English flag. But I'm not sure about that. It's just, it's been a long night, guys. That's what I'm seeing now. I don't know if it's, it's like one of those Rorschach tests. You don't know what you're seeing. Yeah, Eric, let me know what you have first. Call. Call. No raise? Dude, all fucking night you've been like pip 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 Alright, I think I have the ace of diamonds. Let me double check. Countin does have the ace of diamonds. I have the ace of diamonds. Announces a key card. Check. And then checks. Al has stuck a 50 ball and he's not exactly thrilled with the position he has on the accountant. Here, look at these cards, but don't tell anybody. Hey, everybody give me 500 bucks. Oh, wrong game. Oh, wrong game. So look at hold on, hold on. Wow. Yeah. That is it. Oh my god. Yeah, isn't that <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I just, what the fuck am I going to do with it? It's a, it's. I think I thought we are playing with seven dudes. Oh, we're playing with seven No, we're not. Jack four. Oh. oh. You got nothing for that one. Eric wins the pot with seven dudes. Doesn't even realize <laughs> the seven dudes game isn't on. Doesn't matter. It's his night. It's popping. Flops a pair and a flush draw with it. She Easy game. I missed that part, but it's really <laughs> irrelevant at this point. Is Levitt the bike going to get 25k chips or what? For, just have Eric's face on him and have 25k <laughs> chips with Eric's yeah. face on him. Eric's that is <laughs> sick. The count with a decent idea, $25,000 chip with Eric the Mad Genius's face on them. If there was ever a night to oh think about implementing a new chip for the bike, tonight would be the night. You can't do a bronze statue outside. Maybe go with a $25,000 chip. Nice little picture of my man. Maybe you put the stack in front of him, but... We're back in the action. Yang opens up with a king five suited. Berkey defends the big blind. I actually think Berkey is gonna shoot this up to 4,500. Nice three bet. But you want me to, I will. Oh, uh, yeah. I, 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 I flipped with Al King before, I'm like, fuck it. That was like, he can pick up the entire game. Literally. <laughs> 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 If he was sure the entire <laughs> I Hollywooded and tried to shove on his ass because I thought for sure he'd call. A uh, man and stream single handedly. <laughs> Thank you the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> it's like winner takes all. Yeah. <laughs> We're back in the action. I hope the chat is having a good night. A lot of legends out there tonight. Joey Ingram, Landon Tice, 
Some of the brightest young minds in the game joining us. But the action is not stopping. We have a come to daddy announced. Jesus, I fold. Eric's going to shoot it up, and Berkey is going nowhere with a beautiful queen jack of spades. This could be a chance for him to get some money back from the genius. Berkey checks. He's got a gutter. He's got... T and he's got two over cards. He's not going anywhere. That genius bets 5k with his pocket fives. Berkey calls. The reason they do that. Turn is a complete brick. Right. I mean, like, the fact that all the pros got stacked. <laughs> what a nice. Turn goes check, check. <laughs> Bergie's going to need a bluff to win this pot. He gives up. Check. Genius is going to take it down with the fives. Ooh, yeah. Ship another one his way. Berkey taps the table. Consummate pro, but inside, you know the heat is starting to rise. He's stuck over 125,000. It must be like and just been yeah. sitting yeah. in direct, yeah. close peripheral range to the mad genius um, and his gigantic, never-ending <laughs> tower of chips. I mean, he's got yellows, he's got browns, he's got blacks. He's, it's the same fucking stack. <laughs> his stack represents the diversity that makes America great. Well, you know what? I think somebody needs to edit that one because that, that came off really poorly. But, um, you know, it's late. It's here. It's live TV, Will. There's no editing. I guess you can't edit that, but what I meant to say is Eric has a very beautiful chip stack. That's Double all I meant. Check. I know people can get canceled for less these days, but we're just out here flowing. We don't know what's going to happen. We don't know what we're going to say. No one's not gonna, scripted. No one's going to be mad at you for liking Trump, man. You're, you're good. Yeah, I'm not a big uh, Trump guy, but yeah, I got you covered, I that comment could be perceived as such. Come to mama, I know. You're the one that's trying to increase the blinds. Oh, I love surprises. I had a made hand. Me too. I pulled it aces to you. <laughs> Stradoodle. Uh -oh. The wine is flowing. The spectators are up close, getting a front row seat. The accountant may be making a move here. No, he's back in the game. He's focused on the he's focused on the table. Cute. I know, right? Isn't it? Ballsy. So we have two missing players. A tilted no, no, no. motherfucker. Well, we're, it's perfect the way that it is. <laughs> we got, a, we got somebody a, a that's never returning to a live stream hole. poker ever. Ever again. Likely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ever. Like, ever. Is Hamith ever returning to live stream? Maybe in a few months. We got a guy who said he's going to go back to buying the $40 no limit tournaments. Well, he's going to come back with a short stock. It's like a mindset but, thing. But no, but no, but that fucks everything, right? I see Stu in the chat. I, I'm, I have access to the chat. Stu asks, did I play at Parks tonight? Believe it or not, Stu, I did not. Happy to get in here with the chat. What am I going to do? A million dollars. Straddle. Straddle. We've got a flop here between Yang and Aussie Al. Al's still rocking the hot sauce. Big shout out to JD, the inventor, the original taster, the original brains behind Habo, as far as I believe it. Cabo infused hot sauce. You want vacation? You want spice? Habo is the right hot sauce for you. 
I think we're going to have a pretty small pot here, only $4,800. Not really sure what we can do with that, but probably can get us a few weeks somewhere in a decent hotel. The accountant is all over the place. I think he might be going in for a refill. We got this. Yang is focused, not distracted, deciding if he wants to bluff with the best hand. These guys aren't deterred by the table talk. And Al is going to bluff with it and take it down. Al, getting some chips back, he's had a frustrating night. Probably feels like he could have won at least 100,000 in this lineup. The fact that you're laughing as hard as you were. Oh my god, it was the best. I, I couldn't have asked for more. I would have paid money to see that performance. And to be next to it and experience a lot, it just meant the world to me. I mean, the account's thank just... Thank you, Poker Community. Thank you, the Poker Oscars. It's amazing. He's, he's okay. saying what I've been saying all night. He didn't come here to make money. We're gonna do that shit again, dude. He came for front row seats yeah. to see Helmuth go down in flames. Um, other poker pros we're gonna go after. And who's next? Is, uh, poker app. Yo, there's other poker pros. What big time pros are they gonna come for? Count it. This is just the beginning, dude. Like, wow. Back on the books. For sure. And we're gonna go like eat this shit up, dude. Mad genius. No one is safe <laughs> right now from the genius. And I'll back you too. The cards aren't I'm either. Genius is feeling it. He's going to back the accountant. Accountant declines the, the staking offer, but. Meanwhile, we've got. Somehow these players still have cards. We still have to commentate. Accountant has queen five of spades. He's out. Montana banana. Berkey shoots up Robbie with the pretty 9 10 of hearts on Valentine's Day. Check. Hearts have been broken today. Hopefully everyone's okay in the end, but Berkey outflops Robbie. The heart glasses, not doing it for Robbie tonight. Might have to change up the look. The heart glasses and the coat made of Lorax fur, not the lucky touch that Robbie was looking for on Valentine's Day. She's dominated. She needs a 9 or an 8 to chop. Berkey's going to call. She's going to check. Does Berkey want a little thin slice of value? Does he want a little money back? Is he... He's going to check. Nice hand. She's really run pretty bad tonight, Will. I mean, at most, one off, one off. every hand that's been close. Ran ace-king into kings multiple times. Yeah, she's times. played solidly. She hasn't taken too many chances. She had that one sort of misstep with ace-king, but you can't really blame her for that. And, um, yeah, it just hasn't been her night. Absolutely. But everyone has to agree. A lot of deep, best, deep breaths from Berkey here down the stretch. Every, every time they zoom on it. Solid breath work. <laughs> you know the man's work with the best in the game. <laughs> I could smell that breath work from anywhere. That's Elliot Rowe. Yeah. Oh, Elliot Rowe. Yeah. Elliot Rowe, the best mindset coach out there. You study him? No, I had some time with him before he uh, before he elevated his rates, which deservedly so. You know, he worked for the best in the game. But some, some, some good sessions with Elliot. But did you find it helpful? Super helpful. Okay. Look at you. A lot of people like Tommy Angela. I've never done either. I'm not Zen yet. Yeah, we got to get you on some uh, Zen, some Zen products, you know, yeah. even you out a little supplements. Oh. Yeah. Get some Zen supplements your way. I'm trying to gamble with, with the chance to win. Berkey with a, an, again, the strategy talk that we like to hear. He's trying to gamble with a chance to win. Accountant's doing the same thing, but he's got the worst of it. Robbie's got a back door, but. Not much else going on. She's got those beautiful rings. Alright, I call. I like the horseshoe. She's in there. Berkey's not going anywhere with top pair. Where's the race? Accountant just goading Berkey all night long. Relentless. An interesting turn. Robbie picks up a backdoor flush draw. <laughs> Berkey's still got top pair. Accountant quickly checks back his dust. It's in your fucking bus I promise you. A hundred percent. You have no idea what's going on. Like none, zero. I've got the. You're short stacked. Nuts. You're about to get stacked. Mm -hmm. I like it. Oh, accountant hasn't checked apparently. Go ahead. Right, he he does check now. Talk me into it. Robbie is talking shit about his stack, and Robbie rivers the second nut flush. 
And Berkey's got the nut flush blocker. Check. She checks, but I think this is just going to get checked around. No, Berkey bets. Berkey goes for a super thin slice, half a piece of Wonder Bread of value. Why would I call him babe? He's much more of a babe than he is. Jesus. Like, that's pretty ballsy to call Robbie babe. Why wouldn't I call her babe? And Robbie makes it five. And Berkey really... I, I wonder if he's going to turn this into a bluff because he, he has to know against Robbie tonight he's not good. But he also knows Robbie's got something. Hearts on Valentine's Day. Robbie's got two of them. Berkey only has one, but he's got the biggest heart. And the man does have heart. He's at the table after taking a 100K beatdown from the mad genius. Is he going to sh And he calls. Yes, Robbie. Tits. Yes. Tits. Yes, Robbie. Have we have a tits play. announced. Oh, wow. oh. That was like. And Berkey is not pleased. See if we did it. Check if we did it. The accountant show continues. He's having the time of his life. Front row seats. The man has just hung around all night to witness this absolute manslaughter. Berkey still at the table, but barely receiving any oxygen. While Accountant, Robbie, and Eric Hicks just chirp, I think we're going to see these three in the future. They, there's too much momentum from this game. And I, I really do believe that's it. That's a English bulldog, beautiful creature, pooping on the UK flag, if I had to guess, with a crown on its head. We do have a s super chat, Will. Snow Monkey Never Dies says double over time or else chat riots. We got one minute left. I think... I think we're going to be going a little more. We're one minute. Yeah. Hey, we're still here. I don't want to leave the chat upset. I don't want to see a riot. No stampedes, chat. We'll go as long as we need to. Stay calm in there. Be strong. So what are we doing? What are we Taking photos. And the accountant's going for a selfie. Manages to not spill the hobo. It's been his night. Oh, I'm checking, for sure. He hasn't I won even, I didn't pay money, time. per se. Gonna make but money's not the only form of no, currency no, here. No, for sure. I'm just... Uh, the accountant has won that? a memory that he will never forget, no matter how many glasses of Opus go down. Tonight is a special night for the accountant. He had front row seats to the obituary. Is that... Obituary is what... Yeah, n not the obituary, to the, the live stream death of the great Phil Home Youth. At the hands of the mad genius on live at the bike valentine's day 2023 what a night no matter what happens we're going to try to get connected with eric tonight we're going to try to see what he's doing because when you're running like this and you don't you don't want to stop you know you want to keep it going. You want to ride the heater. You want to strike while the iron's hot. So we're going to see what this man's doing later tonight. We're going to see if the jacket can get us into any situations. All, of course, safe. Good fun. Could be an Opus and Baccarat evening for him. I don't know if he plays, but... Opus and Bach. Always possible. Yeah. You want to trade? Al's having a good time. He's he's been here for the entertainment too. He's played very solid. I'd, I'd rather have his than mine. <laughs> I'd rather have yours. Yeah. Oh. I wasn't in the mindset. Folds around and Eric is not stopping. You see? Two p oh, two dependable. yellow one K chips. Oh, and Yang knows it's coming. I mean, it's pretty easy. A lot of you <laughs> fuckers will race. <laughs> <laughs> Eric's got sevens with a spade draw. I, Yang's got raising, middle pair. Check, check. I'm raising, I only have kings and aces. That's it. <laughs> Two hands. Not true. Not true, right. though. I don't, no? think, I don't think that's true. No? no? I just realized Yang no? hasn't said a word tonight. Not true. It Yang's just, been it, very it, solid. It just, it just hit me. Yeah. He, he said a few words earlier, but he's he's been on the quieter side. His his speaking VPIP has been very low. And Yang bets the river, and Eric raises to 15k. The mad genius is not done yet. He doesn't want this money to go to waste. Yang is in the tank, though. He's got two pair. 
He's up against a crazy man. I think he's he might sniff this out, but it's a really, really good bet from Eric because Yang just doesn't have that much to call with. The chips are stacked. Eric's finally dipped below 600,000. He doesn't like it, so he's going to get those chips back. So wild. No, it didn't. It got, it got better. <laughs> no, I said it came out of the mud. <laughs> Can the race car driver sniff this out? The mad genius speeding around a corner, trying to get to the finish line. He's got a lot of cars too, the mad genius. Already offered Ber Berkey a Ferrari tonight. I hope the mic didn't catch You make it fun, you make it fun, you make it fun. Sticking around, being sticky as fuck with that shit. Yeah, alligator skin. Alligator skin, all right, but you do shed those alligators. Shove the short sacks. Shuttle it to the Yang with another time chip. He doesn't know what to do. Mad genius has got him in the blender. <laughs> just does not know what to do. And that's what great poker players do. They put you in these disgusting spots. Mad genius. Putting my man in the blender. One for the road. This is what he's here for. The money's secondary. He's here to crush. You can tell Yang is completely torn. He's looking. He's going to put it in. Good call. Good call. Great bluff. Really solid night from Yang. He's been... I'm not sure how much he's up, but he has played really well. For a guy who drives race cars, he sure knows his way around the poker table. Being brought down to earth. You count doing some light meditation exercises, trying to keep himself cool. How many time chips you use too? Right? You use two time chips or three? Two. Straddle. Very good, very good. Turkey, oh you're in. At least you thought. <laughs> hey, give me two more. Maybe. No, but at least I know what you think. If you called right away, bad, bad, Race. bad. Ray is 1,000, Straddle from seven, eight, raise 2,000. Hold. 5, Eric is back at it. Al raises the ace 10 off. But you're on your own. <laughs> it's going to get through. Show them nuts. Eric has not been denied tonight. He's under 600,000. He's not feeling great about it. He gets a little chips back there. I know. You guys just want to with the guy that's winning all the pots. Why? He's the best guy to mess with. <laughs> He's running good. So what? <laughs> You're running, he's running it? No. Uh, eh, it don't matter. Well, that guy? I mean, it's like unbelievable. Unreal. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. Call? Thousand. Thousand. Call. What do you mean call? You might put in like another two chips or whatever. <laughs> Come on. The count's still chirping. Right. Yeah, let's go. let's go. He's shooting it up with a 6-4 off. How's defending the 10-5? Street poker at its finest. And the account's got him pipped with a no-look bet. Really underutilized play these days. Looks back at the board. Exactly how Jeez, what are you doing calling me call? That's going to slow the action. Mm, you're in bad shape, though. Counting. Never mind. Another no-look bet. Oh, wait. There's Ashley. Ashley's here. <laughs> you get her. Oh, my God. Did she not see us? She what? Okay, and Al is not folding. He doesn't believe the accountant and his no-look bets. Is that really mine? And Al hits a five on the river. The accountant is in trouble now. He's not going to get Al off this. <sighs> it's a donation directly to Australia. Al's not going to love it, but he's not going to fold. 
accountant's going to talk. <laughs> I get to be. Well, after you throw your cards away. Oh, I thought you meant before. No, no, no. After you got to throw your cards away first. Yeah. 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 Ten seconds. Count's talking a lot. He's trying to get a fold. Oh, raise. A lot. I mean, I only have like 20 grand, so like, yeah. What do you have? What do you think I have? Yeah. I just remembered that we're playing Jack 4, so. 5 7 looks really good. I wish I had 5 7. No, not you, me. Oh, jeez. Accountant is really trying to talk his way out of this one. I thought he was doing All a good right. job till the very end. You can pick. After now he's going to let him pick. Or you can call and you can see both of them. Extreme <laughs> confidence. You raise and then, you know, see what happens. Fuck around and find out. The classic reverse tell. I'll give it to you. Al's going to pay. I have a six. No, you wouldn't. Baby, come on and say really? An accountant Get the with a rare misstep, a rare bluff tonight. <laughs> you asked me. <laughs> oh, you did. We're all buried here. What's, where, what's taking you so goddamn long? <laughs> Berkey with a needle back, he's not going to be denied tonight. Oh, it was a lot of, it was a weird, it was a weird. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, 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 I had 10 9 actually. I wanted to do that my whole life. Nice, not nice. That's why I said 5 7 is no good, and you're like, ah. I'm like, wait a minute, I, I have that. <laughs> Yeah. Six, seven. Like, look, uh, you're uh, under the gun. Get, feel like he was throwing shit. Like, Phil was, like, knocking shit over. Yeah, he went out in dramatic fashion. Mad genius for playing the hey, past like, glories from a few hours ago. In this game, I'd still back, be back in my regular life making money. That's what I said. Whoop. Something like that. No, it was something else. He needled but it was just a, It was just. just a, it was another level of needling. Good. Don't try to trap the three thousand. Big, next time, don't try to try to uh, uh, trap a flop with three thousand big that. blinds. He had pocket. He said something pain. else. No, he said. He said. He said. Don't trap uh, yeah, three thousand big blinds. Wine continues to flow. Yes, that's what he said. That's what he said. He's like, oh, trapping. Yeah, yeah. I did. Check. 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 You know, we always said lessons on Tuesday, but you know what? Today is Tuesday. That's what we say on a Friday or Saturday. <laughs> lessons on Tuesday. I like that. I really use that. I lost a lot. I heard that in Charlestown. Mm -hmm. did you, I tell you, I lost a ton of money this last weekend. Yeah, she was there. I'm not sure what's going on here. Robbie's making a play with Ace Queen. She's gonna take it down. Nice little pot for her. It hasn't been her night at the table, but something tells me she's not too bummed about it. It was not fun at all. I just lost all these 25 feet flips. Mad genius sparkling in the night. This man might hit a dance floor later. I'm not sure what's gonna happen. We're getting a dealer change. I'm going to have to kick it to my man, Yale, because it's time to talk a little bit more about Faded Spade. Let me give his retirement speech tonight. Oh! Mally's Big Bet Poker is proud to feature world-class Faded Spade playing cards. Use code BIGBET gets you 15% off of a two-deck set of the new 3.0 version at FadedSpade.com. Will is up to 12 decks purchased tonight. And we got the leaderboards rolling. Oh, yeah. Eric Hicks up 300,000. Phil Helmuth yeah. down nearly 200k. If you're if you didn't see him and Berkey down over six figs as well. Rough night for him. Rough night for Berkey. Rougher night for Phil. It's continued to be the Mad Genius show. Nine to buy one. I think it's time to quit. Mad Genius this my retirement tonight. announces this might be his last night. Yeah. Yeah, but like, what am I playing for? I already got all the money. Something tells me he might be bluffing. Right? What am I playing? But if he isn't, what a way to go out. <laughs> He's just hunting Phil. Is that the deal? Just hunting Phil. Phil doesn't want to play anymore? Give him this hot sauce as a bonus when we win a pot? Try and explain to him, dude. I got a five. Yes. Trying to get a hot sauce bounty going. No, he didn't. The man is relentless. They didn't, with it. Uh, yes. they, they didn't even bother to put the product on Amazon. Nobody knows where to buy it. Goes, Come on, dude. That's where you buy it. Yeah, I got, we gave him that advice like eight months ago. 
And he goes, oh, yeah, my son, he's going to get his shit together. He's going to go do that. Talking some business, apparently Hoppo has not been listed on Amazon. Put that shit on Amazon so people can buy it. Got to get that out there. Somebody somebody talk to the people there. I don't know if anybody knows Bezos. I know we got some pretty high ups in the chat. Can I double straddle? Sure. Oh, you can certainly double straddle, yeah. Double straddle. The racer is in there. 800 in the pot, dead. He can still pick up a hand, though. The accountant picks up a very pretty queen ten of hearts. He's going to go three ways with the driver and the mad scientist. Check, check, check. Not much here for anybody except the accountant. He's going to bet a thousand. Now Genius is going to look him up. He's not in a folding mood. Yang may peel too with the middle pair. No, he's going to raise. Yang knows exactly where he's at. But is the accountant in a folding mood at this point in the night? That is the question. Does Yang know his man? Shades are on. The bulldog's out to play. Does the accountant want to go with this one? He looks interested. Call. He's going to call, so that's real bad news for Yang. Eric's out of there. Turn as a three doesn't change anything. Yang's got to be really concerned. How'd I get here? He's just going to put it in. There's too much in the pot. And he's got a chance to make the accountant fold. This might work. The all-in shove. The accountant does not want to bust. He's hung around all night. Played so solidly. Does he really want to go this way? Middle pair and a gutter on the turn. He's got no chips left, so it's a quite a conundrum for the accountant. The man with alligator blood. Come on, baby. Have a seat. Have a seat. I think he's asking on, for one of the girls to join him. Maybe, maybe for a little... Constellation and the account is going to lay it down. On, Yang gets it through. Just a genius play. The account would have made a straight on the river. Pure torture. And that is not what he wanted to see. Yang stacks some more yellows, some more purples. And the man has really, outside, it's, he's going to be overshadowed by the mad genius tonight, but the driver has come to race, as they say in. The driver racing industry. You want to do 800? 800 is on seat seven. Is it wrong? You do a round? Let's okay. We got a round of eight. These guys are straddling now. Uh, he, did eight, he did 800. He did eight last, and he's doing eight this day. Uh, 200 more here, please. Back You'll need your mic to have eight poles. You're straddling? The 800 straddle, double straddle is on. Double straddle announced. Okay, uh, scan your hand, please. Scan your hand here, please. And did she just call? She is calling. Yeah, fold. Seat one fold, did you scan your hand? I think I did. I, I can do it again. Four folds, okay, we're going to Thank you. Right, seat four folds as well. And options. Seat seven. Right. Go ahead. Ooh, yeah. Who else is? Both players have a piece. Top pair for the accountant. Gut shot for Robbie. Seat seven, 400. Uh, they got us a, a private room in the restaurant here. Seat nine raised to 3,000. Call. Robbie's getting in there. She's raised. Accountant going nowhere. And Robbie gets home, finally. Wow. And Robbie is going to finish off the accountant here. Opus I'm doing a Keating's trick. I'm buying everybody Opus. And Robbie folds. That must be a misprint on the... Okay. Buy everybody Opus. Got there. I go, I'm bragging about how Wait. generous he was. Uh, you only did that. Nice hand. Losing. I'm not sure what's going on, Yale. It's a fucking it's, short stack out of yeah. the fucking pot. We got 400 in I had you it's 9, 17 had Pacific you time, which means it's <laughs> over midnight back home for me. I don't know what just happened there, but the accountant stays alive once again. The story is old as time. 
The accountant just hanging around. He's not going anywhere. He came to see the show tonight, and the show's not over, so that means the accountant is still with us in the building. The mad genius is here. Yang is here. The man has raced Formula One cars. He's driven NASCAR. He's driven spaceships. He bluffs like a maniac. He plays solid. He's put on a show tonight. Hi, uh, baby. I won back all the money. We can go buy the Vegas condo. Eric's talking about a Vegas condo. He wants to keep playing. He wants to play bigger. He said he's going to retire, but this man wants more blood. This is just a small, a small drop in the bucket for the man who invented the Luna cycle. Yeah. The count chips up again, small pot, oh, but he's back up to 14k. And the celebration continues for Eric. More pounds. I'm straddling now. Give me a monster. You been with him? That's where he went. He went to Houston's office. That's hilarious. Yeah, he's having a rough weekend, dude. He's tired. He's, he's been oh, Phil? Hey, you know, everybody needs an excuse. <laughs> Phil needling does not stop. Double straddles on. Listen, I need a loyalty fee for sticking my ass on this chair after a bad beat and a fucking all in. I just, it's not. I've lost everything, but I'm not fucking tilting and flipping the fuck out and leaving the game that we're hosting. Holy shit. The fuck is this guy? How much is that? What is the value that makes men run out of a uh, huge crime? I mean, <laughs> you just broke the internet with that hand. I can't even. And then after that, like, I don't know. Let's play all night. <sighs> Woo! <sighs> what a night, what a night. Robbie wants to go all night. She's stuck a 50 ball still, but she's had a good time tonight. She's gotten her laughs in. She's gotten her needles in. And Yang and Eric are going at it. The two big winners in the game. The two crushers tonight. Yang is going to call with bottom pair. And Eric needs a gutter, and it comes in on the river. Does bring a diamond. Genius can barely even peel his hand, but he knows it's time for value. And he bets 25, and I think that's a little too much. Yang has liked to hero, but this is just this is just too many. I think Genius got a little bit greedy thinking about his face on the twenty-five thousand dollar chip. But at the same time, can you blame the man the way his night's gone? <laughs> he lets Yang know he doesn't need to hide that info. This isn't a high roller. This isn't an EPT. This is live at the bike, where they play fast, they throw chips in the middle, and you really don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> Super impressed with the play tonight from some of these guys. I have never gotten to watch Eric play, and I've definitely never gotten to watch Yang play. And they've both been awesome tonight, really fun to watch. Good at the game, but also good for the game. It's like 800. Oh, God. Right. Cool. I think so. Right? Yep. Pull up. Eric can pull up. Two and four. Eric is almost back to 600,000. <laughs> the accountant's in there with ace five. Check. Check. Really Aussie hard. Al is going to check it. Now. No, he's going to fold. I'm not really sure what's going on. It doesn't matter. No, Matt got me these when I was at the village, at the Palisades Village, because like we were looking for sunglasses, and he ran into the store and got the heart ones. Who did? I checked. Check. Weezy. Check. You said Matt. Yeah, Matt Weezy. Not this Matt. No. Check. There's a lot of Matt. Check. Check. Well. And those look just not like the Cartier. Cartier. Thank you. They are. Ones just like yeah. Do you see those? Yeah. We almost bought them. They were two thousand bucks. We're gonna get yours instead. Said, uh, two chips. Uh oh, fold it. You should fold it. <laughs> they are Cartier. Yeah, We're having a little glasses talk. Wear our glasses. 
2002, what, what, what two yellow say? chips. No idea. Okay. Apparently we'll get you the, I believe, Robbie's glasses. We'll Anybody's video. looking on Valentine's Day for a couple of hearts yeah, the, um, to put over your face. Filming. Shield yourself from the sun. Be safe. I would never wear these because they're not. Berkey really? does not wear glasses. He comes prepared. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm and Robbie just has some beautiful count. rings. <laughs> I can't count, so a couple of gold ones on the right hand. A horseshoe. Looks like a 87 Eagles championship ring on the left hand, but I'm not quite sure. And the game continues. Bally's live at the bike. We're here. It's getting late on the East Coast, but it's still really early on the West Coast. They'll do a lot of stuff tonight. Valentine's Day. It's been a bloodbath. And uh, Helmuth, who's sitting at this table, God knows how many hours ago, is now home in Palo Alto, hanging out with the guys from the All In podcast. He's having a cool down with his boys, Chamath and Jason something or other. He's going to be back. He's going to make some good investments. He's going to play solid. You know he's going to be ready for the World Series. He'll probably be ready to go in a week. But uh, tonight is the night of the mad genius here at Live at the Bike. Bally's Big Bet Poker. It has been Big Bet Poker. There has been a lot of bloodshed. And who knows how long it's going to go at this rate. The fuel is opus. The time is 930. The temperature is a brisk 49 degrees Fahrenheit. And I'm happy to be here. This is a lot better than Delaware. No offense to anybody from that area. I don't know what happened here, but Robbie is going to go for a thin slice. She bets just enough, just small enough, that I think Yang is going to pay here. Robbie's grinding. She's hung around all night. She wants to get some money back. She'll be a little ways closer to even if Yang pays her off here, and I don't know what Yang's going to do. He's got a decent hand. He's getting a really good price. Can we get another bottle of Opus one, please? And there it is, another order of Opus uh, announced. Who wants glasses for wine? We've got enough glasses already. Uh, okay. Um, can I get uh, two bottles of Salvino or Perrier or something? Awesome. Um, do you want anything? I'm okay. All right, Eric, are you good? I'm good with the old fish. And Robbie gets the payoff here. Really nice size on the river. And Robbie's back up to sixty-four thousand. That was a really big pot for her. Go! Oh. She has not gotten anything going tonight. But she's creeping closer to even, and considering what she's accomplished tonight by setting up this game, creating the place to watch the destruction of Helmuth, she's got to be feeling really good about where she's at. A nice stack of 1Ks, enough to buy most people a decent car. In this game, just a 5 bet. I'm not that sticky, by the way. You're sticky as fuck. That's what she said. <laughs> oh. An accountant staying strong after all these hours with another that's what she said. Oh, you didn't see either one? <laughs> the man has hung around. He's talked. He's drank. He's played. He's really done everything. And I got to say, people, you know, give you shit for playing oh, a short stack. Is that? I don't think I've ever seen somebody play a short stack yeah, better than the accountant. Truthfully, it's been a work of art. Okay. Anything to stay in the game? Something? Anything. I don't want to play poker anymore. I have a king. What's the point? I don't even know what I have. Check. Sorry. Accountant is going to bet with his flush draw. Robbie's going to call. Just the two of us. You and I. And Accountant picks up some more outs, but he's going to check. And Robbie lets him get there to the river. He could bluff now. He's going to give up. I have an ace. And Robbie's going to take it down. Oh. Inches a little way closer to even. <laughs> She's only down about 33,000. Got to be feeling good on the comeback trail. <laughs> I had two cards. <laughs> you weren't folding uh, every day? No, I wasn't folding. Not to that stack. <laughs> Not to that sticky you guys ass. You here every day, right? Huh? What? Is this game going every day? No, every day. it doesn't go every day. Eric wants to know if the game's the going every day. It has to go into like going every day. Can't blame him for asking. Respect for the effort putting a game together like this. 
taking some pictures. The bright lights are flashing. We're in L.A. Big movie premiere. We just had the Oscars. No, was it the Grammys? Any surprises there for you, Yale? It's a call. I didn't pay all that much attention to it. Not I really. Call. Yeah. I guess uh, I think Harry Styles won the big one. I don't really listen to him. Harry you? Styles won the big one. Oh, Good looking go. dude. Good looking dude. 35. Actor, multi-talented. Something tells me if we hang with the Mad Genius tonight, we might run into someone like that. We might have to go to like Craig's or something. Maybe that's the play. Cool. C&B scene spot. I don't know Craig's, but I'm going wherever the Mad Genius goes. He's got the jacket on. He's got the glow. Appreciate it. And Robbie looks like she's making a play here with pocket fours. Starting to catch some momentum. Not exactly sure what is going on, but somehow the pot just attracts to the mad genius again. He's got a complete magnet under his stack. You're not your lady. You already have her. He's back to almost six hundred thousand dollars. That shows how good the hand was. If I was going to do something crazy, I could look. Watch this. Watch this. But I, I don't want to show her because I don't want to go. Oh, you got that hand? That's one of the big hands. Oh uh, yeah! Come on, baby. Do you play poker? Money. Like, I don't trust She has no idea anyway, so. That's how you tell, right? If I show her the hand, it's not that good. Like, yeah, the same shit works when you're watching her person play. The second he shows the hand, it's not that good. Mad genius with some more poker strategy at the table, but again, this is not the type we mind. They're not talking about ranges or three betting. They're talking about metagame. He's talking about showing the hands to his lady that's sweating him. This is the stuff that's interesting about live poker. The little dynamics, the ebbs and flows of a live game. Everybody's playing. We got people that are Barry here. We got people that are up huge. We got people like the accountant that are just grinding it out. Just really solid <laughs> night. He's in there again with 6-5. Eric's got a mystery hand. Berkey's got ace king of spades and just wondering, what do I got to do to hit a goddamn flop around this place? He's going to call, though. The accountant bet's real small. Berkey might even put in a raise here. He's had enough. Okay. He's going to appeal, but Eric with ace-jack. Of course he has ace-jack. Top pair, top kicker. He's going to shoot it up, and this party's going to end real quickly. 15K right in the middle, just three chips, but it's going to be enough to take this down. Don't think accountant wants to get sticky here. He's waited way too long tonight. He's hung around. He knows his, he knows his customers. Eric's got the goods. Oh, man. Account's going to use a time chip. And Eric's going to take an opportunity to sip the rest of that Opus glass. We're going to need to get a refill. He's out. Berkey's got no choice. He's not happy. He's upset with the accountant. It cost him a turn with that beautiful hand. And Eric scoops another one. Back over $600,000. Ace King of Spades. Yeah. Ace King of Spades. Wow. Beautiful three bedroom home, complete with a pool, off the strip in Vegas, sitting right in front of him on the table. I shouldn't bet so big. Yang, second place, but over $420,000 behind him. I just wanted him to like think, oh man, he bet so big, he must not have it. And I thought like Berkey did. How can you lead him full? Can you choose? Yeah, please. You see the VPIPs. You see the total damage. Helmuth, the big loser tonight, 193,000. Berkey, second place, 128,000. Aussie Al down a 50 ball. Robbie's only down 36 now. The accountant is down 16. But he's not a loser tonight. And we got Yang and JD as nice winners. That looks like it's it for us tonight. Yale, this has been an absolute pleasure. Even though you weren't named after the school, you were still somewhat bright tonight. And I think we both got a good sweat in. And just I want to give a big congratulations to the mad genius and everybody else out there. Have a great Valentine's Day night. From Dankness 3, Will Jaffe, and Yale Greenfield, Live Poker King to you. Live at the bike, Valentine's Day special. Good night. <laughs>